We are back. We're back. We're back. We're back. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us and sticking around through the BRB yeah. screen. Seriously, I know that um, it can be a little boring sometimes when us when we've got to go to a BRB. I hope you enjoy the clips that we play for you and do know that we do appreciate you sticking around and coming uh, through and hanging out while we need to take our, our breaks. Uh, we've got our episode one of the Loose Sack coming up with Trap here in six minutes. Um, I am going to have to run ads. So don't worry if you still need to get a couple things done. If you're not quite, your, your popcorn's not done popping or your tea ain't quite ready, quirky chick, don't worry. All right. I'm going to run ads now. Uh, content is happening at 10 o'clock. So on the hour, wherever you are at, when, it, when we get back to the double zero, that's when shit's hitting the fan. All right. I'm going to run the ads right now, you guys. Um, there's my ad button. I moved it. I mean, I hope shit doesn't hit the fan. Like, it sounds... No, like, it's gonna. No, I don't... I don't... I don't it's gonna. It. It's not... No. Okay. It's gonna be good shit, though, right? This like, shit has nuts in it. Okay. All right. That doesn't answer my question. <laughs> it does not answer my question. <laughs> not even a little bit, actually. Rick and huh. Morty reference. Get smoked, chat. Yeah. That's not a Rick and Morty reference. Yeah, and is remember it's from the the cable interdimensional cable thing where there's one of the shows is the the it, dude eating shit out of the bowl, and then oh he says this shit is delicious. Is that what he says? I thought he said it has nuts in it. No, that's a Ryan Reynolds quote from is it? Uh, Deadpool. Is it from I Deadpool? Think. Oh, yeah. I'm getting my wires crossed, yeah. chat. I'm getting my wires crossed. But it's definitely Ryan Reynolds who says it, <laughs> and I want to say it's a Deadpool. It's got to be Deadpool. If it's either it's, that or it's like shenanigans, or uh, uh, sorry, waiting. Like. Oh, maybe it is from waiting. It could be from waiting. This shit has nuts in it. Yeah, I can't remember. It's Ryan Reynolds, though. I see his face. <laughs> You're right. Now that I say it. Oh see, this is why we keep Katie around, chat. <laughs> yeah, that's that's all I'm good for, chat. To half remember things about TV shows. And movies. <laughs> <laughs> half remember. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Over here remembering some super obscure shit from white chicks. All right. <laughs> And I get shit thrown my way. I have approximate way. knowledge of many things. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I do. All right, Charlie, Your name is Frank. <laughs> Close. 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 I love that. I have approximate knowledge of many things. <laughs> Adventure time reference chat. <laughs> Welcome to the the brain of of Katie and Zane melded together. Yeah. Um, in the way that only an ADHD power couple can manage. Yes. Welcome to <laughs> uh, 12 years of being together um, melded into a love language that is simply throwing pop culture references back at each other that we both find very amusing. And lo and largely just confusing to anybody that witnesses yeah. what's happening. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So prime example, you guys. Okay. We're listening to a song. The song has been stuck in my head. Okay for like a week now. We're listening to it. And one of the lines of the song is, baby, you're like lightning in a bottle. <laughs> and we're in the middle of the song. I'm singing it. We're vibing. It's like carry carpool karaoke, right? And in the middle of the song, he just goes, I, I got, got that. that. <laughs> and kills which her. Is, which is <laughs> just destroys her. Absolutely murders me. <laughs> I'm like full into carpool karaoke mode, like fucking vibing it, dude. Like yeah. hitting the key just right. All of a sudden, I'm dead. I'm fucking <laughs> laughing my ass off. And if yes. you guys don't know where that's from, it's a super obscure Key and Peele reference from yep. one of their skits where Jordan Peele is playing. Um, God, what They're just like making character? up ideas in like their um, Levi though. He, yeah. No, he has a name. I'm pretty yeah. sure it's Levi. Yeah, but they're like in their apartment trying to come up with like ideas for an app yeah. or something. And then uh, he's I was like, that's like lightning in a bottle. And he's like, I got that. And he pulls it out. And it's a he's it's a mason a jar. It has lightning <laughs> in it. Right. <laughs> and he just goes blip blip. <laughs> I got that. He goes blip and he opens it and it fucking <laughs> starts shooting all shoot over the, the room. Like, we might actually have to watch that clip um, at some Maybe. point. Not but on this stream, just though. Like, yeah, not on this one. <laughs> um, but just a really prime example of how that works, dude. Just All right. in the middle of it. Chat, we're about to jump right. in with Trap here. <laughs> if you guys... Um, welcome. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I'm going to stop the in. music. We're going to focus on what we're doing here now, chat. Everybody that's coming in, um, thank you so much for joining us for day one. 
This is, yes. uh, as some of you heard us mention earlier on in the stream and on the previous streams and stuff, and maybe even in our announcements or whatever, or those of you that we've talked to individually about this project, um, we've been thinking about doing it for quite some time. Yeah, it's, it's a long time in the making this one. Mm -hmm. So very, very excited to finally very get excited. this uh, off the ground. Right? And to share it with you guys. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think it's going to grow and change as we do it. I'm sure that what we have in our heads maybe isn't uh, perfect or what you guys want to see all the time or whatever. And I, we want to hear feedback from you guys. We definitely want to know what you guys think. Um, either way, I really hope that you guys have fun and enjoy it. We're going to really enjoy doing it with you. At the end of the day, I hope this gives all of us an opportunity to meet some of the creators that we all love to watch um, and that Katie and I love to play with, um, give you, you and us an opportunity to meet them on a deeper level and understand kind of more about what, the, what they are doing, why they do it, what they love about it, um, any future stuff that they maybe want to work on. And, and hopefully this is a way for us to kind of share the platform that we've built with you guys, with other creators, um, and, and merge communities together. You know, one of the things that we love doing here is the charity stuff that we love to do. And the best way to raise charity is to have as many people involved as possible. Um, and we're hoping that this provides an opportunity for not only you guys as viewers to connect with other creators in a way that maybe you haven't been able to before, but also give us a way for us to help those creators grow and, gener and you know, um, reach new heights, hopefully, and us alongside them. So... Hope you guys enjoy this. We're going to hop in with Trap now, and we're going to switch over to the screen. Let me pull him up on the chat. You ready, Katie? Yeah, let's get started. Let's do it. I'm so excited. Let's do it. Yo, Trap, brother. What's Yo. up? What is up? How's it going, buddy? Big chilling, big chilling. I'm going to switch over to this scene here. Started. Get you on the big screen. Heck yeah, dude. Guest starring Steve. Oh, yes. Hi, buddy. The, the goodest of boys. Chat and, and YouTube, this is Steve, our dog. He's a good boy. He is very confused as to why um, we're extra super motivated so late in the stream. Normally, it's it's very chill right now. What are you doing, dude? He's like, what's going on? He's, exci he's excited. He just wants to be a part of the energy. We're just going to give Trap a minute here, and we'll get right, started. I'm prepping my family. No, no, no you're worries. good. You're good. You are all good. Let us know when you're ready, buddy. We've got you up on the big screen so everybody can see you. Just make a bunch of obscene gestures to your family. That's that's great. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, let him have it. Let him have it. My teenager's like poking his head over here like, oh, you're, oh, you're doing it with the, with them? Because he's seen you guys up. I had your you know, stream up anytime. <laughs> mostly, so he, my kids know you. Oh, that's cool. That's, that's humbling. Dope. That gives me weird sweats for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is that? Wait, Trap's kids know us? Okay, wait. The, Right? Like, pull, it, pull the plug. Pull the plug. We're done. No, we yeah, can't pull, do this anymore. Pull the ripcord, <laughs> dude. I'm done. I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah, so I'm ready whenever y'all are. Hell yeah. Heck let's yeah. do it, man. Well, yeah, we'll just uh, we'll kind of jump right the in. The camera looks yeah. like shit because you guys don't get the green screen effect on your side. because of the We get OBS a little bit of it. Up, we get a little bit of it. It's like fish-eyed. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. It looks like you're just talking to us from like a portal, like you're some sort of dark wizard. Yeah, dude. Traps quiet. Cool. Yeah, you're yeah just that's like true. True. In okay. space right now. Well, and I got to turn you up. Everybody says you're a little quiet. Can you chat for me one more quiet. time, Trap? Yeah, 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 of course. Is that better, you guys? I don't know. Do they need me to yell? No, no, no. Nah, just talk at your good. normal. Okay. I think I just need to boost comms. Like normally, I have it a little lowered so that it's not overpowering when we're playing. But you know, the whole point is to talk to you. So I just need to bring you back up. Yep. So. That's good. All right. Uh, I think we should do a small little intro, and then we'll kind of just get started. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, I think we kind of did before we brought in a trap, and then we just kind of... You want to... More so like a... Yeah. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Yeah. yeah let's yeah, do it. Yeah. Go. Uh, sorry. Okay. Yeah. Hit sorry. it. <laughs> very rough rough draft, you guys. So uh, welcome, everybody, in. Um, this is our very first episode of uh, the Shooty Loots. The Loot Sack. The Loot Sack Our standard challenge. account challenge, yeah. Yeah, you guys are very, very excited to get this underway. Um, today we have with us Trap HD. Um, he's been a content creator for quite a while now. He, it was, you know, on the scene before we got here, and uh, we're very, very excited to talk to him. Kind of one of our big OG supporters, too. I mean, Trap found us yeah. when we were we were super, super small, um, and we've met a lot of you guys through his community, so we're really excited to have an opportunity to chat with him, learn a little bit more about him, and then um, send him loose and watch what he can do. Yeah, yeah, just genuinely one of the homies. Uh, so without further ado, uh, Trap, do you want to introduce yourself? Tell us a little bit about you, how, how long you've been streaming, things like that. Yeah, yeah. So I've been streaming for, I just literally just looked at this stat like two days ago, so oddly enough. I've been streaming for Hell three yeah. years, roughly. Um, 
I usually take holidays off of stream because I've got three wife and three kids. Um, so we're either traveling or doing something for the holidays. So mm -hmm. okay. Outside right. of that, three years. You know, um, I've been in the army for twelve years, so that's that's a big part of the culture on my side of Twitch, I guess, because deal with a lot of veteran stuff, hang out with a lot of veterans, yeah. surround myself with that stuff, give advice and whatnot. Nice. There we go. Yeah, it was That's actually, cool. it's one of the things that, um, you know, I, I tend to bring up even when I just mention your name, like, in yeah. passing, but something I wanted to talk about while we're here, you know, it's kind of your sort of uh, project, so to speak, right? The Black Flag Nation. Right, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Black Flag Nation started as a, uh, just a strict Tarkov community. It was me and a handful of my buddies that uh, we were a part of, like, an OG. This is 2016, mind you, when this all started. Uh, as part of a, a different Discord, and, you know, they were moving towards a different route. Mm -hmm. um, they weren't. We just we, we were older group. We didn't want to be, you know, around at the time, like, what we considered to be immature people. Uh, sure. And we, were, we established, like, the set of rules that I think most Tarkov players actually, like, abide by now. Not that we started it, but it's just kind of funny how everybody kind of does the same thing. Like, you know, when the homies die, you ditch their stuff. Right. You know, and you don't. But you, what, you, what you kill is yours and whatnot, so things of that nature. Yeah, yeah. We what we would started the Go ahead. Oh, I was just gonna say what we would consider Tarkov etiquette. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Right. We started Black Flag. I think what was it back then? It was Black Flag Gaming. I think so. Just us. Yeah, when we I first started streaming, and then it turned into what it is now. Was that you and Luau, or who else was the the other? No, half of that? actually, these are a bunch of guys you y'all probably have never seen before. Um... They've they've been around my channel a little bit. They're not too much around Twitch and the Discord anymore, but they right. they kind of do their own thing now. But now it is mostly like me, Graham, Lou Alboy, uh, who you know you guys have seen around a lot of. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh yeah, some of the homies for sure. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's one of the things that, you know, whenever we meet a new, uh, we get a new member in the community, they mention that they're either active duty or veteran, you know, we always try to funnel yeah. in your way as well, because yeah. we just, I really like the community that you've created over there, and um, for us too, I mean, you know, when we were up and coming, when we first met you, you know, the, your community was a big part of, like, the support and, and love that we got, you know, that helped us realize I that mean, this is something that was even part. doable, you know, right? you've created I... a really amazing group of people that you've got over there. I... Okay, I remember very specifically why, like, I was like, I grew so attached to you, you guys so quickly. Official Ghost and Shorty were, were du dual streaming, and they were having a lot of audio issues and stepping on each other. And I was like, I stumbled across you guys, and I was like, oh, hell no. I love <laughs> this. And I was like, I got to get Marcus over here, which is, that's Ghost. His name is yeah, yeah, Ghost. Oh, yeah, we uh, love I Ghost. Got, I put Marcus on you guys as quick as I could. I was like, dude, like, communicate with them. They've got to figure yeah. out. He was asking me for audio help, and I was like, I don't, I'm not there with you, so it's hard to help you. Sure. Yeah. It yeah. can be tough. It can be tough. That, that part well, is really I mean, hard. now you know you run the 2P setup. You know how much of a pain in the ass it can be. Oh, yeah. This is yeah. a... Yeah. Uh, that's, I think that's one of our, our most asked questions on our channel, is how do you guys have your audio set up so that you're not yeah. stepping on each other? Yeah, like, yeah. Um, it's definitely one of the things that people are, uh, you know, alerted by by our channel is that we've got the dual setup. That's uh, funny. It's that like, such a way that it, it doesn't... It's like, it, it, like it, it brings us friends, right? You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? Uh, I think it's, that's awesome, right? That that was the thing that, that brought you, you in. You're like, oh, I really like this setup, and they managed to figure out the audio struggles because we've, we've honestly had so many people come in and say the same thing. Um, yep. that, that's that's kind of awesome. Well, I want to refocus because I don't want to talk too much about us. I mean, the goal is here to, to ch oh, chat no, no, about you, right? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so talk to us about Tarkov, right? Um, I think you've been playing Tarkov longer than you've been streaming it, right? You want to yeah, talk to yeah, us a little bit about like kind of how you're... Large majority. Yeah, so you... I was playing Tarkov back in 2016 when you had to buy EOD to even play the game. Oh, wow. I didn't know that um, was even a thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. It was super... So, like, a lot of games do that. Um, like, I think right now, PAX Days do... No, not PAX some of the big MMOs are doing that right now. That and you got to do the supporter well, package, right, in order to yeah. We're, we, yeah. But now, like some of these cha these games are charging like four hundred dollars. Yeah, really their stuff. Wow, um, that's insane. But yeah, I started off. I I got into PC gaming, which is around the same time I got into Tarkov. Like a month later, uh, the game that got got it all started was PUBG. Actually, it was before it was on console, before it was on all these other things. It was just coming out, and a handful of streamers were playing it. I was like, I got to play this. How do I do? Yeah. It? Uh, and that's what got you started PUBG in PC PUBG. gaming. Yeah, so I bought a gaming laptop and I was like, I want to play PUBG. <laughs> okay, I, I, yeah. across the, 
I stumbled across a Tarkov video. And I was like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. This is awesome. Uh, and that was back when there was only two armors. It was Ford armor and Pekka armor. Uh, there was only like one helmet. It was the Kiver helmet. And there was one map. Factory. It was just factory, right? Yeah. yeah. And then customs came and then woods came and then so on and so forth. And they started expanding maps. Yeah. Not. Right. Yeah. I mean, like you could instantly heal, you could instantly load mags, you could put whatever you wanted in whatever container and all this other stuff. So, oh, wow. Yeah. I remember people I'm used to, to like, it, people used to bind their heels to the same button that was shoot and you yep. could shoot and heal at the same time. Oh, yep. whoa. Yeah. And you could like yep. multi bind, you could have multiple heels bound. So people would load in and like killing people, you had to work through all the heels they had because while they're shooting, they're also healing because there was no animation. That like, sounds like, like a completely different game. You know, it's before like, a lot of the systems existed that we're yeah. used to, right? I mean, yep. in complete honesty, that is a completely different game, right? It's, there's mm -hmm. different metas. There's different everything. When you, if that's yeah, you used play. to be able to put loaded mags in your butt, right? Yeah, I've heard yep. that you before. You used to be able to put a magazine case in your butt full of loaded mags. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow, that takes that the metaphor like a little far. That was like when Labs first came out. <laughs> yeah, that's so silly. Yeah, and I, I remember you used to be able to find, like, I've seen videos of it, right, just before I started playing, but you find, like, a, a thick case in a marked room, and then you put it in your yeah, bag, and then yeah. you just stuff the whole map into your bag, basically. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, and that was back, like, when the rich, rich, like, that's, like, the wipe. I, I was probably around two or 300 million rubles or what. No, it was 155. I, I think I peaked at 160. Uh, and I would just buy weapons cases and carry them on the labs with me, and stuff it full of guns, and come out and sell it. Right. That's right. insane. Yeah. <laughs> you know, That's you, like, insane. Kill a juicer. You kill a juicer yeah. and like, oh, he had an items case in his bag, you know? Yeah. Oh, shit. shit. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. Yeah, you don't get that kind of come up anymore, right? Yeah, I, like, I mean, I started playing in 2022. Two? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Def definitely, you know, long after a lot of the, the systems that we now know as Tarkov have been, were put into place. Um, and so that's that's kind of mind blowing for the, a new player to hear something like that. Uh, so I guess so I want to know, did did Black Flag Gaming, you know, Black Flag Nation, was that before you started streaming? Yeah. yeah. OK. What kind of prompted oh, wow. you to okay. start streaming yeah. then? Can you talk about that? Oh, my son, my son actually started like pushed me into streaming. So I streamed for about a month back in 2018. Just to see what it was like, see, like, I'm just curious, like, could I do this with my current setup? And it wasn't good. It wasn't working. The resolution sure. was shit. Right. Because um, I didn't have a very expensive computer. I think I had a 1060 or something like that. Um, and then when we got here to where we're at now in Washington State, and I was in a different, very different capacity. So back then, I was active duty, airborne infantry guy. Like, my work consumed me, right? Mm -hmm. The only time I could fucking stream and game was, like, after 8 o'clock and kids are asleep. Right. Yeah, yeah, you got to do the yeah, dad super, stuff. Super you got to, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I also wasn't getting home until like 6 p.m. Sure. Um, mm -hmm. But now I'm in recruiting. Find you, I hate this job. This is the worst job in the world. Uh, but <laughs> my son, I was like, I started getting into nice setup and whatnot. And then my son was like, Dad, why don't you just stream? Like, you're really good at Call of Duty and Tarkov and all these, all these other shooter games. I think people would love to watch that. And this is my 14-year-old. I think he was 12, right. 11 or 12 at the time. I was like, I'll give it a shot. Yeah. And then that's when I found reconnected with Marcus, who him and I, we served in the Q course together. We were both trying to be Green Berets back in the day. That's where we met. I mm -hmm. uh, was in Airborne School, and then we went to selection together and all this other stuff. Tried wow. to be medical, like Special Force medical sergeants and stuff like that. Uh, and just you guys go stayed way in back. contact. Oh, yeah, yeah. This was 2014. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's some intense, then, intense bonding, like just oh, like going through those types of programs. Yeah, it's it's programs tough, right? Yeah, yeah. I can't even pretend to yep. understand. And then he's, he was sitting around, like he, he was a partner on Twitch already and all this other stuff. And he found out I started streaming and like him and his community, which turned into a lot of the people who are, who made me an affiliate to begin with and supported me in the beginning. And turned into what it that's amazing. Yeah, no, I'd love to hear that. Yeah, yep. that's, yep. that's cool. That's cool. So that's where I fell into, like, anytime I meet somebody who is a good person and they're starting off streaming, it's like, yeah, we got to do an affiliate. That's yeah. one, of, one of the things that we that's started doing because of you, too. Yeah, yeah. It's like, you know, let's, yeah, let's help support everybody, right? We all, you know, one of the things that Katie always says that I love is that, you know, rising tides raise all ships, right? Yep. <clears throat> it's it's True. not about me versus you. You know, we're all in this. We can, we can be in this together. We can work yeah. together to... Um, to grow our communities, meet amazing people, and, and, you know, make a slice of the internet that's not so shitty, right? That's always been my goal. I, uh, 
there's a lot of shitty places on the internet. And so when I when I come across places that are actively uh not doing that right just just being a very you know genuine and, and good place to be and positive place to be it's it's definitely some place that uh calls to me and your community definitely did that in the beginning i mean you were a big part of uh, our affiliate push for that matter like you know we uh, got it yeah yep you know, we i won. mean well just so, part of, yeah and, part. and all and a lot of that is is due to to you and and your kindness um and just kind of the the vibe that you put off so i'm uh, very very much appreciative of that um you know, just kind of more so talking about Tarkov, right, is, that, you know, the game has changed so much from when you first started playing it to what you're playing it now. You know, is this wipe captivating you? Is there something that's still bringing you back to Tarkov right now? Or are you kind of in the lull of, you know, what else is out there? Uh, No, so I was actually pretty over Tarkov last wipe. Um, They were, you know... I've I've complained about streamers affecting Tarkov for years. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And there's a handful of streamers that I've I've never really like been a part of. I won't drop names, obviously, like because that's not good for you guys. Sure, um, but I get what you're saying. Like having one or two people have too much influence in the direction of the game. Yeah, right. Absolutely. Regardless of who they are, like, right? We, yep. That's just not something that's yep. uh, beneficial to the game. Yep. Yep. Um, and I didn't like. I, I'm first of all. I, I used to complain a lot about wipes. I hated wipes, but at the same time, I understand the need for it because eventually the game would just die, right? Mm -hmm. Um. So I've gotten over that. Uh. But they, all the changes, like it was steadily making the game, like the random recoil thing and stuff like that. When that first started coming around, I started to lose more and more interest in the game because right. This is supposed to be like a hardcore sim, like where and me being an army guy, especially infantry guy, like. Having my, experience with wherever guns. Wherever that barrel is right. aimed at, that is where that round is going. Right? right. So, like, when you start implementing random recoil and stuff like that, where you have flyers. And yeah, the like crazy that, MOA you know, and stuff yeah. that's, like, a little yeah, 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 outside yeah. the realms of reality, right? So, when they brought back, rec like, the recoils back to what it used to be several this years wipe. ago, I'm just like, oh, man, this feels good. Mm -hmm. And I'm also just, there's there was enough new content with this wipe where I was like, yeah, I got to go back and check it out. Because I, I took... I didn't play when Streets first came out. I played a little bit last wipe, which I played a little, quite a bit of that with you, Zane. When, yeah. Because you taught me Streets. Mm -hmm. um, and Lightkeeper. So I, when Lightkeeper came around, I like that was I was I didn't play that wipe hardly at all, and I didn't play Streets wipe hardly at all. But now we're back. Now I'm, I want to chase this content. And on my main yeah. account, I already got Kappa. I'm chasing Lightkeeper. I'm like two quests away from going out and meeting him with the uh, radio transmitter thing. So hell yeah! Oh, wow. And if I, I remember that, correctly, did you start day one? Uh, yeah, wipe? so I was, yeah, I was recovering from a surgery. That's what I thought. And I was on vacation, so, so the wipe team, and then we're here. Were you, were you expecting, like, leading up to the wipe that you were going to hit it hard? Or were you still kind of skeptical coming in that, you know, I haven't been really enjoying it, I'm just going to have the time, so I'm going to hop in? Like, what was it kind of like when, like, this wipe? Because you're not the first person that I've talked to that has played for a long time, took a little bit of time off, and then this wipe yeah. has kind of, like, pulled them back in. So I'm just kind of curious, like, what were, what was your thought process like leading up to actual wipe day oh um, uh, well arena arena mostly was my thought process that's true yeah we were hitting that hard years. you and i were playing that like crazy yeah yeah, yeah so i've i chased down that i grinded out that one uh tree of whatever fucking assault right. or whatever um and i was enjoying the shit out of that and i was like man yeah i mean I, I might play a little bit of tarkov and then when i saw the changes that were being made and mm -hmm. they're bringing vault in and all this stuff I was like, yeah i gotta play i gotta check yeah out, so Long time supporter, right? Got the alpha arm band. Alpha arm bang. Yeah, check out the new stuff, right? <clears throat> yeah, dude. So then yeah. it pulled you. In. What? Um, do you think were you in right away? Like as soon as you started shooting the guns and stuff, you're like, oh, this feels great. Um, uh, like, so ground zero. Bringing an M4. Yeah, on there day one like, opinion on to, ground zero, right? <laughs> being able to laser people with an M4 with no attachments on it, other than a red dot, was I was like, oh shit, okay. Like yeah, from real life experience, like it, an M4 full auto recoil is not bad. Right, yeah. it's, like it's manageable. Is, yeah, this is realistic, and I like this. I'm glad they did something like this. So, yeah, it's, I don't, I don't know, I don't know if it's a whole kind of a whole package thing with all the new shit. So recoil, right. um, so everything new together, map, yeah. new features, right. the yeah. vaulting. So you were saying that Arena kind of had your attention before Wipe came. Now that Wipe is here, are you still yeah. like enamored with Arena, or have you kind of gravitated I back touched towards? It. You haven't touched it. No, haven't touched Arena since this came out. I think I played like a handful of games when Tarkov went down. Like, oh, it's down right. for an update. Like, okay, let me go play. Go play Arena. Arena. Right. Okay. 
just so that you can and that's most i think that's mostly due to the issues with arena with the money and the stuff like that with the kits and whatnot and yeah. the matchmaking and not being they the have best. fixed a lot of that stuff but oh absolutely kinda, yeah kind of same i haven't fired up arena since uh wipe i've and i'm a part of it enough to where like i've communicated with uh i don't know if you guys know who harley davidson is um mm -mm. him and no. a bunch of other creators are a part of they're doing a tarkov arena league okay and i've already i'm already a part of kind of the talks for that like i can go play it anytime oh, i want it's, sick it's private games where they have their own leaderboard and stuff like that so oh that's, that's cool. Really cool that's cool. yeah that's so the first i've heard of, of that people that's you guys know cool. or no well, yeah you may i'll have to i'll have to get you over there yeah send me the info for that and then i can share it around so more people can learn uh, about it because that sounds really cool well, if that's, that's something that they're that's the thing is it's not really you have to be uh invite have, like, invite. no they're not that's showing the thing, so. Are they streaming yeah. the matches and stuff so that people can watch them? Yep. Or yep. That's yeah. what I mean is like so people can watch. Like here's the channels go if you want to watch some like private arena matches, right? Like go check them yep. out. Not going to be inviting a bunch of people, but yeah. thank you. I but, sent I sent you an invite to it, Zane. Yeah, hell yeah. That's really interesting to me because I've I've no, no one's really talking about that, but I've noticed that from a ton of content creators that there's mm -hmm. a lot of people that haven't touched arena since this new wipe came out like they were really really excited for it was you know like pushing for it and uh, i mean some of them were people that got it day one like you did um but a lot of them are definitely people like me who didn't get access for like a week and i'll be yeah. completely honest with you guys i i haven't even opened arena i haven't touched it i oh, played it yeah at i wasn't a part of the first wave either i was yeah. second or third wave because i i don't participate in a lot of the the challenges and the tournaments and whatnot Mm -hmm. because Same. of my life like my schedule and with my kids and stuff like right streaming yeah. isn't it's i love streaming and i like talking to people and like being there and being mm -hmm. a part of like if i can make somebody's day better right, fuck yeah right oh yeah but ultimately like my kids are already Do so. whenever like sports and stuff are going on i can't commit you, to, yeah you got you, know, you got to be dad first always yeah right. i can't i can't commit to streaming tarkov for eight hours a day when i'm still active duty army and i you know kind of right <laughs> right yeah no i mean it was tough even for me to do like i you know jobs yeah. till i was 16 hour days yeah. basically i was i was working playing tarkov and then sleeping yeah. and so katie was managing awesome. steve for me right and so we did the whole thing and ended up pretty low payoff for the amount of effort involved right and then what we i got out of it basically i got day one arena yeah bro day one got that day one so i got to could... flex how much cooler and better i am than everybody right. on yeah. twitter dude farm that engagement <laughs> Nope. No, I mean, it was fine when it came out, but same, yeah, I've, I've, there's only a handful of people I'm aware of that have really, like, are still kind of, like, actively playing it. Like, yeah, I, um, it's very few people that I see, and, and, and when they do, uh, it's Tarkov's down for them, the launcher won't launch, Yeah. Uh, you know, it's, it's normally just, because they don't have access to Tarkov. What do you think that is, Trap? What do you, what do you think, like, even with them fixing the money and, and everything, like, what about, a, a, like, Arena versus the base game? Do you think it keeps the majority of people playing the base game? <laughs> I think that a fresh wipe is going to have most of the player base that actually like cares and loves Tarkov playing regular Tarkov. And then right. when the patch starts to die off and it gets a little old and, you know, they're going to go back over to Arena where it's casual. I mean, that's the thought process. And I think that's BSG's thought process too. And, you know, they wanted some casual take on Tarkov where people still fight and have fun. And Without the loot issue. About gear fear, you know? Right. So, right. I don't know. It's hard to say. It's hard to say because what if. That's not what people like Tarkov for anyway. What if it's the RNG and the overall environment of Tarkov, not just arena style challenge? Yeah, well, I guess that leads to like, you know, what's if you had to rank, you know, there's a lot of different aspects of Tarkov, right? Looting, the fighting, um, you know, the gear kit that you build that like plays into what you're capable of doing, right? Like the guns you run. What do you think? Um, what's the main draw for the, for the base game for you? Um, I think it's the fact that anything can happen, right? So, like, I don't have to have... Obviously, it increases chances of killing, like, a, a top-tier Chad guy, right? That's, like, way better. And if I, I used to use what's called the Snoop Booper a lot back in the day. It was just suppressed <laughs> SKS. Right. Uh, and just see what I can do. Yeah, or the, with. The, the classic, That's the Mosin, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those, the equalizers. Yeah. I used to, uh, back in the day, I used to go into raids with nothing, just at my hatchet. And yeah, zero to hero back runs. Back in the day, zero to hero, yeah, like I'd smack yeah. a smack a raider in the face, you know, when you get them through a door and then you take their full right. kit and you come out of the out of labs fully juiced. But yeah, you know, I think 
the lore for me, I don't know. It's hard to say because there's it's it's a total concept for me of Tarkov. Like the raid, like overall, like am I gonna get a crazy fight this wipe or this raid, or am I gonna find some really nice loot? Am I gonna get like two lead X's mm-hmm. and then like be you know try to and, avoid and maybe see nobody right? Not yeah, even avoid it. Just you just don't people. even see it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's just, I think it's the diversity of what I can do in a raid. Mm-hmm. I can go chase PvP. I can not necessarily avoid it, but I can do other things. Just right. that, that sense of anything can happen instead of a bunch of known scenarios. Because I feel like with Arena, we've we've all come to know that like the juicers are going to go for the ult and kits. Like you're going to run into somebody that's just indestructible, right? Or an entire yeah. team of them that are just yeah. indestructible, right? There right. isn't that that sense of like, oh, what's going to happen next? Like you know what's going to happen next. Well, I think that's tra- the beauty of that Tarkov yeah. Arena League thing I was just telling you guys about is they it's like uh, Counter Strike where they do or not Counter Strike but Rainbow Six Siege where they ban a character. Oh, see, banned, that's what I think the, the regular game needs is like ban yeah, kits, dude. and it'll yeah. probably happen, right? Probably In order happen. to make it competitive, you know, and you know, and I, but I think you hit it on the head a little bit there. Is that Arena has, like, it's distilled Tarkov down to just the the gunfight, which is fun. And, and is but part of what makes a lot of the gunfights in base game Tarkov fun is that you never know when one's yeah. going to show yeah. up. It's right? that element of surprise, There's right? So many you don't know the before they seize me. Yeah, yeah. You don't know what they even have in their gear. Like you don't like you don't know what you're fighting for. You've True. got stuff that you're trying not to lose. Yeah. Task items. I think that's something that Arena is never really going to capture. Right? There's you're never going to really capture the thought of like having a task item on you that you've been looking for for a yeah. long time. Just getting that like but, oh fuck moment. I gotta get out of here. But even more than that, I think Trap hit it. That the the randomness of it. I think think about how many areas on the various maps, especially now with like the shoreline rework. So shoreline's got new terrain, so we had to relearn like where all all the POIs are the same and they're in the same location, right? Except for the new like farm area, but like the terrain's different. And so now, like, you've had all these these fights where you're getting into fights with people in areas that you're, you're familiar kind of, like, where you are on the map, but now the terrain's so different that people can attack you from, you know, verticality they couldn't before, and then it only takes one fight in one of those areas, and it's, like, etched into your mind, right? And then the next time you get into a fight, like, you're trying to do those same rotations that guy did on you, right? And, I like, it's expanded out across the entirety of the map, and so you never know... Like, there's still areas on maps that I've never gotten into a fight in, right? Even 3,000 hours into the game, and I like the one the first time I get into a fight there, it's going to be insane. And I, whether I win or I lose, it's going to be an exciting experience. And I think that's something that Arena just misses the mark, right? Yeah, for that particular aspect of the game, yeah, I agree. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And me, I you know, ch- chat knows this about me, but I love the loot. I'm a, a little bit of a loot oh, yeah, goblin when it comes to it, right? right like, it's fun finding. You know, oh, the greed not, will get you killed. Greed will uh-huh. get you killed. It'll yeah. like try trying to make friends, trying to hit the the rooms that you know you shouldn't be hitting. You know, like like uh, it's late in the raid, the player scabs are everywhere. Uh, I could go, I could go loot the marked room. Like right. it'll be fine. You know, I've gotten into some insane fights being you know greedy and staying late. And then you know, I, like nothing really compares. It a lot of games don't really can't capture the finding that Ledex, right? Finding a Ledex in a random duffel bag, right? Right. Um. And that's something that, like, you know, those Tarkov killers, like, they've, you know, I think when I think of the cycle, right, it's the cycle's dead now. Mm-hmm. The cycle's missing a lot of those things that you say, like, the things that make the game fun for you, the 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 equalizers, right? It's That game didn't really have, like, a good way to level the playing field. And then it also was missing the mark, I think, in a lot of ways on that loot aspect, right? Um, finding, like, the really juicer loot and knowing, it, like, even even new players find a GPU and they don't even know about the Bitcoin farm and they get stoked, right? Just because of the nature of what the item is. Right. Well, I mean, even the, yeah. the, the new loot uh, part of the map that they added to Shoreline, people are so excited about right now. Just like oh, yeah, because it's juiced. Right. Well, and it's I, it's something yeah. new. It's something, it's, you know, the randomness of, am I going to get there? Is it going to be looted? Did the player scabs get to it? You know, there's so much True. even to just, we added a new area and put a bunch of juice to yeah. it. I think a, another huge aspect that I missed the mark on, I'm talking about earlier, was the new armor play stuff, right? Because that's a mm-hmm. huge yes. hot topic, this wipe. And I didn't right. even touch base on it at all. Um, yeah, armor changes. I was excited about them, and now I'm like, eh, was it the right decision? Because now they brought in like a couple new hitboxes that just like, as everybody's oh, seen, yeah. probably on TikTok, where you yeah, know, the you armpit deaths, the armpits. <laughs> yes, yes, the, the elusive armpit left deaths. armpit, you know, yeah, yeah, no. And I think that one's messed me up. And for some of it, it makes sense. Like in the beginning, it was like, oh, yeah, I'm dying because I'm turning and I'm exposing my side, and that was the point. But as, like, more and more videos have come out, like, from Arrowing Marine, I'm sure a lot of people have seen his videos on it. Like, the hitboxes, they almost, like, 
they like overlap in weird ways and it causes the damage to like multiply and then now fragmentation you know people used to say that fragmentation was broken or like it wasn't a thing and turns out it is a thing and it is working and now it's causing us to die in ways that like we didn't see before yeah you know? getting shot in the chest and your back plates fucked up so like they definitely have a lot of work to do with the armor system mm-hmm. um i i also was yeah, really excited extent, about it to an extent like armor only does so much irl Right. I mean. Oh yeah. Well, and, and bullets do actually fragment IRL, and so the, it's it's yeah. going to be a fine line to find the right balance for it. But I do think some work needs to be made on it. What I found really interesting was how, like, collectively as a community, we really didn't come on to how off really the armor system was until we got about you know three four weeks into wipe until people started to get those tier four tier five tier six armors and realize wait a minute yep. i'm still getting one they're not doing what they should be right by yeah. armor that, that i shouldn't be getting one tapped from and so the, the lower tier armors i mean i remember beginning a wipe but everybody was like man it feels so good right now day one a wipe people were fucking stoked on everything Faulting was hot. Armor was hot. It was all great. And then kind of as the wipe went on and as we got more data and more input from the community as a whole, we kind of started to see these gaps uh, specifically in the armor system and, uh, you know, c- come up. And the, the armpit one is the biggest one that you see around everybody yeah, dying armpit, to the armpit the shots. weird hit boxes. Yeah. Yeah. So. Cool, man. Are well, you ready to play some Tarky, dude? Yeah, dude. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm listening. I was moving a camera back. No, 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 you're chilling. No, we just kind of hit our we hit our 30 minute mark here. So, yeah, I was going to I was just going to lead into that really quick and and ask you, you know, what what you think your strategy is going to be like today? You know, kind of as we get loaded up and and go in here, kind of talk about that. Man, you got that cable going right past you. (laughs) On ground zero and have a little fun. So hell yeah. Hell yeah. That sounds so much fun. We love it. uh, We're looking for a fight. Maybe, maybe. I'm not going to cower. I'm going to play the way I normally play, and that's usually where I die to greed, so. Okay, yeah, I like I identify with that. I love I think, that. So I think, just so that you kind of know what our plan is, is we'll probably chatter in your ear and annoy you as you're loading into raids and, like, mess around in your stash and stuff. And then once you get into raid, we're going to mute so that we're not messing with you at all, let you focus on the raid. You're, feel free to interact with your chat and everything. Like, we're not trying to lock that down or nothing. But we're going to stay out of your ear while you're mid-raid, um, maybe on occasion we might pop, pop in on if something crazy happens, but we'll try to leave you to it while you're actually like playing. Um, and we're just going to kind of commentate on what's going on and, and chat with our chat. And then, um, we'll just roll with it, see how things are going yeah, and ask anything. Yeah. I've got yeah. another camera view as well. So if there's ever any questions on like setup or. So what I'm going to have chat's going to be seeing what your chat sees. So I've got it set up so that I can pull your stream. Um, and we'll have it up in a in a box on ours with some rules and us on the side, um, and yeah, it should be a good time. That's crazy that you got that cable right there next to me. I feel like I would just smack it. I uh, yeah, that is wild. <laughs> Which one? The one for your camera that's going right by your right side. <laughs> is that, it's like right next to you. He's like, there is no cable. Wait, where? What are you I, I, about? I, I saw I saw it a second ago, and now it's gone. I don't know, the green screen maybe and messing with it. That's all I, good. I think maybe it is. So the cable runs actually behind the green scene. I got like a 10-foot uh, USB It like it. popped it out in front, and it looked like it was right next to you. Yeah, I don't know. That was weird. But cool, man. Oh, you may have. I don't think it would have been. It, it. It oh, maybe it was that ears. cable. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. yeah so uh, It looked small... black. I don't know. Yeah. I was just going to give a small disclaimer to everybody. We are going to be seeing Trap's game feed delayed. Uh, through his stream, just like the normal else. Twitch delay, yeah. right? Uh, so we'll kind of be responding to to plays after the fact. That's more a disclaimer for you than anything else, Trap, because okay. it might be off putting for. So you guys want me to? Okay, so I'll just I will mute my mic to Discord since you they're going to hear what my chat hears anyway, right? Yep. That makes yep. Sense. yep. While you're in raid, in between raids, we're going to mute your stream and we're going to chat with you, right? And then while you're playing, we'll we'll leave you to just play like normal, right? That way we're not chatting in your ear. You're welcome to unmute and okay. chat with us if you need to, but or you yeah. can just ask us questions through stream because we'll be listening. So, yeah. cool Sounds man. Sounds good. Let's do it. I'm gonna swap scenes yeah. here, and then you can kill your camera feed to Discord. Do you guys if you want. want me to see anything, or y'all want to me to like pull anything up? Um, Before we start, I, like I'm literally at the get ready screen. I haven't selected the language yet. Yeah, no, that's fine. We're gonna we're, we're gonna good. pull your yeah. feed up. You, like I said, you can kill your camera to Discord. You don't need to stream that just to save resources if you want. Okay. Um, but yeah, we're going to switch over to this one, chat. 
and then I will All right, let me mute up. Chat, how did you guys like that interview? Do you have any other questions or things like that that you would like would us to Do you guys have this account name? Or do y'all have anything in mind in particular? No, you can name it whatever you want. You can name it your name. Why is this being stupid? Yeah, dude, have fun with that. Let your chat name it. We're going to chat a little bit more at the end of the challenge. We've got about uh, probably 25-ish minutes, 20 minutes that we'll have to chat at the end to kind of, you know, ask them how it went, things like that. So if there's any other questions that you guys would like to ask, uh, please put them in chat and I will try to ask them at the end. We fixed this, and now it's being stupid. Um, I blame you. I fixed it again. How dare you? No, I fixed it. It's fine. You fixed it. It's okay. Oh, I know what it is. Theater mode. Um, oh, they can't name it. <laughs> He's trying to name it Loot Sack. Loot Sack 1. I like it. All right. Do we have him... So, hmm... All right, we'll unmute. The most obnoxious face. I have to unmute. Let me switch it over. This is supposed to be a... The artist who made this playlist is supposed to have a DMCA free thing. Gotcha. Gotcha, Play gotcha. Jean. Play Jean. Where we got? That makes sense. I just unmuted stream uh, and, and heard it and recognized it, and I was like, oh, I know that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, that man. So we're going to... We're gonna we're gonna get started here soon. He's I, as you guys can see, he's a. Uh, we'll call time start like first load in probably. Yeah. 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 Sure. Sounds good. All right. Are you gonna run with the the kit they give you? That's the question. You gotta get the uh, butt set up. Not. You got you got the, the fun alpha. You got a little bit of like you you're kind of used. To, you've done some hardcore account runs before, so you're kind of used yeah. to. So yeah, like well, talk us through this. What's your what's your starter kit usually? Like your first come in. Now you well, obviously. I mean, you know. I would yeah. like a bigger container, but you know. <laughs> uh, Same. On hardcore, you know, you don't go in with anything too crazy. You start off with nothing. Um, I don't go ever go in with food and water because I'm going to find some. So. Yeah, I kind of do that anyways. Usually, I usually try to find it like mid raid. Okay. Yeah, I usually don't go in too kitted. Um, and then, like, ideally, I would have a grizzly in my pouch. Not on hardcore, but like starting off normal on a normal raid. Um, right. But obviously, that won't. The case for this go around I have one yeah the alpha kind of forces you to to bring a few things like exposed right so if right. you go down that's just it uh forces you to make certain decisions mm -hmm. for sure so we went bear i see everything yeah yep yeah, yep yeah, yeah. chat chat picked it chat picked chat it, picked it. <laughs> okay i was gonna ask uh, I, I know you're a usec man what what happened <laughs> um this is the hard part, right? Because I don't have anything, any of the good stuff that most you start. It off is with, difficult being like being mid wipe. Yeah, you don't you don't have some of the you know more useful um, weapons available to you. Yeah, yeah, and especially knowing that you're going to ground oh, thank zero. God. It's a uh... here gave me five hundred rubles, five thousand. Hey, hey, love that. Yeah, we're juicing. All right, Get and you're on the you're on the Let's come up. What our meds are. Boom, boom. Fuck it. Oh, that's what we need to do. This Guru, thank you for the love, buddy. Thank you so much for that love. Dusa, thank you so much for all those compliments coming in during the interview, you guys. I appreciate that. Does it uh, remember this? Uh, yeah, the settings should be set um, nice. like to your computer. Okay. So, Everything's yeah. set up. Nice. Yeah, that's one of the nice okay. things about doing it this way is, yeah, you get to keep all of that. That's cool. That's actually something I didn't think about, but it is definitely a nice byproduct. Yeah, and the settings are saved in the launcher, like local on your machine. So yeah, whatever so account logs in, yeah, we'll get yeah. the... That's hot. I'm sure there's a pair of brothers out there somewhere that hate it, but what, yes. it's nice for us. <laughs> <laughs> Share the family computer, the freaking pissed. Right. Or they all can conform. You know? And just use my keybinds, dude. They're right? better. My KD's higher than yours, bro. Yeah, dude, I can <laughs> hear the argument. 
and you can hear the sigh of the dad in the background yeah, on a no, recliner. Mom, he keeps changing the keybinds, but my survive rate's better. <laughs> <It's> just, <laughs> That's crazy. Just it, it, like I said, in the dad in a recliner, just. <sighs> The deepest and, dad and, side. And, and Trap's house, it's him and his son. <laughs> like, you better not change those key bonds, boy. <laughs> in my secret life. You know, like, I don't have a recliner. I've got the nice same chair as you guys. We all have the same one, actually. Yeah, but know? this thing yeah. does recline, though. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> this, this, dude. this thing is a recliner. You can take a nap in this thing, dude. No, dude. What's up? It's awkward. I feel like I'm in a dentist chair all of a sudden. <laughs> oh, God. Get the picks out thing. <laughs> Talk to me about your setup a little bit there. That thing looks nice. You got three monitors, I can see. <laughs> yeah, I used to have four, um, but you know, there's no need. I actually don't even use the far left front anymore. So I'm really just I'm on a two PC setup with a two monitor setup. Okay, so, all right. The other one's usually where I keep Discord, but I'm not okay. Okay, but you guys know. that makes sense. Set up over there. So, uh, it? Uh, and then obviously, I got the Go XLR. Uh, I usually have something up monitoring my own stream so I can see what everybody else sees. Mm -hmm. Versus just having it up over here. Um, then I got the stream deck. I use Touch Portal a lot. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Touch Portal, but I use that a lot, a lot. So, okay, I am not. Familiar it's with another stream deck thing where I can make it do whatever I want. I don't know if you guys are. Familiar. Okay, that's cool. Oh God, here we go. All right, buddy. Good luck. We're gonna right, let you, you got jump this. into it. Yep, yep. Later. Right, Jay, here All we right, go. chat. I'm so excited for oh, him right God, now. Here we go. Task. All right, let's see. Where did he start? Right, you got this. The, uh, yep, yep. Later. Let's see. We're in Ground Zero. Uh, let's turn it. I don't recognize Chat, this building here. right out Hello. the gate. Um, oh, he's in the. Um, oh, so I don't know what this is called, but the the one the one of the machine gun uh, emplacements is above him that he needs to go for his task. That gives us. Uh, actually, I, I believe it's across the street. Okay. This building oh, is have, not. I, didn't bring I forget cash. what this one's. It's the only one I don't know the name of. Damn, it's not Tarbank. I think it's like. It starts with an E. There's it's like upstairs. I forget. We should pull up, pull up the map. <laughs> usually, usually it has porn on that one. Right, we're going over here Damn, first. chat's coming in hot already. Here, let me oh, pull shit. up the uh, map for Ground Zero so that I can name some of these buildings. Spawn is dog water. This map is dog water. <laughs> a lot of longtime players don't like this particular like map. A fairly kitted. You know that. Moving. Is interesting to me Fish because I'm Persky. not a long time player and I liked the map. It was, you mm -hmm. know, it's small, it's concise, right? There's a lot of, uh, you know, That's right. I hope you get the film better, brother. Yeah, I'm sorry it, you, uh, the, the one place that does suck, I will weather. admit, the weather. Uh, is the, um, Oh, oh, I feel like the terror group building. Terrible. Yes, the terror group building. No yeah, the, that's where all the tasks are. So that's where everybody yeah. kind of yeah. conglomerates. Right, right so now, specifically second floor of the terror group building, Whoa. that one room that you've got to go into that is just like yeah. prime fucking right. rat spot, whether so, you're ratting it or whether you're trying to do it yourself do your and task, you end up ratting it because you heard something. Up. Yeah. Right. Well, we got accused of ratting because we were in there doing our task when a team pushed us. It's like we're literally hunting trying to find the item and you guys pushed us. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, I don't know what you want. So trap, I agree. Trap right now, he's in the um, Capital, what is it, Capital Insight building. This is down in the bottom corner of Ground Zero. One of his task spots he needs to get to, the automated turret is above him. This is also a player spawn, so Trap's just playing it a little safe right now as he makes his way up. there's a spawn up here. Ooh, he can't remember if there's a spawn. I don't think there is a spawn. It's always there. a fun, fun right? thing to try to keep track of. There yeah. are spawns up there, chat, to answer everybody's question. But not up here on the third floor where yeah, he is. Here, my left here. You like the map if it had less players? It is a lot of players for its size. I do agree. Kuru, you want to play on a hardcore account? Buddy, you got to get more time on a regular account. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> From like me loading you just call that one green? Nice, Luau. Uh, yeah, Guru, Shadow, this is I the new map. I agree with both of those things. Yeah, I think if they... Extreme. Even two extreme, less PMCs like on this extreme. map would make a very significant difference. I don't understand why they made it such a choke point to get into that Biggest one map. Fear. Yeah, and then... Broken legs. Oh, Trap forgot to splint. That's going to be a struggle. He's also playing at nighttime, so this map's a little dark. A lot of shadows here. The the lights on the street, they don't seem to light up as much as they noise? do on streets. Crap, here's something that's bothering Oh, it's the fire right here. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> and you play I don't too much know Apex about Legends. the one-way path what? shadow. So that one, like, it sucks Tango, what's up, dude? because they did it in so many places, but that is a very standard Tarkov element. Open here. Hi, True, like, choke dog. points and things like that. Right. Ooh, like a lot, that's, a that's lot of places have more than one way out, though. It's one of the few places that it's truly, like, a one way in and out. Oh, yeah, All right, we've got yeah, some fighting yeah, right in front of Trap right now. He wants he wants to fight this player. He wants to steal that kit. 
You love the map. It's your favorite scab map. Consistent one mil. I haven't even scabbed here really ever. I did it once, and I helped a guy do his quests. I've actually never scabbed either. I need to. Let me up here. Traps being a sneaky breaky. This guy shouldn't be there for a beginner map. Be up. I see what you're saying, Shadow. He uh, is on the hunt That's not for this player. Maybe not such a severe version of it. If that makes sense. Beginner map, yeah. Right, like. I gotta remember, I'm not on my main account. It's very narrow, just, like, throw like away one way in, one way out. You could still I'm create doing what's called that the loot section. that element of being trapped from nothing. And but working our way up to you can do it in a way dude. that's not as severe as the way that they've done it. With because I do loops. agree with you on that. It's fucking atrocious for a, a brand follow. new player to come into that. Oh, hello, Ooh, trap, trap. Here's somebody. The underground offers, dude. The underground that's, on this map is actually low key map. really cool, and I think it's really lame that dude, more tasks aren't down there. Leave me alone. Yeah, it, it really unlocks this map, and they don't drive you down there at all. All right, trap is really. He's in Tarbank. The building, the offices behind him have landmines in them, so he needs to be careful. This building is one of his task buildings. Upstairs above him is the GL that he needs to get. Oh, he's got running. Oh, uh, yep, I hear it. Player in the stairwell, it sounds like. Yeah, that's definitely a player. Oh, guy across the street. Oh, he dropped him. Nice. I'm kidding. I love you. I'm <laughs> I called him. <laughs> <laughs> Like in. Hell yeah. What's up, like in? Why would he just Thank like you, stop? Babe. Right there. <laughs> Kicked down there. Usually has decent loot too. Oh, is there really? Check it. I think we go check it. That's Fuck good it. Why not? Trap said it's the greed that gets him killed. Yep. Yo, so the last time I played this map, you guys, I got baited by fucking Nikita in the open safe that's got a fucking gold chain yeah, those, in it with a mine right Those offices were right behind him. It. That's the room that Trap that's was in. That's the last right time I him. played Ground Zero, and I was like, fuck oh, was this fucking map. Like in How is Helldivers 2? I just looked at it yesterday. I was showing it to Katie. We were thinking about that maybe getting fun. it. Oh, no. It looks fun. We're in community days. Yo, yeah, Guru, we're doing them like again. We were doing them last Saturday. This map should lock at 15, not 20. Um, I just, Level 10. I don't know. I, I just think it's a weird brother. idea. Get off the map. <laughs> Get off the map, brother. What a bully. What a bully. Oh, that 70 round, 75 round mag is actually huge yeah. early wipe because Trap doesn't have access to a lot of good ammo. Yeah. So that AKM Honestly, that and all that kit, ammo, that all of that that's is huge. Massive. Yeah. And look at him. He oh, said he was going to find food. I it's, it's HP ammo, but still. On that, Lucas. Looted. Once you hit flee, if you know what you're doing, you can get off flee. Gives you a NASA advantage. Yeah, getting all I that gear. I agree with that, actually. Once you hit flee, I think I'm it, solo, you should so I'm be not able to come to this map. On insurance. No. Oh, oh scabs nope, are yelling at him. Yelled at. Yep. Where the fuck you go? Somebody else killed that scab. Is that above I him? I am confusion. What the fuck just happened? I think someone's above trap right now or in the Is area next to him. Is right there? A Mosin just killed that guy, right? Oh yeah. Trap's got a player nearby. He's just got to he's got to root him out now. My I'm guess. I'm so impressed by the veterans' player's ability to call there out a specific round, and I'm getting there. I can like I can tell the difference now between like a shotgun and a nine millimeter round, like the, from other rounds, right? Right. But like the nuanced ones, like a Mosin round specifically. Knowing the difference between an RFB and an SR-25 that shoot right. the same this bullet. Right. right, they shoot the same bullet, but from a from a different weapon, right? right? Like, that is so impressive to me that you guys can do that. Mm -hmm. And it just comes from time. Mm -hmm. Oh, they, 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 oh no, the barbed wire is still here. I think there is a guy up here. Oh, yeah, he's definitely got company. Ooh. Oh, yeah, he saw him. He saw yeah. him. Don't peek it again. No. Oh! No! Oh! Damn. So close, man. I should have re-peeked him with that gun. I should have peeked. What's up, Hans? Because that gun was atrocious. Damn, good try, buddy. Good kill on it the first guy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, really? Mosin man upstairs with the AVS, dude. That's crazy. Um, it's Level always 10, the Mosin man, or whatever isn't he was. it? Yeah, the level 10 guy. Dude, you dropped that guy in the street. Yeah, you did. That was a good kill, dude. That was clean. I should have, like, rocked the PP-19 upstairs, too. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with that. I think you... Tough, he had the long barrel and then AKM, and then, yeah, it kind of built, like, doo-doo. Yeah, it didn't have great ergo, and so when you were ADSing, you were getting... Yo, already. what's up, buddy? So your hits were just kind of getting hit-punched already from the start. 
be really cool yep. if you have Absolutely. return this map but changes slightly as an end quest. Cult on yeah, it and a boss. Do... That'd be cool. That'd be cool. I think I honestly I think overall I think it'd be cooler to have maps. Here, I'm gonna ask Trap this. Tra Trap, I have a question for you actually. How That's would you here. feel about some sort of mechanic? Like a quest that you would do or something that would give you like a one time use item that boosts boss spawn rate. Like maybe something I think specific. I just went through chasing Kappa, it's not a bad idea. Like I think it'd be like, you know, instead of Killa just spawning idea. randomly, right? Like what if you had to find the SR key or to unlock his secret room and like plant something and Make then the next makes him yeah. spawn right no, or the next time idea. you load in he's guaranteed to be there or something like that right i mean we already have a mechanic in the game with lightkeeper just like that where you have to collect a bunch of items go through a series of things in order to get that little beeper thing so that you can get right. across the bridge right yeah, what if it was like a one-time use beeper like when you, you load yeah. in with it and it forces the boss to come to that map Right, and it's right. hard, to, you know, make it hard to get. Just like Light, right. Lightkeeper is very difficult tasks to get through. Um, but I think that would definitely add an element of like uh, drive um, mm -hmm. and, and another like grind element to this game that a lot of people really enjoy. We know a lot of people that just grind Tarkov, and I think that would definitely create another thing for people to just like, oh, I was able to to get the beeper and kill fucking uh Gluhar, I'll use it for example, a hundred times, which I've I think I've seen Gluhar once the entire time I played Tarkov. Sure. sure. Yeah, I think I've seen him once this wipe. Or yeah. even even if it was just yeah. like it boosted his chance to spawn and then when he finally does it goes like blat so you could like check it in your inventory and you'd see like, oh shit, it works. He's for real like, here. He's here. Like, I know right? he's here. Yeah. Right? It doesn't spawn him on top of you or anything like that. You still have to be the first one to get to him, but you sure. know he's there. Yeah. yeah. I like it. I, th I don't think BSG would like it, but... Right. Yeah. I, I think it would I add, <laughs> you know... <laughs> something that is going to be interesting, right, and Nikita's talked about this, is that the full release of the game includes a story mode that nobody's seen. Yeah, we know nothing about it. Right, so maybe maybe there is something like That's that. True. Maybe we Maybe we will have some way to force him. Yeah. Do a drug drop for Sanitar. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> That'd be a funny way to get him to spawn. You need to bring Elmer's glue to factory, and that I makes Tagilla spawn. I just think of the same thing, but like that turpentine <laughs> glue. You know what I mean? Like that big container, dude. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Let's see how it goes. Let's go around. Fee, you can pay ups and odds. That way, it's more universal, and most of anybody can do it. You have to go through crazy quests. Yeah, these tasks. Be I don't know if the do first it. one, like finding one gun, gets you off that. If I have to go back and find um, it, I, um, you keep it. You keep it. Yes, I do yeah. remember that. It's one at a time. Yeah, you don't have to do it all in the same raid. The only one that you have to do all in the same raid, I think, or it seems to throw a fit, is the shooting cans one. Which one is that again? That's one where you got to go get the key, go up into the room, find the hard drive, oh, and yeah. then get out. Yeah, I've we've seen the issues when people get the hard drive, uh, having to go back and get it again. Oh, it spawned me all the way on the other side. No, you're at the bottom. All right, buddy, good luck. Yep. Oh, it spawned me. All right. All the way on the other side. Get the glue the for Tagilla as a rare spawn from <laughs> Gluhar. <laughs> oh. It's the hard drive, yeah. Oh. Ooh, he's got the nudes. Now? Do we make it that far? That'll be the interesting thing, too. Like, how far ahead do you try to like, plan? A it's a three-hour challenge. I don't need to get a bunch of late quest items. Yeah, but nudes aren't that late in the game, you guys. There's nudes are pretty early. Right outside my fucking door. Yeah, they the are left. pretty early, actually. So it'll be very Not interesting to watch. See Not what people choose fan, to pick Chad. up and Not what people fan. don't. The quests help. They're good way. EXP drops, right? Yeah. I mean, if you can manage to get to level here. five, you unlock the dailies, and maybe that'd be worth doing, right? To yep. try to be the highest level okay, player. Force here, Mosins. love that for me. I remember, I lost my Christmas. How's the quality of trap stream for right you guys? Here. Looks like it says it's doing 1080. I feel like I should just rush. Ooh, trap sending it. But I got He's sending it as fast as I possibly could. We're just gonna rush the other gun. Uh, Lucas, that sounds like it would us, be uh, you can a still bug get it in. exploit. Ah, of some through kind? the vaulting, probably. Yeah, you can probably just vault through shit. Yeah, <laughs> which is not something we necessarily want to encourage. Oh, FMJ rounds are going to be good if, early on if you can get out with those. Yeah. Honestly, any loot that he can get right now is just going to be incredibly valuable to have. 
The ammo is just so huge. Right. Anything that he can sell, the ammo is massive because he can't buy it yet. Um, so that's that's really way, probably the most me. important thing for him to find. We say people go into that the place above him like immediately. Oh yeah, he's definitely. Oh, he got can players. hear him running. People yeah. are running around. Lag? Why am I getting lag? He's rummaging through file cabinets above him. If I could try. Problem is, he's got to go through barbed wire to get up there, so the guy's going to hear him no matter what. He's looting away. That man is looting. He's neck deep in a fucking box right now. <laughs> <laughs> Break the window, walk along the edge. If it wasn't meant to be done, they could have blocked it off. Like they, Well, there's a bunch of places you can get into with vaulting that you shouldn't be able to. And you can make the same argument, right? And it, like, but it's Challenge like through a wall. The barbed wire. I was just about to say, Lucas. Uh, I, I don't. I don't. I'm gonna hold off on making uh, the statement that they intentionally left that open. Um, what? You never know. You but, never know. They oh, might have. Still hits the barbed wire. Does that count for the other guy? Traps sending it. He's upstairs. That guy's still looting, bro. Yo, he did just fucking. Does that guy not even know? No way. Does he not even know, bro? Travis about to kill like a level three. There's no way he didn't hear that, right? Bruh. Oh, Ooh. smoked. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> folded. I thought below I heard me. too. Got a buddy. This guy's got a buddy below him. Travis should clear. Make sure there isn't a second one. Clear right. your corner, shit. All right, he got his gun. This guy's got a good, better armor on. Level six, this Arctic Surge, GGs. Oh, and he is uh, looted up. Oh man, look at that helmet. Oof, hell yeah. It's not a vault though. That's good. My brother in Christ. The drum. I don't know yeah. if you want to keep the drum. It's empty, but what it looks are we like he's going to. What, I would what be are we looting? Curious to see the if they patch that. They're way out of this motherfucking building. Next wipe that doesn't involve going me forward. going down those stairs. Right. <laughs> the only reason that. I say that is because historically, when something like that shows up, that the community is like, no, they would have fixed it. Uh, Once it becomes though, like evident to Uncle Nikita, it gets mm -hmm. fixed. Damn. He's like, actually, no, I don't want hold this on, game Chad, to be made on. easier in any way, shape, or form. Let me cook. <laughs> Let me cook. Trap's got a smoke nade. <laughs> he's cooking, chat. <laughs> Let him you cook. Know, nope. he's, oh. he's fried. Um. He's fried. <laughs> he left the oven door open? People. He overdid it. He overdid <laughs> it. In that building over there. Hey, these guys are making a move on me. No, so, I mean, he, he has the advantage noise. where he's at if he stays put. Right, because they've got to get up to him. He's going to hear him get up to him. Yeah, it's a tough spot he finds himself in, though. Yeah. Can't just, that window. But ultimately, he is stuck because they've got him pinned on the same exact side. Uh, this is a really high up second floor. Yeah, it's not like in... Where I have to go down those fucking stairs, didn't I? Yeah, yeah. It's like the fourth floor or something like that. I don't have a fucking. If that will dump the single spawn key or brother. just take it to troll. Yeah. Oh, so th I mean, what I about a key then? Good stats. It could jump right. to that. People do the same thing to unknown. Oh yeah, especially early wipe. Yep, it's, I mean it's Ooh. the same exact thing. They 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 do it to be dicks to troll. Right, they don't need it. They just don't want other players to get it. What the fuck are you yelling at, bro? <laughs> Trap. Oh. Which, to be clear, my opinion of the matter is that they should have something like that. Right, in case that people want to be you guys dicks, doing right? okay this down the there. Map. You, you are just starting, um, and it is really frustrating, especially as a new player, to get stuck on a task and really not even understand why. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, it says it's 100% spawn, but every time I check it, it's not there. Like, why? Right. right. So I would love for that to be the case. Um, I Trav's just jumping around like a crazy person. Feel like Nikita, if that makes sense. Sure. Like not in line with like the rest of the game. Right. That's fair. A sneaky little peek down the yeah, stairwell dude, right there. Cheeky, dude. Trap's gonna go down to the underground, it looks like. Is this plan? 
I like this plan, actually. There's a lot of traffic on that main floor. Oh. Rocking that lefty left shoulder. I like it, Lucas. And I don't like you seeing how big the ledge was, so broke the window, walked out on it. Is that guy eating? I think, what? I think Trap just heard somebody start eating. I mean, if he's just chilling there, no we're shot. good, right? I thought it did. Damn, someone oh, took that. Someone okay, took the so car. Took that. Let's go try Trap to get can't do that. Get the fuck he's out. Gonna, he's going to try and get shooting cans done. Right, I think that's what he's working on is shooting cans. It's, what's this other one? It's uh, oh, jump on that. That'll probably get me um, shot. Um, I don't remember what the name of this quest oh, is, no. chat. That requires him to go Bad to the place. scientist. Yeah. Three people made shorts about it. Oh wow. Yeah, I never. We never had the issue. We always were able to just get the key and then climb right up. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like the mall. The mall. That sounds right. That sounds right. Yo, I heard if you right, hang chat. out in this building right, too long, you have a really small PP. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, did there's that offend someone, you, bro? There's someone above him. <laughs> that that offends you, bro? <laughs> He's <laughs> classic. So he needs a I'm name. I'm coming for you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> He's here. voiping to here. him. I die here. I die here. I'm coming for you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that's still active. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Yo, whoever did that, thank you. Azarek, thank you for the fucking. How many that scared him. That was, dude. Oh, my God. There's no global cooldown on that. Oh, that fuck. was pretty great. I might have to turn that off for this challenge, guys. That's funny. That's <laughs> funny. All right, here he goes. He's going to go fight this guy. This guy's ratted up here somewhere. Oh my god. I forgot about it, dude. Yo, there's Why somebody in here for sure. Hear them shuffling and buffling around. He's got the key, so this guy's got to be in here somewhere. Or he, he ran? Or maybe the guy has the key from a different raid? I guess he could have kept it. Yeah, he it's kept it. It's hard to rotate through he kept, here. The guy kept the key from a different raid. Oh, that's him prone on the ground in there. Or, or he did the ledge like it's the same. Ooh, those were some nice peaks from yeah, Trap they were. there. But Trap didn't unlock the door. It was already open. Oh, we're going to the ledge. Oh, oh let me in. <laughs> nice! Oh, there's another one! Oh! oh! <laughs> get shit on! <laughs> get shit on! Is this? Oh, there it is. Yo, let's go! Okay, now that I've seen <laughs> it in <laughs> action no myself, they're Lucas, hanging out. I, I agree. Yeah, that one's meant to be. Yeah, I agree. Now that I've seen get it in action, that's meant to be map. there. Artist Greed, level 20, camping the, fuck? the fucking uh, quest room. Yeah. Level 20. I didn't bring extra ammo, did I? I did. What a kill. What a double. Yeah, dude. On the on the left shoulder, too. Oh, I forgot, that was good shit. Guys. I enjoyed I that. Bring Hilly-ish. Something off the map, dude. What's up? That was good shit. I enjoyed that. Nice work. Nice work. Preach, preach, preach. What's up? Nice work. Nice work. It was a beautiful uh, follow-up with the left shoulder, dude. Hell yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense, Lucas. They're scavs. Yeah, I did not know I that I'm I was there. I think I'm here to scav outside, but there's cool, definitely uh, something else present. The left oh, hello, yeah. you sick armor. I think I'm here to scav outside, right, but there's definitely What's interesting <laughs> is that the window oh, hello, wasn't broken, so you're right. They brought in a key from a previous raid specifically to camp that as level 20s. I hear donking on them. I hear donking on them, dude. In the mattress. Damn. Oh, please no. I wish I had my heart rate. I love how he I'm didn't working. move. He was Damn. like, well, it, it if is it what happens, it is. It happens. <laughs> 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 that 
That's a true Tarkov veteran right there. Right, dude. He didn't flinch. I'll eat this, Nate. Is this he what was it's like, well. <laughs> this is what it's going to be. <laughs> well. <laughs> the question is, is he going to do dude, the oh, the XP. stacking? Shrap uh, 25, huh? Or is he going to he's going to let it, some of that stuff stay? Uh, Cuz he can like stack that. into that rig and carry a lot of stuff but it's going to make him heavy and he's got the early game stats. But the loot and the money. I can't access the fleet. I, I don't know, man. It could be worth it. I think it's like 10k. Could have taken the window and said not made a sound they could have killed trap through the door as he was unlocking it. Maybe the turn of biddies, dude. Yeah. Scrubs don't even know how to rat. Right. <laughs> that would make sense, wouldn't it? What, what's so interesting to me, Lucas, is that they chose Which to rat makes more sense, this one or in the other such a one, toxic though? way by take it, by both taking the key right? from How a different raid. Is this a one use key? It's kind key. of bigger than mine. Trap is looting. Right? Yeah, it's a one use Same key. So they, they had to Never have mind. pulled that out from another raid. And then brought it in, yeah. And then brought it in. And yeah. at level 20, you've got no reason to be in that room. Oh, I can't. Well, he's, the other guy's level guy three, so. Oh, okay. Okay. Fuck me up severely. okay, that makes more sense. Am I missing? I can't that do makes that more sense. one. He was the oh, buddy three in. found in raid med items, right? That's what I need. Yes, sir. He's right. Yes, he does, chat. Chat, we're going to have an ad after this raid. Stack. Yeah, I can do that. Oh, these don't count. Okay. You got an analog. And now again, though, that'll be that's one. I thought the blood set counted. No, uh, blood set doesn't count. It's got to be like a one of the red ones, like an I actual gotcha, heal I gotcha. item. Med use item. Yeah, 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 yeah. Salewa, cheese, bandage. Damn, the gotcha. Emercom little checkpoint things back down that way, isn't it? That I need to hit. That's yeah, the other way. It's yeah. the other way. I don't want to give too much like. Input because I want everybody to see like this is like the way that they play. Oh, right? yeah, if the they get help process. from their chat, I don't, I don't care. Oh yeah, no, we're not chat, here to help. Right? We're but here to commentate. We're chat. here to watch. And so Trap's got these scab. Oh, that's a P scab running around beneath him. I'm was here a, to watch and report. That was a player scab, hundred percent. Do we make that risk? Immercom checkpoint. That's down here, right? I don't yeah, know what the fuck Mira Avenue is, guys. I'm gonna be honest. Mira Av is oh, the. Shit. Hey. Oh! oh. Mirav is the flare extract chat, for those who don't know. Mm. We got Bonked it. him. I'm like an old man, chat. I can like stick my tongue out and be weird. <laughs> Bonked. There's another one right here. I thought there was one close right. Nice. Oh, there's a bunch of them out there. Hell no, you ain't shooting me, bro. Oh, shit. Bonked him, dude. There is a flare spawn. What you mean? You know when guy to pull them. He's got a chance to have a, a big stairs. win on this raid if he can get out with this, right? Pretty That's huge. An, yeah. Big wins on the gear. These are the guys I needed to find, right? Spawns on the dead scab. Yeah. It'll be curious to see. That's uh, true. It does. Oh, eight five five a one, bro. Hell yeah. Dude, mind if I do. Yeah. That's banana bread at work, right there, That's dude. That's banana bread. That is banana that? bread at work, chat. He's got to go back up to the office. The task is being funky. Is that oh, I hate that. News to me. This is that was the task I was saying was acting weird for people earlier this way. Hans, we started at 10.30 Eastern Time. Yeah. 10.35-ish uh, Eastern Time. That was the task I was saying. Uh, so. For people earlier this way. That oh, sucks. Yeah. Oh, did, yeah. Did we yeah. record a start time? No, I forgot to. That was on him, chat. Uh, I would say we're roughly about 30 minutes in. Let me pull up trap on another tab so I don't screw up the feed. I'll go look at his. Oof. I... I don't eat that. Why are we oofing? What's the oof I about? Check the scientist for the key first. I'm 90% sure. I thought I did. Oh, no. I just walked over his body, didn't I? No, I looted it. I hit F on the No, on he the looted bag. it. Yeah. These guys are kidding as hell. All right, chat. We're half an hour in. So 30 minutes ago, so we'll call it 1040 was our start time. Big. So that's uh, that's that's a one forty end time for three hours. Or oh, am I math right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, officially end at two p.m. after we talk and everything. Two a.m. Yeah. Or, yeah. Just said p.m. Oops. Go. 
That his task seems to be bugged on him here. So he's already been upstairs to the scientist's office, but the task isn't recording progress for him. Um, and we've seen this task bug out for a number of people on various different they stages of it. So it's kind of interesting what's going be. on. We're going to check this again, chat, and I'm see if it checks the block. That I think he just has to go back into the office. Did he grab the hard drive or did he just go in there? No, he did grab the hard oh, drive. Oh, I grabbed that. I instinctually like, oh, that's a hundred. Oh, there we go. Boom, saving the mole. Got it. Yeah, right. and I think what it is is you get the. Oh. Uh, yeah. See, now he's gonna grab the hard drive again, even though he already has it. Bro. Yeah. Wow, it, I can't believe it's still that messed up. Yeah, it's it's the door and the hella bored. That's he's crazy. gonna have to do it. I skipped. I skipped the trigger for. Yeah, the so thing. it's gonna. Wow, it, I can't believe it's still that messed up. That's crazy. Oh, Scott, oh. Scott's in front of him. I just realized what happened. So it, it's because it's he went through the window. Unlocked. No, 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 no. So the trigger for the to the task, it's when you through go the through door. the door, right, to mark that you've been up there. And yeah, and then it unlocks the hard drive thing for him to get. Yeah. That seems like a player scab. Bro, I can't see that scab. That's bullshit. Yeah. In the bag. If you don't find the PMCs for in the Wouldn't garage first, cool it breaks out, it. Actually. Yeah. Okay. It's just like all out of order, unfortunately. Yeah, which is real dumb that it's like got such a finite order to it. Wait, I have the fucking key, bro. What? <laughs> what the fuck is that about to do? Maybe we should warn people before they start the challenge. Like, hey, that one task is Ed's bugged as fuck. I'm sorry. Right. And yeah, you I need to do it in order. Oh, I know what I was looting this for. Um, I need uh, first aid stuff. Yeah, you didn't touch one of the one of the bodies downstairs first, so it didn't track. Bugged out for him. That's yeah. fucked, dude. But yeah, I think that is something that we should warn uh people going about forward. going yeah. forward. Yeah, because hey, how are you, Richter? What's up, brother? Good out. to see you. I mean, we tuned it in. Caught us out. Getting better eyes. Mm, that's not how age works, though. You know. Oh, bitch. If you're alive, there's no way. <laughs> I did a little jump peek. Oh, he's got the double barrel. Look okay. at him, chat. One of the things I'm most interested in to to Put watch through all of this is how everybody <laughs> has their own like shit talk that they talk to the scabs, right? We all talk yeah. back to them, right? Oh, and it's brother, so don't, fun don't watching everybody in their own That's unique crazy. brand and That's the shit crazy. that they say back to the scabs, which. It's so funny to me that we all do that. Fucking NPCs that have no merit. They're just pixels, but we all talk shit. We all shit. Yeah, we all, sh yeah, we all yeah. shit talk them. Talk about that, Meg, actually, in this game mode. Oh, God. We need those. He said, I do <laughs> care about that. <laughs> Give it back. Doing something really stupid. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. He's gotten pretty lucky in his loot right now just kind of derping around the map um hello you know being a bit hello. of a goober I yeah did that he quest cleared backwards cleared a couple people off the map no sense so it's mostly just player scabs he's got to worry about and i don't think they show up until a few more like a little bit later i kept thinking it was player scabs he was seeing and they were just ai yeah i honestly don't have a ton of experience on this Wait, map so that's where i need to go actually isn't it yeah, them? we just kind of have the the first roll, you know, ten. I think I've maybe, yeah, I think I've maybe played really ten it. total raids on this map. Yeah, that's got to be a piece, Gav. Uh, yeah, that's definitely not an AI. Could be a PMC. Are you coming up from the underground? I think that's a PMC. Oh, it's over to his left. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's, that's see if, gotta be a player, right? Yeah, it's a player for sure. It just is it a scav or is it a PMC? But he's over here in this parking lot somewhere. Oh, that's him. <laughs> Bonk. Bonk. My first gunfight this wipe happened right here. I killed two PMCs right here. See what I was this is what I was talking about earlier is like the randomness, those oh, those oh, moments yeah. stick with you, they right? Do. Those those hey, engagements, like the first time lost, you get into an engagement in a specific spot on the map, like it just it just sticks into your yeah. brain, right? It's it's wild the way that that works, but mm -hmm. yeah. Could be a heal item right here for him. Nice. No, oh, three what? things of ammo. Is are you fucking with me, brother? We heard him sprinting. Yeah. <laughs> he was running into the wall, and then he ran out of breath. Someone said, nice radar to trap. <laughs> no, he's, they're trolling oh him. It's God. one of his regulars. <laughs> that scared me. 
That's funny. That's funny. Give me med item, please. There he goes. That He's good. Is, there it is. That's three, right? Yep. That's three. Yep. That says hand over, not find. Wait, did it just say hand over medical? Did it say find and raid? It has to be found and raid. Yeah, you back in it. I don't think Traps found any Kappa items. Isn't that a trade right now that I should nope. be like taking? No Kappa items yet. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh, did you ask him to send us screenshots? This is my extract, right? No, I totally forgot to, and he died on the last one yep. that he did. We're good. Yeah, so it's oh. okay. Tarkov veteran doesn't know new map. This one. First time always hurts. Hell yeah, buddy. All right, man, do you mind taking a screenshot? Have you already clicked through the... Celua? There was a Celua there? Yikes. Hell yeah, buddy. What would you like to see? Right, man, do you mind taking um, a screenshot? Just the, like, that kill screen. I made a channel for you, too. I don't know if you can see it in what our Discord. What would you Discord. like to see? Uh, the kill screen and your loot screen would yeah. be ideal. I'm yeah, I like this. So. What? What is my... Uh, if you're PC, okay, I'll definitely. Boom. Oh, that'll work. That was really scary until you said the one. <laughs> <laughs> Alt F4. And Rip. I'm out. Yeah, he's this. gone. He, he um... That's fine, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, can you see the Discord channel I made for you in our look. in our server? Right underneath us, it should say tracking trap HD. You just paste them in there. I think you can see it. Congratulations on your first successful Thanks raid. Thank you. What's it under? I just now got Discord back up. I was talking to my wife. Uh, okay, it's... Uh, no, it, can you see tracking dash trap HD? It's near the top, like right under the channel that we're in. It should be. You should be able to see it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'll let you post it. in there. That's going to be hard to do. I'm going to have to do it. Oh, fuck. How am I going to make this work? Being on a different computer. Uh, How about this? Don't uh, worry about it. Yeah, don't worry about we'll it. Just, it. Just show them and I can get them in the VOD. Yeah, just if you can be conscious not to click through them super quickly. Like, just kind of make yeah. sure you pause a little bit on them. And then I can pull them later. Yeah, and we'll pull it. That's fine. And then, yeah, just show your loot um, when you get back to your stash before you start pulling it off. Sounds good. You got the hard drive baby. and then left without touching the dead PMCs? Yeah. Yeah, great kill on that duo, dude. Level 20, camping in the... In the Quest room with his level three if he buddy. Was the first guy I dropped or the second guy? I think he was the first one. That's that's hilarious. It felt like he Vice dropped Versa, him first. That yeah. Been a problem. And that's, Vice that's versa. A... That probably would have been an issue. Yep. You iced him though. Yeah, it was a clean shot. It's a bummer you got caught out by the uh, order the of operations bug. Yeah. I can't believe they haven't fixed that shit yet. It's been like that all way. Yeah, so apparently you have to hit the uh, bodies downstairs first, first yeah. or it will trigger it all out of order. Thank you. That's perfect. Interesting. Perusing through them tasks. Oh, I got the I completed the quest. Heck yeah! Okay. Hell I'm, yeah! I'm glad it, that it retroactively fixed itself. They did fix it then. Oh, that's two quests complete so far. Yeah. Hell yeah! We'll have his stats at the end. It'll tell that's us true. that. That one will get tracked. Mm -hmm. Sorry about the ads, chat. We can't avoid them. They they come sometimes. Oh, we got the mows in. Hell yeah. The great equalizer. It worked out as good. Yeah, that's why well, they must have fixed it to like maybe not visually update, but at least on the back end figure it out. Like, oh hey, they got out with the hard drive. That means they did everything. Yeah. I touch the bodies, you they have the hard drive. Like jokingly talking about melee kills. It's like, how can I make that a thing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> dude, if you can make it happen, dude, make it happen. I'm I'm here for it. 
I was just, I, you got the shovel, <laughs> right? You know, I just, I wanted it to be very to open, go? right? Well, play Tarkov how you want to play Tarkov. If you want to meme around and, and try to smack people with a shovel for three hours, do that. Who cares? Right. I, it, it's supposed to be fun, right? You know, it, the idea is to bring the community together, right? Mm-hmm. If you want to get sweaty, get sweaty. If you don't, don't, you know what I mean? Yeah. Take that Here first labs is. card you find, send it, go zero to hero labs. You know, I don't care. Like, let's yeah. have fun with it. Right. That is the opposite of fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hey, we you have know, different you definitions know. of fun. You know, you know. <laughs> As it we turns out, <laughs> I, I don't have that muscle actually. All right, so now we got a little bit of juice here. What are you? What are you feeling for this next raid? Are you gonna just go straight into that nice M4 that you picked up, or? Uh... No, no, I'm gonna work my way up to a kitted PP19, hopefully at some point. Okay, Hell yeah. Right. You got the grip on that bad boy now. Yeah, now you got that. that uh, I was we love to say, some grip, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, get I the grip on it. <laughs> <laughs> that is not the right word. It's the right prefix, but not the right word. You are a goober, Katie. <laughs> I'm so good at this. Professional. We love it. So professional. Anyway, the uh, grip. Here's the question. is: Do we send it back into ground zero, right? Because we still have the paid extract there. Oh, you got to do the car, right? Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I can go to Woods. Woods sounds a lot more actually. Yeah, uh, so you also have your Salewas uh, to think about. Let's see, what else is Oop. something to think about that Ground Zero might be beneficial for? Is that good? Is that a good map for that? I insured things. I'm dumb. Which map? Uh, Ground Zero for Salewas. I, I, yeah, I yeah. think you find a lot of them on that map. A lot of the early loot that you need for tasks, I've noticed, they seems seem to have to higher spawn, spawn rates good. on yeah. on Ground Zero. Yeah, both as a scab makes... and a PMC. Yeah, the underground area we'll is pretty there, juiced. Though. Good stuff. Of what? Yeah, oh, it's like the, the scabs you kill seem to have like mostly dead Soleil was on them and stuff like that, which is all you need, right? It doesn't matter if it only has twenty seven on it. Almost went to streets. Do it. Send it. All right. While well, I'm loaded into this, I got to step away and go use the bathroom real quick. I apologize. Beer B. I think this is a great uh, ad time. So. I think ads just ran not that long ago. So we're oh, okay. chilling on ads. All right. Well, welcome back from ads, everybody. Uh, Luau just stepped away. He's uh, got to use a bio break. Oops. Ooh, so sorry. You I, said Luau. I did say Luau. I read him in Traps chat as I left to my right. It's that thing where your brain just like spits just out what you're looking words out. In. Yep. Oopsie poopsie. Uh, trap. Sorry, sorry. Just stepped away. Uh, he will be right back. We are about mm, 30, 40 minutes into, yeah, my bloopers. The Katie bloopers. Imagine. Yeah, imagine. imagine. I'm so professional. I'm so good at this, you guys. I'm going to so refill so my drink too while, while we're chilling. Yeah. You need anything? Um, A snack. A snack? A snicky snack. I don't know what that is. He'll figure it out. But yeah, I hope you guys are having a good time. Uh, if you have any questions that you want us to ask Trap, please let us know, and we will ask them. Um, but yeah, we're just kind of vibing out, having a good time. Uh, he's had one successful raid so far. Um, he was pretty juiced, actually. Just dropped two PMCs. Um, got quite a few tasks done. So, you know, it's it's looking pretty good uh, for, for Trap out the gate. He's already level four. So we're having a good time. What's this challenge? Mid nineties. So this challenge, it's uh, what, what we call the the loot sack challenge, which is just the shooty loots presents the standard account challenge. Um, and so we have Trap here with us today, and we did a short little interview at the beginning. You know, asked him, yeah, what started his content creation journey. You know, what got him into Tarkov, how long he's been playing Tarkov, things like that. Um, so if you wanted to watch that vod or the video that'll go up on YouTube a little bit later, you can see that in a little bit. Um, but what it is is right now he's got three hours on a standard account, right? Uh, not Edge of Darkness or anything like that. And he's just playing Tarkov. So it's kind of really open-ended in the sense that we wanted people to just have fun with it. Um, and we'll be creating leaderboards based off of various stats. So your XP, your level, your PMC kills, the loot experience that you had on the account. Just things like that, things that we genuinely look at to see like how a particular person may play Tarkov. Oh, oops. Looks like we have Trap back. Heck yes. He does not like his spawn, though. Doggies. Perfect. Thank you, baby. Okay, Jack. 
Uh, we're going to break it down by episode. Break each person's run down Do oh, into status? episodes. No, no, it'll be one big video for each person. Yeah, and we'll edit some of the dead air out, I think. I'm going to go through and I'm going to kind of clean them up now? a little bit. Yeah, it'll be a highlight for each person. It's not going to be three-hour video of just we're their entire run Fuck from start to Bad finish. Bad time to test it, but we're How do you be it. to be a part of this challenge? Mid-90, can you please reach directly out to Zane? And DM, DM him me. right now. Um, and we can make that happen. And thank you so much for your interest in that. If you have anybody else that would be interested, uh, please let us know. That's um, true. Mm -hmm. It's it's our 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 way of getting to know the Tarkov community and, and our, everybody's and the welcome. other content creators that are in our space. So this is definitely not gatekeeps in any way, shape, or form. Yeah, no size. You just got to be able to stream on Twitch so that I can capture it, mm -hmm. and potentially maybe other platforms. We just haven't gotten to the point where we're ready to support that yet. Someone's coming from that way, guys. Yeah, the so pop can... is real. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Minetti, I got you. Uh, you can through our. Are you on our Discord? Join the oh. Discord. Yeah, and then you should be able to DM me, no problem. What, baby? Oh, get off. Don't get back on it. I don't want to ground you. <laughs> High five. Let's see if this counts. Don't I'm get back curious. on it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure this does count. I think he's trying to see if a run through still counts, and I'm pretty sure it does. I think it does. I have a strong feeling this doesn't count. I think it is does. It's a super the like competitive one to do. Yeah. I just want to see. I I'm pretty sure it counts. And I get you just off that map, which is nice. Oh, I gotta go back eventually for wine, but definitely. oh, it's true, true. Boom. Yeah. So Lou Alboy brought up a good point. Uh, when he was learning the map, testing it. He extracted from that map using uh, offline. Like he was like, let me try, let me go find the car and do it in an offline. And the offline counted for his quest. Did it really? Oh wow, that's yep. wild. That's an interesting bug that I'm curious to see if they patch. I could have tested it, but that one's a little, eh, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, do we have extra ammo? Going to woods. Max scav rep and mid ninety. We'll we'll sync up uh, tomorrow. Probably I'll have some time and we'll we'll nail it out. But I'm in. Let's get you on here and it'll be fun. Get a chance to get a chance to meet you. We'll, we'll have a chat. We'll play some games. Heck yeah. Uh, it'll be a good time. Good night, I'm twisted. Good night. During... Good night, buddy. Okay. You be lurking. I appreciate it, dude. Get some rest. I know work's been really really crazy for you lately, buddy. Yeah, chat. That uh, that goes for a lot of you guys. If you're interested in the challenge, please reach out. Let us know. What were we saying? Oh, sorry. I just realized I was open micing you. Uh, but it goes for your chat as well. If anybody is interested in participating in the challenge, please reach out to us. Let us know. We are definitely looking for more people to participate, uh, share their views. You know, share who they are with us. Right? Just get to know the community. I'm um, outperform me. <laughs> but you can't be trapped. That's the rule. Yeah, you can't be trapped. That's illegal. <laughs> Veronica, you, it's an open invite, babe. You Veronica, let's get you it? in. Let's Go do on. it. I was just reaching out to some people that I knew I'd talked to about it and they were aware of it, and I knew it would be in to do kind of like the first couple episodes because I wasn't sure if anybody would even like it. it yeah, so we, we kind of had If you guys are a... enjoying it and you, and you want to get in, let's do it. Let's figure out a day. Uh, we had two... Uh... Juggle our own rejection sensitivity with True. like talking to everybody about it, right? Because you know, what if we came to you guys and you guys were like, "No, I don't no, that sounds that. dumb. I don't want to do that," right? Yeah. Uh, so, well, that's the fun part too, Veronica. Right? It's a fresh account. There's yeah. nothing to lose, right? It all goes. It's all going to get reset at the end of it. You, you know, we're, everybody starts on a fresh account. You're not going to be playing with any something that like somebody else's lost gear or made rubles or whatever. It's right. always starting from the same. And in three hours, you're not going to care about it anymore. <laughs> right. So. So full send it, and then yeah, if, full send it. If you're naked for a half an hour, who cares, right? Right, or it's, even it's two about hours, fun, right? You know, it's mm -hmm. it's how you want to play Tarkov too. Like I said, you know, you can come into this and you can decide I'm gonna go naked hatchet man for the entire three hours and see what happens. Yes, we do provide. It's the, the time account, for the Jaeger note, brother. We do provide yeah. the account. Oh yeah, maybe some no. Salewas. Maybe oh yeah, There's some some good Salewas like spawns on woods. That's usually where I get them. Um, yeah, the the medical.
Yeah. No, yeah, no sight yet on the. Have you tried? Because is there not a mount that you can put a sight on the PP19 early on? Because I know you can get that little like Walth or MRS sight, right? I appreciate I'm that. I'm almost coming idea. into this with the mindset of like borderline hardcore to where I just like operate off of what I have. Bare minimum. On the ignite and what I come out. Right. Yeah. Just keep the same kit rolling instead of adding more to lose. We actually already have two accounts in rotation. I appreciate that offer. Um, but you guys have already paid for that as a community. Um, mm -hmm. That was that was your guys' well, for that you one. helped pay Talking for Talking to Lou Owlboy uh, about that doing a rogue farm. Like, once I get, like, a decent optic, the accounts. go do a nighttime mm -hmm. rogue farm. On, on get the uh, XP. Yeah. Yeah. Well, That'd be a good Lou. way to jump up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <gasps> yeah, it's dash value for sure. Stack, oh, wow. Right? That's crazy. It started shadow. off with, like, an MDR with a, with a red dot. I probably would have went that way. Oh, it's a good point. You know, that's one of the things that really changes the early game. It's hard yeah, to do but... rogues early game as a bear because you need the like, you don't need NVGs, yeah. but it definitely makes life a lot easier. Well, yeah, any any type of optic, you know, that's that's got a zoom on it too is nice because you know you can't really see them mm -hmm. before they see you, especially right. as a bear. Good luck, buddy. Two Iron sight was right. You got this. Go steal Turtle. some man's oh, Mosin. Go get them Timmies. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, he spawned down by the village chat. He's out in the field. Thank you. You should be next point. Not sure if it I still exists, TV but chat. you could wait two weeks into a wipe if you did it right and start your wipe exactly where you ended the last wipe. That's, what? That's How does that even happen? Exploit, dude. How does that even happen, bro? That's crazy. <laughs> that's fucking stupid. Dude, what, what is that? Yeah. Yeah. We'll give a shit about nothing. Dude, Woods, though, in the encoding through Twitch, Woods always looks so terrible because of all the grass. Shane, you really Twi doing this? Twitch just can barely handle it. Got to be careful. So one of the interesting things about Woods is I think it has Holy some of the yeah, best bro, spawns you uh, for most of the maps. A lot of the spawns, you're actually relatively far enough yeah. away from other players where you can you make some fun. movement before you're immediately in sight line yeah, of another player. Line, dude, so they can re this is a bit of a bold also, statement, you talk but I think Woods is my favorite map. Is it? Stream. Yeah. It's a good I map. Really, I really like Brian, it there. I, 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 know you don't I feel like Twitch, when I die on Woods, it, it, it was a, a fair fight. It's more likely due to your own mistakes, like positioning, or you didn't see him or something like that. I just, I got caught out. I didn't look to see if I got network latency. Right. I, it's... It's rare that I feel like I got but straight that's ratted not true. That's on not woods, true, right? Like, like I know it's a sniper map, but yeah. like, just it having just a, a it doesn't talk about queso feel last that night. Way. You know yeah. what I mean? Um, you know, um, who and else? like you we said, the spawns are, are spread was, out, so you know, it, like unlike shoreline or lighthouse, you're not dying mm -hmm. thirty seconds into the. Rain. I think one of the things that Woods also has really going for it is that the audio isn't fucked here because you don't have to worry about. Um. Like the verticality issues oh, that like see, streets see, and interchange and like other maps deal with. Right, you know, shore, shoreline with the resort and things like that. Mm. Bonked that sniper scab. Do you think he's gonna I go take that splints, sniper? Guys. Do we risk it? He's got to, right? Fuck. I don't want to risk it. I'm risking it. He's gonna. Is he gonna break the legs? He's really lightweight. He might be able to get away with this without oh, breaking no. his leggies. He spit oh, to do a little parkour. <gasps> A little parkour action. There's a little gold chain. I'm so broken blown. Look at his face. Leg. He's blown away. <laughs> Two his... gold chains, bro. <laughs> Put them things in your oh, ass. Shit. But his face just went from shocked at the fact that he didn't break his legs to shocked <laughs> that there was a gold chain to just <laughs> bewildered <laughs> me. <that> there was <laughs> a second. <laughs> like, he's juicing. He just went through so I'll many emotions in like five <laughs> seconds. <laughs> Think he's going to check the bunker? He's got a flashlight. Yeah, I mean, I would, going. right? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Bitcoin. Butt coin. Come on. Come on, butt coin. It's a hidden stat. Nothing. Is it? Oh, I haven't seen an update on any of the cheat forms you watch, and they've scrubbed all public mention of the Ground Zero high level exploits. So I'm not sure where that exploit sits Hell still. No. Jesus. My ears are far more important than that. Did he fall down here? No. Oh, Man just crumpled right where Trap dropped him, dude. Yeah, he did. He's got an SVD. <laughs> <laughs> dude, He's scoped boy. SVDS. Oh, <laughs> what a come up, dude. Hell that is yeah. a, the ridiculous optic, though, but that is a huge come up. SVDS feels a little weird, this wipe. Um, it feels really similar to how it felt last wipe, which makes it feel weird in the context of the current recoil system. I was just about to say that that's strange to hear because it should be drastically different compared mm -hmm. to the recoil of last wipe. Mm-hmm. 
is a about nice to blast somebody. He <laughs> <laughs> got it's that a, blat on him, you. dude. He's ready to mess up somebody's day. I'm about to take this thing and go kill Sturmy. So Walk out of here with a fucking red rebel. <laughs> right, <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we didn't even put boss kills on the... Oh, uh, that's yeah, yeah, that'll get tracked on his end sheet as well. I gotta set the fuck up, dude. But it'll do the job. It's actually quite the opposite of great. Is he gonna go for Sturmy for dad? That's the question. I mean you gotta Imagine if you see him, right? Him. Right, I feel like you gotta send it for him. You gotta try, right? I mean, especially if you've got that S V D S on you. Like right. You actually have a shot of seeing him before he sees you. You go mm. for it. I think I need to get more sleep, yo. It's, it, with this being the standard, like with the challenge, right? He doesn't have the benefit of like insurance, oh, so there's no there? like, let's just throw this on the ground, yeah. right? Because and then I don't have, I can go in no, no risk. I'm only using the loot I found in raid. Like everything's at risk the all the time, students. which I think changes how you approach some of the stuff in this. In yeah. Yeah. Shadow, I agree with that. I think we might include it with I'm lost. Uh, boss. I don't think it's. I don't think it's like something that we'll keep track of as like a actually like one of the main leaderboards, oh, it's like a, it's but a, it's a something to keep track of, right? Like, like, hey, you know, someone someone managed to kill yeah. like three bosses. Like, that's crazy. That's the most that anybody's seen in the three hours. So, um, I think everything is RNG, right? So that's why we want to kind of track a lot of stuff and then kind of nail down like what are the more compelling leaderboards that people are the most interested in seeing and then we'll still have the other stats as like something fun to talk about right yeah i think next week a really big part of the discussion at the end of it will be like what do you guys care about as far as the comparison right like Easy boss. what mm -hmm. do you want to see how well Rao did versus how well tracked like it and mm -hmm. those Cheese? answers right what you guys tell no. us what's up giggle the mind is fucking business thank you so much we don't much, even have giggle. a grizzly bro don't even have a grizzly. The anxious. Jesus fucking Christ. JFC. Traps chat is giving him some shit right now. Yeah, they are. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun to see. You guys can, hey, I'm glad they're keeping it up, fun for engagement. I appreciate the fuck out of you guys. I know you are yapping. Giggle, how's it going, buddy? How are you? How's everybody's Thursday going? It feels like a Friday. But so fun fact, guys, is, we're having this little party right now. It's a Friday vibe screen, to tonight. Shoulder. And also, when you ADS, look at this. Size of my scope. Size of my scope. That's an interesting oh. tip. Uh, wow, yeah. I think he's still alive. Dude, Sermon's still alive. Trash about to get somewhere. fucking smoked. It is Friday somewhere. It's, well, it's I mean, Friday it's... in 23 minutes. I was just about to say that. Oh, who's this grease ball? I die here. He's I die here and he goes <laughs> <loose> anyway. <laughs> I love it. At least he's aware. Okay. He's very okay. self aware. <laughs> I see you, big boy. Traps just looting up. I love to see it. Alright. Oh hmm. I just thought I of a fun Shane thing. Shane that is just seeding out the fucking mouth for all of us. I don't know if I want to say it out loud right now. It might be something that I sh found. like share with oh, you. I'm in the middle okay. of the shit right now. I'm in the middle of the shit. <laughs> and Os that fucking Osprey, bro. What the fuck? How, what? How is Trap alive right now? <laughs> that thing's got to be no plates, right? How much room does that take? Damn. That thing's got to be no plates. Oh, it's got plates in it. What the fuck, Sleep. bro? <laughs> what is this, dude? <laughs> what? In the come up. Trap. And we leave. Just stumbled upon a tier four rig in the grass. Oh, GG's. <laughs> uh, that's my yeah, paid actors, guys. shiny on the ground over here. <laughs> stumbled upon a tier four rig in the grass. GG's. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's my paid actors, guys. <laughs> what a champion. Uh, I've seen everything's good. Everything's going good. Look at him. He's crawling, bro. Crawling. There's something shiny on the ground in front of there's a There's a prep it's chat back. in the secret, or you can DM it to me, Katie, whichever. Mm -hmm. it, it, what, there's just a trail Bruh. of loot. Okay, what is happening? <laughs> 
say it ain't so. There's he just found some NPGs. What? He needs a helmet championing. <laughs> <laughs> Brother, what? Why is he ditching gear there? There's a dead player right here. Has I found to be. Ditch from gear Sturmy. already. What is that? Why is he ditching oh gear? That God. is. I found ditch gear already. What is that? Uh, All right, which fun, which one of traps fucking community people just went in there and <laughs> threw stuff on the ground? We don't extract here. What's a trap, Shadow? This what did I ask you? The, no, no, the the we stuff that traps extract. finding, like all oh, the loot, yeah. just like it's like a trail of loot leading him to like a box with a stick. Yeah. Is what it feels right? like. Yeah, like you got to fucking get like Wiley e. Coyote, dude. Get a freaking piano dropped on your head. Right. <laughs> Chat was worried you were walking into some sort of like Acme level trap. Oh, absolutely. That's, 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 that's <laughs> like a trail of loot. Get Wiley e. Coyote. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, absolutely. That's, you got TK'd while you're looting a BMZ. Right what, bro? Hans, I, I, I have oh nothing. God. I can't say shit, dude. That's crazy, dude. Look at trap. Trap's if going if for more fighting right here. Oh god. Oh, piece oh my god. Of he's got NVGs on. What the fuck? Brother. Is that a guard? Oh. This is it's a guard. Gotta be. It's got to be a guard. They had MVGs. That's a guard. Yeah. Someone killed Sturman, oh, got no. the key, and ran, and, and Trap's oh, no, just the looting bomb. the leftovers, bro. That's crazy. <gasps> oh, Someone's oh. here. They're creeping. Man, he's come down here to get his loot, and Trap's already took it all. <laughs> Ooh, a piece of candy. Ooh. Yeah. Come into the van, little Timmy. <laughs> <laughs> no trap. Right I say in my normal voice. Yeah, Trap's got a player near him. Where's Trap's backpack? What do you do with it? I think it's on him. No, no, no. He just swapped it. Oh, it's a scab. Oh, it's a scab. Oh, this is bold, dude. It's just a scab. Yeet. Bonked him. <laughs> Fuck up out of here. Oh, he dropped it. There it, it. is. <laughs> Look at all this loot, bro. Yeah, what? <laughs> oh, what? He doesn't even know what to do with it all. <laughs> he can't reload anything right now, dude. Mm. I love the deliberation. This He's man's thinking. just like in a pile of bodies. <laughs> I'd, be, I'd be panicked <laughs> to death right yeah. now. Let's go see if we can I'd be like, oh my god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. How sick would that be? Dude, Trap's, trap's setting uh, quite the pace him, here with these raids. Yeah, he is. <laughs> I'm impressed. There. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm, I'm quite impressed right now. It is not easy to... Uh, yeah, probably. And this is mid-wipe. It's not like we're at the very beginning and everybody's running. Like, there's dudes, yeah. juicers running around. Yeah, I mean, his his first raid, he died, but he came out with PMC kill. He, he freaking swacked that first dude, folded him. I got you, Shadow. Yeah, I mean, they, they Sorry we haven't been in there much lately. We've been super busy. Them. I haven't even, I haven't played Tarkov in three days. Today, I, I ran one Prime scav raid with Uni Look at this. Look at um, this. during my lunch break. I haven't played anything since last Saturday, Sunday. Is that Jeremy? <laughs> I would have got an achievement right on this account. His face. He wasn't sure if that was Sturman or not. No flash drives? There's no achievements on this account? Locust, first time? Okay, yeah, we're good. I'm nuts with that admin he killed Sturman. I think I, I think a player blown. already killed Sturman. I'd have been blown the fuck away if he just, like, looked through yeah. his scope and so went, oh, and tapped Sturman. Yeah, no, a player, a player killed Sturman and, like, spread some loot just, like, randomly around from his duo it. that died and then got the hell out of there. Right. Oh, he, we're so thick. We're crawling, Chad. Yeah, dude, he's 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 worm and he's a slippery, sneaky snake. You, you know, the one time I had the audacity to do this in raid, I got fucking clapped <laughs> trying to get out, dude. <laughs> Somebody spotted me crawling <laughs> almost the extract and fucking hit me with the stank rat giggle and went <laughs> and, <laughs> and fucking and then boop. bonked you. <laughs> that do be happening. I ain't. What is this going to lie to you? What is, what is what? Wouldn't that be I'm some afraid. shit to like I'd look over here and there'd be people? Trap know. even see through that? That's crazy. I don't give a shit. It's part of the game at this point, dude. 
something you got to defeat. You know what I mean? Look at all that stuff, dude. Yeah, seriously. Oh, you know he what is, I could he, do? This is a I'm big dumb. come up if he can get out of this raid. Save one slot, guys. Save one slot. We need a <laughs> hey, it's worth it. Where's my Dolbos 2 in my Early profile? raid, man. You save every space you can get. <laughs> Look at how thick he is, bro. Yeah. <laughs> He's got after the heavy G's on. Challenge, we're going to log back into the main account, and we're going to go get the... Uh, the body for. I gotta go to. Sh I gotta go to lighthouse, and find a himbo <laughs> thick, thick dude. Spawn dude. fucking bullshit thing. Yeah, he's he is th thick with many C's. Not Ideally, even just right, two. I should be many. like flowing in and out of these. Interpret that how you want. Out, but it's not gonna happen that way. One oh, P nine the action, right there, dude. Ooh. Come on, man. Are you what's saying? he gonna? Sa what's he sacrificing? Yeah, what's he sacking? Nothing. He's leaving it behind. Oh. One good thing. Is very All the higher tier right production that you put up only speeds up your crafting time. Unless you ask you for it, you it, can't it, produce anything beyond what you unlock. Jeez. That's dope. It doesn't like okay. magically open things. It's just that's cool. Makes it a little quicker. All right, chat, we're through the first hour of the challenge. Trap is about to finish a thick-as-fuck raid. Uh, is here that's a, been a part of the community for a while and remembers the War Thunder streams. We will be going back to playing some War Thunder on stream. We've been playing a lot of it off stream the last couple of days because an event came out, but we will be back to playing that. Trust me. I don't even feel like going prone again, dude. Just get me out of the fucking raid, brother. <laughs> I feel that sometimes, dude. He was like, let me the fuck out of here. Seriously. Oh, he's got oh. scabs over there, too. Was that a fucking laser? Oh. I don't know if I would have. Oh. I didn't see it. Chad, did you see a laser? I don't know, bro. I'm scared for him now. I'm, I'm terrified for him right now. Oh, that's. that's. Was that a player? Yeah. Bitch. Ooh. Bitch. <laughs> I was hesitant. I was about to be like, that's a player, but I was like, mm, oh, if dude, I'm wrong, I'm going to look like an idiot. What a raid, bro. Oh, my God. The come up. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thick, dude. That's fine. That, that speed thick. was fine. It doesn't need to be super, super long. Just long enough that I can, like, look at it if, if I've got to go back through. Appreciate it, homie. And the, the PMC almost get you there at the end, dude. That was nerve-wracking as hell. That's... That's the avenue you took is that he almost got me. He's lucky I actually. <laughs> yeah. That's true. I mean, I took it oh, from the yeah. perspective of you were thick and crawling. And so if had, that had true. been me, that would have been the perspective that my brain was at. It was just like pure panic. Like, oh, my God. That he heard me shoot at that scav and still was like, I'm going to run over that one. Right. <laughs> it was kind of weird. He ran right at you. He was like, is that Sturman? That yeah. <laughs> What's Sturman doing over here? Yeah. <laughs> Well, I think that's what ha I think, uh, uh, like a duo killed Sturman and the guards, right? And then the one guy yeah. must have died because you found a bunch of ditched PMC gear. God damn, dude! Can you make this a God damn. Oh yeah, yeah. I I would have been so nervous. Yeah, chat's you know saying it only takes one lucky shot for you to get folded. True. Right. That's that's kind of where my brain was at. Was... I see where Chat's head is at. <laughs> yeah, dude. Where's the no faith? faith? You know, where's yeah. the faith? I just, you know, I, I got that panic potato brain. You know what I mean? As soon as shit starts to get a little, little on the sussy, the the sweaty side, I'm like, oof, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die. I'm in danger. <laughs> that's Fifty six point one on Ooh, that. Look at that Osprey, dude! Oh my god! Oh, I need yeesh. I don't even have what room for all of that right now, dude. Nope. Let's go through here real quick. Uh, who does this introduction? Boom, uh, baby! Just cruising through the tasks. Yeah, we are. Damn. Uh, just so you know, you're about an hour in. And doing so very well. Even got, the, got one of the nudes already. Right, dude? 
You're just yeah, cruising through nudes. some of these. We do love casts. nudes around these parts. I agree. I can't remember if I can take the fucking sell those yet or not. I'm not making it to the keck tape. No, I don't think. No, I don't think I don't you'll think make so. it that far. I think that's a realistic uh, expectation: is that you won't make it that far. The armpit be weak. Mm hmm. That will help. Hopefully, bring her back in, Shadow. We can get back on there soon. Did, did you guys see the new Grand Blue game that came out? That game looks, that looks fun. Very Extract. good. It's like it got recommended to me because of Monster Hunter, Elden Ring, and Final Fantasy fourteen. And I'm like, ooh. I, I love could all of them. I could play the fuck out of whatever that is. Yeah. Whatever whatever what whatever, whatever is. that is, I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play the <laughs> shit out of it. I'm taking your nudes. Those are private. All right, dude. Now what's the plan? Talk us through it. I guess you got I talking about. It. I was like, do I go you, to the lighthouse now? Yeah, you got the NVG. You got the scope. Is it time? Maybe. Oh, you got that last shotgun for debut Let's... too, don't you? Yeah. Do I chase down? No. We don't. We need to eat, drink, and then get to lighthouse. Hell yeah! I think this is where we're really going to start to see diverging paths for people. Mm -hmm. Right? Is after the first couple of tasks on Ground Zero are done, do they decide to diverge off of Ground Zero and go on to other maps? Like, what's what's the play there? Oh, this is absolutely where. I die as well. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, you're going to well, Lighthouse. Like, of I, I want to see, like, who's going to be the first person to go labs during uh, this. That'd be really right? fun. Yeah, yeah, the first person to just pull a labs card on and, their, their scab. And, and be like, oh, it's happening. I'm going. Yeah. Why do I think it's going to be sick if Sick does it? Like, I, I think I think Trap would go. I think I think Rao would go. I think a lot of people would go. It'll just be like, who gets the yeah, labs yeah. card, right? Yeah. And then, like, who's going to be like, yeah, let's go to fucking or labs. fucking send it. A lot out. of it also depends on, like, what are you looking to do? Are you trying to farm rogues or, or what? Right. Because I've, I don't know if you guys have played a mu uh, much labs this wipe. It feels different, dude. Like I've, maybe it's my positioning or whatever. Like I was, it's not easy. I haven't been yet this, this wipe. I haven't been this wipe either. I'm not a big Agreed, labs Shadow. either. Agreed, Shadow. Sick will go immediately. Uh, so it's, that one's, that one's a difficult one for me to, you know, even comment on as, as like a. Right. Um. Wow. Shoutcaster, right? Um, labs is labs happened. is wild. The rotations are different. The pace is different. The people that play it are like their their goals and like what they're looking for are for the most part are very different from like the rest of the player base. Right, right. It's it's a PvP map. It feels like you know an end game map. Very sweaty. Yeah. Yeah, and like going to this map, right? So I know enough about this shit hole of a map that like I can spawn and get a pick in the in the matter of like. Two, within two minutes. Lighthouse and Reserve are the yeah. worst ones for those types of spawns. Oh, yeah. Just yeah. like right off spawn being able to get a guy. It's actually one of the things that I don't like uh, particularly about those maps, right? Because as a, a newer True, player no. um, I don't have all of those spawns memorized the same way that you do for instance, right? And so I'm usually the victim of that 30 second pick yeah. off of Lighthouse or, or Reserve yeah. or something like I've, that. I've, lighthouse, I've killed people within five seconds of the raid. Yeah. Like spawn in, turn around, there's a guy, boom, he's boom. done. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. And I'm sitting here open like, man, I hope I get that spawn. I hope I get that spawn. Right? Yeah, yeah, you're over here like, man, I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking get him. And dude. what's crazy about that one is you, you don't want the one that's closest to the road camp, you want the second closest one so that you can spot the guy that spawns there, smoke him, or clear it, and then go fight the rogues, right? Yeah. I'll take either. I don't give a shit. True. It's just I think the 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 other one's the better of the two. Yeah. From that one, sometimes, especially because how everybody pushes to building three nowadays, sometimes when I spawn there after I clear it, I'll go and I'll lay on the ledge overlooking the, the village. Yeah. I've they killed also, tons of people they, to swipe that way. Yeah, they also patched, like, the, the rogue farm, too, so that's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can't just you walk into building three and get them all. Door. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah that, that's lame. Do you see the one where you, they figured out you could do it through the locked door that was in there, and then the rogue's AI wouldn't even go in the door? I did see that. Yeah, if you unlock the door, I you go thought, in there and then you yeah. shut the door. They, they'll open it, but they will never go through oh, the threshold. Are you talking like operating room? Not operating room. There's a building. It's the, room, I think I it's it no, no, no. It's the uh, USEC barracks key. Okay. It's a locked room in building three on the first floor. So oh, when I, you're, I have that key. I've never used it. Yeah, the loot in there is not that great, but what people figure it out is that the rogue AI it doesn't know how to go into rooms that are locked. Like their pathing won't take them in there. So you go there, you unlock the door, and you close it, and you go in there, and there's cover, which a lot of the other rooms don't have. 
That's so some even, Westworld type of program. Yeah. So even yeah. even when they open the door, they'll go up and they'll open it, and then they'll just stand there and they'll walk away. Like they won't even try to go yeah. in. Yeah, it's like the room doesn't really exist for their mapping or some shit like that. Sorry, Mars. All the sound alerts and stuff are turned off for yep. the challenge. You guys, I, so it's I good to see you, buddy. How are you? Uh, me and Grim were talking about Loot Fest. That's what, yeah. this month or next month? This month. That is this month, yeah. It's the end of this Crazy. month. Yeah, yeah so. Uh, I'm getting stationed in Texas in, this summer, so. Are you? Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, I remember we were talking about a year ago that you were wondering where your next set of orders were going to be. Yeah. I got so they one pick, so. Oh, oh that's where you wanted to, to be. I ask you if this was a place oh, that yeah. you wanted to be, or if you're kind of relocating. Are you, of, you know, are you changing yeah, roles stuff. too? Does this get you out of the recruiting stuff, or are you still gonna be doing that? Uh, I'll be in charge of a recruiting station. Okay. Okay. So, and then hopefully I'll a little less of the army from that point because I don't. I'm not really interested in continuing that. past that. Yeah, the geopolitical stuff that's going on. You know, it's just not really where right. I want to be. True. True. <sighs> What part of Texas are you going to end up in if you don't? If... Eastern Texas. So I'll be about, okay. I think it's about two hours away from Dallas. Okay. Yeah, this is where we're going to be in Dallas, Fort Worth. Uh, yeah. It'll be, yeah, I'll be in Texas. But you said summer, right? So that's not going to be until June, later this yeah. year. June, yeah. July. Yeah. yeah, so. Uh, that's going to be crazy, man. Yeah, that's going to be a heck of a move. It's two, I'll, be, I'll be about two hours away from my hometown as well. So, oh, that'll be dope. And that was really the nice. whole purpose because we've, I've been in the Army for, how long have I been? Active? Twelve years. Been active for almost twelve years. Being able, like, I've only gone home. I've probably yeah. spent three weeks at home in twelve years. Oh, oh wow. damn! That's yeah. That's not. Do you still have a lot of family back there? Yeah, and oh, yes, so that'll be nice. I, okay. I've never been really <laughs> close to my family. Like I've been. It's all about me and my wife. And sure. So you family. just you you want to be back oh, in that area is what you're kind of hoping for. Yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, this is a see. So talking about terrible spawns. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> Willed it into existence. Good luck, brother. Believe in you. So talking about terrible Let's spawns. See how well he does with this chat. I yeah. yep. hate this map. It into I'm luck, gonna be honest brother. with you. Um, it has been very brutal to me. This wipe. It's a Go brutal chat. map. So we're in between yeah. a lot of teams. Right I mean, now we've I we've gone lighthouse before. That, right? that, that be spawn that right trap got is one of the worst spawns. Uh huh. Hundred percent. Because there's somebody already waiting on the other side of this. Oh, I'm sorry, room. trap. I'm open my key. That, that, that spawn good, that trap got is one of the worst spawns. Hearing my own voice come back through the stream. That's helpful. <laughs> yeah, because there's good, definitely brother. somebody already peeking this ledge. They could be, him. right? Or they spawn there and they head straight to the road camp, right? Yeah. <clears throat> or they spawn there and they meet him trying to climb up that mountain and they fight at the base of it, like. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, and I, we've we've had people spawn at the one right where he's looking at right now, and turn around and come back towards you for the because right. they know that you spawned there. Right. So. Right. The three lane map, which is good for a comp shooter, bad for extract survival. This is this wouldn't even be a good comp map. Yeah, yeah. I it's just poor map design. <laughs> honestly, it's it's. There needs to be equally enticing P POIs on either side for it to be a better. That's like like that's what it needs. Yeah. The, the, the POIs get progressively more interesting the further from one side of the map to the other you get. It's like this gradient spectrum, which just makes the map not fun to play. And then the spawns are bad on top of it, which makes the combat on the map not that fun. Yeah. Um, well, and a lot of the, the points of interest are at the oh lowest points of the map, too. And so you're just at risk of getting clapped. I at feel all. Yeah. like... Because I did a whole day of it, essentially, to get a quest done for Lightkeeper. This map has so much verticality to it. And, uh, it's, I love this little opens. spot. But that's, I think it's more. I didn't know that base, existed. Honestly. I went to the wrong Now I'm going to have to start looking there. I love this little right, spot. We break anything. We're good. Hardcore place. So yeah. good. I mean, I. <gasps> oh, he broke oh, his legs. Fuck out oh, of no. Me, oh, no. Oopsie oh, no. Oopsie poopsie chat. Oh, and he doesn't have a splint. This might be a reset. Oh, no. Yeah, you might have to reset this one. I took my fucking splints out. Why did that uh, break my legs? We're gonna try and kill a scab here, I think. God damn, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, we I got them broke legs, right dude. All in it. Oh, no. Oh, damn. Miss Timbo leg. <laughs> you got them weak ankles, <laughs> dude. Switch camera. Thank you. Skip leg day so one Seth, too many times. Playing Tarkov with broken legs. Online High apps. low stats, yep. Yeah. 
nothing will go wrong here. Got I think them. That's also a really interesting part of this challenge, though. So, you know, even if we Those did this at the that beginning way. of wipe, I still think it would catch people out, right? Because like everybody gets caught yeah, out. Yeah, I'm doing a oh yeah, challenge for again. the shooting. Right. Like I'm playing you know what I mean? Solo, that's that's one of the things where it kind of creates uh, from that feeling from mm -hmm. nothing, wipe, right? That's one of the things. And I think too, with the account like this, like inherently, like you know that none of this stuff matters, so you're gonna play harder, so you're gonna make those types of moves that are gonna cause you to break your legs. Or fall too legs, far so right, kind of more often. Right now, I think. He's, cause he's sending it, chat. Hey, there's somebody in the mountains. He's over sending there. it. Or at the gate. I can't tell. I love I love how he's just gonna PK We're through the rest of the race. Race. No. No. He's got three more minutes of PK because he's got it's just oh, an Algon. Well oh, he's got three what more in Algons though too. So two more. <laughs> oh yeah, now two more. So One I mean, more. he's gonna have to find food and water. He's gotta find something. Yeah. The food and water for the for the popping the pain over and over again, but he needs to find something to That'd get him out of here. See. Well, that's what I mean. Yeah, he you needs both now. He needs, number. he needs both the split and food. Oh! And water. oh so they aggro that close at night. Cool. He's I used. Like, to, he's used to being used to. Would aggro that fast. That sucks. Yeah, that was rough. Yeah. That's okay though, because I broke both my. You legs. broke. Yeah, you got the <laughs> the Timmy ankles, oh. man. Walking around on painkillers. This is freaking limping. That map, dude. Crazy. That that was a really far aggro, uh, even as a for bear. nighttime. Yeah, that yeah. Was, that was pretty nighttime, far. Nighttime, yeah. I should have shot him because I had the gun. Yeah, you you could have got him from up on the mountain. I think you can get that one right. Chuck killed him like ten feet before that. True. Yeah, before he saw you. Yeah, just thought you had the space, so you're taking it. It's you know something, yeah. to, but with letting chat pick, and they sent you bear, right? You know, that's something you're not used to dealing with. Fucking assholes. <laughs> Fucking assholes. <laughs> you did get out of two, well, you had a second pair of NVGs at least, so. Yeah, I just got to get a helmet, I, which I'm, I don't think I could buy any. Uh, I, mean, I think you just got to use that uh, Oh, no, you lock. can't get the Ratnik. Never mind, off the uh, gate anymore. The only thing you can get is the penis helm. Oh, you got the dailies. I guess we'll go to customs. I like it. Oh, yeah. Water, food, and water. Okay, level five, everybody. Yeah, Hans, he let chat pick, and he went, he went bear this time. For the memes, bro. Don't worry, it's bears get special like, treatment on streets, like, like she said, however yeah, long ago. Spread. Yeah, trap. Chat says, chat says you should go to streets so that you can go to the faction that's nice to bears. Oh, wait. They never yeah. did that like they said they would. What's so funny is I <laughs> thought... Nothing but jokes here, chat. Nothing but jokes. So funny. So funny. <laughs> no, I thought with the addition to the... With the what is it? The ATP or whatever the fuck it's called? Um, BTR. Ooh, so far yep. off. So far <laughs> off. I don't know where I came up with ATP. Anyway, with the BTR... You got one letter right, though. <laughs> uh, I was thinking... Like, that's where the bear faction would come into place. Like, you would get discounts or something like that. Mm -hmm. uh, or, or anything, really, uh, with the addition of that. But nope. 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 And Nikita yeah, laughs in the distance. <laughs> it's, we will, we will, we will, we will. We will, we will, we will, we will, we will. People don't think like it'd be like a bee, but it do. But it do. But it do. But it do. <laughs> All right, so this one, uh, the goal here is the survive, right? You're shooting for that. Maybe some Saliwis. Yeah, knock Run out through some Saliwis and try to get uh, the uh, sur survive, yeah. XP, some gear. Survive, Saliwis, and maybe a 3M and a Taz. Hell yeah. Okay, yeah. Just still pushing them tasks more than anything. Yep. I like it. I like it. I personally like that approach to early wipe. Um, I know there's a lot of people that will go out and just like PvP early wipe because they like the PvP. Yeah, true. Right? It feels really good. Everybody's on the same playing field. Um, but I feel that's a, you know, well, yes, you get the PvP day one. By day two, if you're not tasking and, and questing, then you're yeah. falling behind. Right? I think and definitely like my goal early is like working towards trader rep. Like whatever is in service of getting to that next trader level because it's like that's how you get the stuff so that you can be the most equipped to survive. Right? Yeah. I'm a big believer. Like Absolutely. the thing that helped me get over gear fear was recognizing that, like, when I take better gear in, I survive more often. 
Yeah. Like. No, I mean that that's very true. What spawn are you hoping for? That's the real question. RUF. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Hit crack house. Yep. Get yeah, six salewas right off yeah. the bat, you know? Get them saliliwas. That would be nice. Another crazy thing, right? So starting off with the standard account versus my old, 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 old account. Mm -hmm. I have like the books from back in the day and it gives you extra gear at the beginning. Oh. I get a pair oh, of quad knives yeah. to start with and a suppressed uh, baby AK and a suppressed pistol. Like kid. Oh, and that's AK. true. Some people have to deal with that. Like we have, you know, some creators are emissaries and so yeah. they get like a big dump of stuff right off the bat that they're used to getting. And it always adds an additional layer of challenge to the standard accounts. Yeah, yeah. I remember back in the day they were going to give them their a custom gun, like emissaries and uh, Sherpas. Yeah. That'd be cool. Kill one of them, and then you get that, that juiced gun. That would be cool. Uh, which is, like I said, I, I find it interesting, the beginning of wipe, right, with these standards accounts. Like, do you push PMC or do you not? Because to your point, right, you want to try to get good gear as quickly as possible because good right. gear equals better survivability. But we're mid-wipe. Right on a brand new standard account, so fastest way to get good gear is to kill people with good gear because it's going to be hard to push trader rep in three hours. And you're not going to outpace anybody in, in a, with a three hour time limit, right? No. That's why you know Tra Trap's got that juicer M4 sitting yeah, in his dude. stash, ready to get Wait, used. Man. They got the A55 A1. You did pick yeah, up some like of that. I saw it. It. <laughs> yeah, and it's enough. You know what I mean? You got twenty rounds, dude. Hey, you put five in the top, you know. Yeah. <laughs> And then you run into a scav that's invincible and just eats all of it. Yeah, and then you die. Trap. The other day, I had a I had an AI scav eat five rounds of fifty four R B T from an SVDS to the face. I haven't had that happen yet. I watched yeah. that. Yeah, it's, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Like what, dude? Yeah. Like, it, honestly, it doesn't matter what I I should like. It could have been a pistol. Like you, if I you need to die, you just took five bullets to the face. Like I don't, <laughs> like you need to die. <laughs> How are you still alive? <laughs> I don't care if you just took five BBs to the face. <laughs> you, you're at least on the ground in pain. Like, you're not looking you're at me upset. anymore. You're <laughs> upset. Yeah, the hitbox is just in general, like, sometimes it, like, it feels great, I would say, like, 60% of the time. But when it's not working right, like, you get caught by that weird one tap that doesn't make sense, or you shoot an AI scav with no armor, like, six times, he doesn't go down. Yeah. Like, it, it's so weird. Puffy, how are you, girls? Good to see you. Yeah, I think my first two days of this wipe, I was getting shit on by AI scav for no reason. Oh yeah, but I got collapsed by some AI stuff. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it it still happens to me. Honestly, well, what is I'll it? get caught out by them stupid scav swarms, and all of a sudden, all three of them. Yeah, the little gang where it's me. three of them. Yeah, mm -hmm. like it's there's twice now that this wipe that I can remember. Mm -hmm. One of them they killed me, and the second one you were you got to me in time. But I was like, shit, Zane, 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 I need your help. I'm being swarmed, ah, because like I'm in the I'm out in the middle of nowhere, like looting, and all yeah. of a sudden they're on me, and I'm yeah. like, oh fuck. And they are you coordinated, know? those right? little scav yeah, gangs. Yeah, they literally just like swarm around you, right? Uh -huh. I've got one in front of me, and there's two flanking me, and like I am straight fucked unless somebody comes yeah. and helps me. Well, like this wipe, you know, I you know people meme about like oh i'm stuck on the pocket watch and stuff like that right but like that hasn't really happened to me this wipe i got stuck on delivery from the past oh me too it took me like seven tries to successfully get out of a customs raid with that fucking thing right because i was, don't even want to talk about i'd it. run into we'd run into three vans at, at re big red or like an ai scab would clap my ass right <laughs> yeah yeah like i i was having the hardest time with the customs tasks early wipe i mean yeah. still am for that matter right i want set up and i hate it <laughs> All right, homie. GG, see you later. GG's, good luck, good Got luck. Got this. All right, homie. GG, see you later. GG's, good luck, good Got luck. Got this. You guys stuck on friends for Wait, so long, and you were stuck on that one for a while. Yeah. The worst spawn for what it I'm the exact, exact opposite of the map from where he wanted to be, by the way, Chad. Yeah, literally <laughs> kitty corner opposite from where he wants to be. <laughs> Couldn't have been in a worse spot. <laughs> crazy talk, bro. He's zooming. 
There's one thing about the spawns. I think customs has got pretty good spawns too, where most of the time you're not like yeah. right next to somebody. It's really hard. For Except in a few places, like you spawn big red, and you kind of know, like, oh, there's gonna be. Yeah, well, I mean, there's two that spawns a... there, three spawns there. Did a player just run away from trap, or is it a scab? It's gotta be a scab, right? Uh, scab. Right. I got a daily to get thorax kills, don't I? Uh, well, yep. that wasn't it. Players could have spawned up at the like power thing, the little substation above them. Oh, there's a scav looking right at him. Is that them? Yeah, shut up. I, I Is find it the that boys? A lot with Tarkov, right? There's a task that that you get stuck on, and it's just demoralizing. Get a little rushy right? action. It kind of can sap your energy to play Ooh. this game a little bit. Um, and it's like this weird like. Game can't see this oh, there with your is. own psychology, right? Like, do you continue to try to? Oh, those are the guards. To be them, right? Oh, those are the Rishu's guards. Rishulu, Rishushu. That's a guard kill. <laughs> oh, bro, how's Trap gonna approach this? Is he gonna take this fight? Dude, am I gonna be able to make it? To yeah, the it can fence? be very demoralizing to get stuck on a task, and then you've got to try oh, to figure no, no, out no, no. like, do like I move on to a different task right for now, now or do I keep throwing my face at this wall? Like, all right. But at that point, you're in a bad mood, so it's get, it's tough. Get a cardio back. Get the cardio back. <laughs> they did aggro me on the rocks. What trap. You mean? Is trap gonna go for this? That's the question. I, I think so. I he's got it, right? Yeah, he's gonna them, push right? this. He's gonna go for him. There's one there, one there, another one on the back, and then there's that guy over there who has level four armor on. This has got to be your shoe. Did you bring any nades with him? No, I don't right think here. so. I feel like he would have hooked one already. That was a regular scav. That wasn't a guard. Yeah. So that was. I I understand. I could have killed that guy with a headshot. Thorax or stomach Death. shots? <laughs> there was a shuffle. In the, that scab yeah. was going through it. He did take, like, a bunch of 9 mil to the chest, though. I'd be not feeling great, too, I think. Donka, 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 man. Interesting way to come off that wall. Did that one count as a... Ooh. Yeah, it did. No, it didn't. What the fuck? Was that a neck shot? Collapse that scab, dude. Yeah, he freaking headshot him on accident. <laughs> he's, he's mad that that's he headshot him. He's like, fuck, dude, I needed the Thorax. Oh, yeah, that's his NVG helmet right there. True. If we oh, survive. he's got movement. There's another scav here. Well, the only criteria that we have to participate is that you have about. to stream. That's yep. It. Yeah, we just gotta you just gotta be able to go live so I can we can pull your content in. Other than that, everybody's welcome. Encouraged, even. Yeah. We want to talk to everybody. You know what I mean? Anybody who wants to. An RPD. What? The fuck? what? Bro. His face. <laughs> what? What is this? What? <laughs> Yeah, we'll obviously do what is this. You can spin it up. Spin it one up? More time. Hell yeah, yeah dude. dude. Dude, you got the RPD, bro. <laughs> what? Got, got that blot on what? him. What? <laughs> I'd be running at this point. I'd be like, yo, what the fuck? The bonds on the map? It's full of T45. Oh my god. That's funny, bro. That's amazing, dude. Perhaps about to run people over with that thing. Yeah, Lua, if you're interested, reach out to Zane. Yeah, and we'll DM get me it. and we'll, we'll get, get a, something scheduled. We'll find a day. That goes for anybody. Our plan is to run it every week, so I'm gonna I'm gonna need people, you know what I mean? The idea is that we'll kinda do it in seasons, right? Yeah. What is, what yeah, we may take some breaks. Satisfy my curiosity. Yeah. You know, might run it for six okay. weeks and then take a couple weeks off and then run it again, right? So that we can reset the leaderboard. Six weeks might not be oh, enough if we're only doing one a week. I don't only need to be six people. You know that's true. Job? That's not enough. Um, How? Just as an example. It's you know what I mean? <laughs> it's cooked. <laughs> is it, there is a hidden... Oh. Bitch. Oh, what? All right, hold on. We can't keep doing that. We can't keep doing that. <laughs> he said, hold on. Hold on. That was a stomach shot. That was a stomach shot. <laughs> 
Is it fresh on me? Love it. No, let me in. There's a scam behind me. <laughs> let me the in, panic. let me in. Please let me in. Oh, he's got running on his left. There's a guy in there. Yep. Yeah, he heard him. Did that correct it? Yeah, it did. Oh, he got it jammed. He fixed it, though. Yeah, he did. On the reload. heard that guy, right? <laughs> oh, God. Oh. He's trying to go for those stomach thorax shots. Yeah. I just, I was open at the movement on his left. Oh, yeah, there's definitely a guy in there. Homie is definitely waiting. Yo, why are you fucking with the lowly level six, bro? Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> Go away. Go away. <laughs> I love that funny, so man. much. You smell funny. <laughs> you smell. Yeah, you're using the standard account to your advantage, dude. Don't yeah. pick on me. I'm with Timmy. <laughs> I have a grenade. Ooh. I'm so impressed with his positioning. <gasps> <laughs> that was close. He's running. <laughs> Please, no. Ah. Don't shoot me in the back. Don't shoot me with my own gun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a dangerous spot to peek from. Where the fuck you go? I don't think I would ever choose to peek from up there. You got nowhere to go. Exposes you to a lot of angles, but for that specific fight, it's a good angle. No, no, I, I didn't mean it disparagingly. No Mostly yeah, just right. like in for awe, because like, again, like, not one you would choose. Not how my brain would work there. Right. Is this guy chasing him, or is that the AI scab running around in there? Well, I could do. I can't tell. It does sound like a well, blare. Need launch reaction, you know what I'm saying, brother? Yep, yeah, Huffy. Huffy. See how far you can make there it in three hours. Yep. How many kills, how many quests completed, how many levels, and we're just trying to track as much as we can. Yep. The overall, Dude, like, the competitive TikTok? portion of this will most likely be tracked off your level and total XP. I'm a terrible yeah, player. that'll probably be the main board. But we, we're going to be tracking everything, right? Did you get a melee kill? Did you get a grenade kill? Right? Mm -hmm. We're going to we're gonna try to have as many, uh, like, miscellaneous gun. leaderboards, so to speak, as we can to just highlight the different ways that people played, to right? I mean, um, you know, if this guy went out and did Hatchet Man, yeah. right? You know, this this person went out and decided to chuck nades throughout the map, right? right? Yeah, just, go you know, farm we'll, rogues, go to labs, right. run factory over and over again, right? This person was a loot goblin, like this, uh, right? Players, and, yeah, and looted everything. I'm right? glad you like it, Huffy. We'll see how we'll see how it takes off. You know, I think Trap's putting up some some solid numbers, and I think yeah. it's going to put him in a really strong position. Just It'd be tough to beat, and I think having that like thing to strive for is definitely going to get to the competitive side of That's a lot of our right. our creator friends. Well, we're all competitive. Oh That's why we play Tarkov. That's why we play Tarkov. Absolutely. Right, like to to, to pretend that we're not is honestly it's kind of silly. Right? <laughs> a little naive. Trap's like, what's crazy? That serve kit won't even fit in my ass. <laughs> <laughs> got a small ass, dude. And you yeah. fucking pop you gotta stretch that baby up, out. Right? Yeah, you gotta get more squats in. But yeah, Huffy, the I idea is that it's open life. to anybody uh, that streams Tarkov, right? We do, do unfortunately need you to stream. So uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Why did you fucking massive, <laughs> massive? I'm I sorry, I stopped mid sentence away. because like. Oh, hey, look at that surf kit. Why make that noise? <laughs> surf kit super helpful. What a convenient surf kit. He <laughs> said, "Why make that, dude that noise?" That dude reports me 100%. He's gonna be like, "This guy's level four. Dude, <laughs> it, this is paid. I swear to God." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Who are you, who you got filling your lobbies dude, right now, my dude? Yeah. Paid, I swear to God. Audie. <laughs> Yeah, dude, who are you, who you got filling your lobbies right now, my dude? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> trap just let the bleed. You gotta put the tummy back on. Fuck me. 
So yes, as I was saying, chat, uh, we do unfortunately need you to be able to stream just so that we can turn around and stream your broadcast back. Oh no, show. an ad. Oh. Fuck. Oh no. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm so sorry. You post more TikToks than I do, Native. You talking about? It's supposed to warn me, Chad. I'm sorry. L Strimmer. Oh my gosh. What the fuck is this? Little fat mutant. Kinda he got like a U lock, bro. Juiced. Wow. Juiced, bro. Wow. That's crazy. He was just crouched and hiding in the he fucking was library. Chill it, dude. Huffy with the prime. Huffy, thank you so much for thank that. Thank you. Prime. Sorry to bully you with an ad. <laughs> I'm so Where sorry. Put it all. <laughs> what does he do with Excellent. all that loot, dude? He's got a tequila rig. Why that okay, a tequila rig. Yo, come on, that. <laughs> bro, you can't bro. make it up, dude. Bro, <laughs> 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 I'm over here freaking laughing, my dude. What? Trying to have an honest challenge <laughs> over <laughs> here. <laughs> over here freaking laughing, Shit. my dude. What? Trying to have an honest challenge over here. <laughs> I should have hit met it up, dude. Fuck! Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn. No! no! 100%. I should have hit Damn. Met it up, dude. Fuck! Damn. Damn. Dude. That was his buddy, 100%. Dude, his yeah. buddy waited a long time to come He's probably, get you. He's probably a little scared, you know, Damn, a little, little spooked. Dude, his yeah, buddy said. waited a long time to come get you. Damn, dude. Oh, man. The RPD, Rip the, huh? Rip the RPD, bro. <laughs> that was good shit, though, dude. A mag that full was... of T45 is, is insane. That was nuts, dude. One hell of a come up there. Well, because of the RPD, Katie and I were over here like, that's got to be Rashala and the guards. Like, yeah, 100%. Like, like, what the Rashishi, fuck? 100. <laughs> yeah. Right? Mistakes were made. That was tough. Oh my goodness! So I I haven't really seen you use vault too much. Uh, like, what do you think about it? Do you like the new system for vaulting? Oh, I love it. Yeah, I, I love it. I just haven't needed it. Oh, I was just curious. I mean, I've seen a lot of people. One of the things that I've been doing with it as I've been going out through the maps is like trying different rotations and like trying to yeah. go places that like you never could in the past, right? Um. Like jumping over the fence there at Ruaf, you can now do pretty easily. Well, it's, um, what's wild about it is if you're moving at a slow speed and you vault, it's actually really, really quiet versus jumping. Yeah. So like you can you can make some sneakier rotations by utilizing uh, vaulting. Yeah, yeah. I've 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 started to try to adjust. Like Welcome said, back from the ads, you guys. To, to, so sorry about that. To use more vaulting, um, just to try to change up some of the the well known paths throughout the game. Yeah, take take a funky route, right? Mm -hmm. How, did you map your vaults and your jumps to be different, or do you still have them mapped together? No, I still have default. Default. Okay. Yeah, I don't need. I like I saw the the whole like special different things, and it's just like I don't. I just, I have a lot of buttons on my mouse, so I moved vault to its own button, and then made it like press instead of or like instead of automatic or whatever. So. I, I have mine on default still, yeah. um, but I, I haven't really noticed a problem with it. Like, if I tap it, I jump, and if I hold it, I vault. I think it, there's just some situations where I was, like, I was trying to jump, and it went to go do a vault because I was, like, so close to something, and it wasn't really what I wanted. Yeah. And it got me killed, right? And so yeah. that was when I made the switch. I was like, okay, I, I'm, I'm going to make a conscious choice, vault versus jump, like, yeah. every time, right? I guess that's all it would take. Get killed with it once, and then you're like, okay, I'm making a change. Yeah, where it doesn't do what you expect it to. Like, yeah. I, I don't want to die because the game does something funky. I want to die because I suck, you know? Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I want to die because I am a complete and utter incompetent at this game, but, like, not because uh, the game Oh, what did I complete there? Oh. You get your kills? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Got debut done. Locate the liquor store on ground zero. Ooh, are we going back? That's a fun one. Yeah, are we going to go back? I don't know. True. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well. I'm a little so excited to go to that map. What would your favorite map be? 
favorite what? map is probably Shoreline. Shoreline before or I after like the Street changes. A lot. I like uh, currently. Current. Yeah. The changes were nothing but good. No, yeah. they were great. They did a really good like changing the flow of the map enough so that like it resorts not the only any map that only has one POI. I think it's just bad. Yeah, no, right? There's only one POI yeah. that matters. That's why Lighthouse is bad. There's only one POI that matters. It's a uh -huh. huge POI, but like it just it's what makes that map bad. Yeah. Sorry, I cut you off there, Trap. What were you going to say? I don't remember what I was talking about, to be honest with you. We were talking about your favorite map, and then you went to go say something else, uh, right as, did you say Shoreline? Um, sh nothing but good for Shoreline. But you were going to say something else about another favorite map of yours, right as I asked you. Oh, before. Streets. Streets. Oh, yeah. Streets is so good. I, I lo that's, that's love me some favorite Streets. Favorite it's my favorite map, 100%. Yeah. I love the it's urban good. combat. So good. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going to buy uh, some cheese for health. Oh, yeah. Got to bring the cheese. Yeah, don't forget your cheese, man. How are you doing on rubles right now? Six forty-two. Oh, you're chilling. Not too bad, yeah. And I can pretty let's respectable. Here, let's make some quick, I don't need a bunch of shit anymore. Dude, wouldn't it be fun if one day we get big enough that BSG lets us use like level forty-two accounts for this or something? Yeah, that'd be so hype. That'd be so fucking cool. Sick. Just give us like what five. Would your, mil? What would your goal be at that point, though? If we could go, if we could start off up there, what would you? I think the challenge would be different. Like I, we would come yeah. up with a different. Like a totally new thing, if we had BSG yeah. support like that, right? Like, I it think would be what, so open ended. I think we would have some very specific goals. goals, right? Yeah, which would be, but I would, I wouldn't want us to get too close to like what Evasion and the Hunt are doing. I'd want us to still keep like our own flair, you know. But I think, I definitely think, like what we have now is a function of what's available to us, right? Mm -hmm. You know, the a fresh standard account's a really great way to put everybody on the same. Like level, level playing, playing field, field, which is what our aim was. If yeah. if everybody had a level forty two account with max trader rep and a certain amount of money, then that would be fine too. That as long as everybody's starting from the same baseline, and yeah. I think, think that that's what makes a strong challenge, right? But I, I'm, we probably could even take the same formula. It wouldn't have the same impact, right? Because you would have to do the math from forty two to whatever it is that they got to, right? But you could still take to Zane's point the same formula and apply it because they're starting at the same baseline, which is the most important thing. Because that's when we when we iterated through this idea, right, that we originally were like, oh, we can do it and we'll let them use their own accounts. But we can't, obviously can't do that because people are at different stages of the account, right? And, sure. Kappa versus non-Kappa yeah, and right. money and Ed stuff like that, right? Edge of darkness versus non-edge of darkness. Oh, right? There's keys. so many different variables yeah. that come into play. And so we landed on, okay, well, it has to be a standard account that we control, right, in order for it to be fair for every participant, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure what it would look like if we had like BSG's full support, right? I I think if we had BSG's full support, I think we would also have like more opportunities to do those specific goals, right? The the RNG oh, portion of it. Yeah. Right. We would have control. No, you're <laughs> the good. Pupper fish. <laughs> cool. I restarted my computer uh like yesterday for updates and stuff, and when I do that, okay. it always fucks up audio and it just gets screwed up. Yeah. Yeah. Goodness gracious. Cool. So how are you feeling so far in the in the challenge, Trap? You feeling confident? You feeling how are you feeling? Typical Tarkov stuff, you know, like yeah. I didn't clear that building, so like kicking myself for doing that because that would have been a huge ray to make it out of. Mm -hmm. but yeah, it is what it is. Got the ups and downs for sure. I yep. I think you're doing very well, to be honest with you. Um, I uh, we didn't really know what to expect when we came into this, but I don't think that I expected, you know, level six first hour, uh, cruising through all the tasks that you've cruised through. So, yeah, fucking crushing it, dude. Oh, oh I bet I control it on this computer. This have you have you guys seen HUD FX yet? No, I'm not. No. Like another like sound alerts kind of thing, kinda. Get off my fucking screen. Chat, I apologize. Don't just go away. I will be right back. That's an aggressive little window right there. Jesus. <laughs> Curious. Here. It is. Boom. 
where the fuck I am. Ooh, that's landmines. All right, buddy. Good luck. Ooh, that's yep. landmines. Thank you. All right, chat. Just me for a moment. What Thank the fuck, dude? The hell? Yep. <laughs> that jump scared me. What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, I just tested it. It's FX. It takes on your screen. And it Holy plays on my it, fuck, so it man. plays on your screen, not on your uh like that's HUD FX. OBS. It takes over your screen. Yeah. And it plays on my it so it plays on your screen, not on your uh like not in OBS. Yeah. We're already dying. Oh my god, Trap's already taking already shots. Dying. Oh god. Dude. What the fuck is this? Hawk, you're not the first one to ask that, bro. <laughs> oh, no. no I no. got stuck on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> hey, imagine he gets fucking snapped right there. I would have died laughing if that, that log would have got you killed. Dude? I'm not going to lie to you. It has to be up there, right? It almost succeeded, dude. <laughs> I would have died laughing if that, that I don't log know where these guys are shooting him from. Hardcore account challenge would be it cool too. Succeeded, dude. That would be fun. Add some of the hardcore rules to it too. I, don't know where these I think what makes the hardcore fun. account really fun is its longevity, right? And so I think that might be hard to capture in like a short, like one off challenge like this. That was the other thing that was hard too, is like, you know, I can't take Trap's time over for a week. And are you like, you guys want to watch that, right? Like, I think if we can keep it encapsulated like a one night, one shot kind of thing, it makes it really interesting and fun. And the payoff yeah, and the good, the dude. results are all in one one go, right? That one was good. Um, I think it would be fun to explore like what the, maybe I'm that would look like, try to cut right? Me off here. One of the things that we talked about doing or that I think would be fun and like how Katie was alluding to if we had gun, like, BSG support would be doing like specific goals, right? Gun. Like we wanted to like offer up points. Like well, if you if you kill uh, this guy, you know, it's like if you kill Sermon, it's worth five points. If you no beat this task that's like a little bit down shit. the task tree, it's worth like ten points. But we were having a hard time like balancing that and and we didn't really know what to expect so i think if we were to do something like that this will put us in a we'll be better equipped to make some of those decisions and make a more compelling challenge like going forward if we decided to swap it up so start this on hardcore hard is to toughest do. part arguably the most hype that's yeah, fair maybe we should chat about it luau you know maybe that's like a an alternate thing that we can do i don't know i feel like i get lucky a lot trap's going after this guy huh is it that dude in the middle of the road oh, that was shooting at him? Player, right? Oh, it's not. Sorry, I'm just uh. catching up, chat. He was getting Set. shot at right off spawn. Relocate. A hardcore. Oh. That's... Yeah. That's the moment I fire uh, first, I'm kind of fucked. Broad? Woods. Woods. Why am I pinging at 130? Traps on a funky server. Oh, he pivoted. Wow, that's crazy. Question is, was that a, a thorax shot or not? Literally just a pixel over the mountain. Mm hmm. You knew where he was like ahead of time, right? So. Yeah. Question is, is was it a player actually shooting him off the ra off the rip? Race for you too. Or was it that scab? Because the angle, that scab, that would make sense. It's like Trap's just moving through. He's making his way over yeah. to the USEC camp. Decided he didn't want to, didn't want to find out. Yeah, he's staying on the edge of the map. It's tough. One of the things that's really tough early, like in a, like a low level account, is the optics. You don't have a scope. You don't have reliable access to a scope. Like yeah. Trap losing that one SVDS was actually a pretty huge bummer for uh, like yeah, his so, options. Yeah, yeah. I mean, honestly, oh, both of them. So, in the last raid, he had two or three weapons that he had picked up that had great optics on them. Um, and so, so dying right there in, in I do think was, I could go to streets and make more XP than this, though. The setup where it's comparing different styles pretty different because other people can try to play the style, but oh, getting that a person that defaults. Right, we wanted to, we were trying to make it so that, like, people would shine at, right. like, their style of play easy. and still get rewarded. So right. uh, like EXP being like still kind of like the main thing that we're comparing opens up a lot of different pathways to still doing well on the leaderboard. And then we still look at some of the other aspects of Tarkov no, no, as well, right? Like how many kills did you get? Like what was your stash value for looting, no, right? Like right. 
but yeah. you know. Right, and, and what's what's great about that is that all of those things him. go into your XP, right? You get XP for looting, you get XP for killing. Shit. Killing, right? healing. And yeah. so, like, if you're a loot goblin and that's just, Long like, mouse. what you're good at, then go do that, right? Oh. We want to... One of the main oh, goals that we had when we were thinking about this right. was to showcase that there isn't oh, right. one way to play Tarkov. Right. Right, one right way. Right. Right, just, be, just because you're the PMC killer doesn't mean that you're a Tarkov god. Yo, right? what if... With, what if we got Stank to do this? That'd be amazing. Or that'd, that'd be crazy. Right, that, that would be so awesome, right? Because it would represent just one more How play style that goes yeah. to Tarkov. Because riding, mm -hmm. it, it is a play style, right? Like, it is one way for you to play this game and to play it successfully, I would add. Yeah. I mean, Stank's very good at this game. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, he's. Uh, I've played. He's been on my team in arena. He's very strong at Tarkov. He chooses to play the way he plays, right? Yeah. Um. I'm glad you see that, Shadow. That was something that we were specifically aiming for. Yeah. It was like specific a specific goal of ours. I may have heard somebody Metal Gunner. Metal Gunner. Gunner. Metal Gunner. So Thank you for the raid. All of our raid hype stuff's turned off right now for the challenge. Thank you so much for bringing Appreciate your community you. in I'm here. Give you that shout out. Everybody coming in from Metal Gunner's stream, welcome Focus in. We in. are the Shooty Loots. My name's Zane. That's my wife, Katie. You're right in the middle of episode one of the Loot Sack, which is our standard account challenge. We've got Trap HD up on the screen right now. He's coming up on, he's ending his second hour of three in the challenge. Gunner, how was your stream? Oh, you were playing Skull and Bones. That's in oh, beta. Yeah. Uh, Crow was in here talking about that earlier. How is it? Are you enjoying it? Do you play a lot of Sea of Thieves also is my yeah, question. Yeah, that's a good question. Oh, some Piranha Rounds. Those are, those are good ammo. Is he going to take him? Yep, he's taking the Piranha Rounds. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. I'm gonna peek over the rock here at you said. Is that I a like suppressed gun? Came in at. I did not know you could just stand on that net. I should have, but Yeah, you can just stand on it. <laughs> For some reason I was like, you'll fall right through. They obviously didn't put collision on that net. Look at that USEC armor over there, chat. That's the other thing is like I, I watch, you know, <laughs> streamers from time to time, but I don't a lot of the times I don't uh, like hang out and like watch watch people play Tarkov. Usually I'm there to just like hang out in the communities and chat with people. So, so this is uh, showing so me already a ton of different things that I play styles, peaks, rotations. Yeah, right. Yeah, really so like, I didn't. I didn't know you could stand on that net. I thought that the, the collision mesh wasn't Granted, there at all for it. You just yeah. through. So I've never tried because I didn't want to break my legs there. Not right. Even. And to like do it in a raid, and then we're all sitting there making fun of you, right. and you didn't know or right. whatever. I barely right. play this game solo, so right, I would right. have been with you guys when I tried to figure that out. Yeah, and yeah you like, guys ah, would have gave me so Katie much broke shit. Her legs. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. So this is one of the things that I've never tried to do. You do play Sea of Thieves? Say, Hell yeah. Good to see you, bro. Chat, by the way, you guys go check out Trap. He's one of our really good, yes, good friends. He's one of our OG supporters around here. Um, and he's the guy that's on the screen hey, right now that you're watching over. play. Yeah, so he's about to find that Lettuce. A lot of gunfire around the map that's definitely going to distract Trap. I know him. He's gonna go peek. I know him. Yeah. He's gonna go look over that edge and see if he can, see if he can spot those boys. Be huge right now. He's not gonna be able to help himself. Mhm. Mm oh. It is 9:36, baby boy. What's oh? up? The other one, surely. I'm trying to calculate how long you've been reading. <gasps> There's a letty, bro. No, I called it. No <laughs> shot. I called it. I just want everyone Bruh. in this chat to know. I said it. Bruh. It happened. I'm gonna tell Trap. Trap, I called that for you. I just want you to know. I was about, he's about to walk up on this Letty. <laughs> little late game Letty Take action. Dude. Little late game Letty. Yeah, I called that for you. I just want you to know. I mean, it's technically not that late, but like, <laughs> little late game Letty action. You would think dude. that would be hit. Little late game Letty. I mean, it's technically that not that late, but like, <laughs> that was you would absolutely think that would perfect. Be hit. If you were hurting for rubles before, you aren't now. Yeah, dude. <laughs> that was perfect. Wild. Too bad I don't have the fucking flea market, huh? True. How much does therapist buy that for? 600k. 700k. Yeah, Something like that, yeah. The fucking flea market, money. huh? Oh, yeah. How much does therapist buy that for? 700k. I got the M855A1 in the gun right now. I'd love to find me a juicy boy. Oh, yeah. Ooh. All right. We're pulling for it. As I, really I got the that. M855A1 in the gun right now. I'd love to find me a juicy boy. we got to figure out a solution for that double audio. All right. We're pulling for it. I, Talk to I, you soon. Maybe I should be deafening them in the Discord so that they just have to talk to us through stream. Like a double audio. I don't Maybe? know. Maybe? Yeah, we'll have to we can brainstorm that, that one. one. Yeah. yeah. That's why I put it in my ass. That's why you put it in his ass, chat. You heard it here first. <laughs> you heard it here first. 
It's a Mosin. I don't really give a Oh, he's got shots in the distance at the village. That's not Ooh, a Mosin. That's close. That's not a Mosin. I was about to say, he said, Ooh. <laughs> flea market, you see that there. smirk right there? Yeah. He's like, ooh. Wait, you think we go say hi to these guys, Chad? And uh, I think we go say hi to these guys. Sounds like they're traveling that way. I knew it. Hi, Shiloh. Chat, while Trap pushes this fight, I just want to make a call out and say thank you all so, so much for being here for day one of the Loot Sack. We appreciate you. Uh, we've been really, really excited and very, very nervous to unveil this to you guys and the amount of support that we've had for day one. Amazing. And on a Thursday, you guys. Thank you, thank you so much. And this is, it's just going to get better. You better guys, and better from here. Right. We'll, we'll watch the VOD for this. We'll, we'll make notes of where we can improve. Right. I'm going to put together a promo so video. Yeah. Right. And I won't misspeak. Dude, if I would have found a magnified as often. Be huge right now. Traps pushing in on these, these these shots, dude. The greedy face, right, Hans? That was greed. That was that was the promise oh, of no, juicer loot. They're yeah, dude. On the side, okay. It's the same face Stank makes when he he hears footsteps. <laughs> Here he goes, chat. He's locked in. All he needs is a little bit more sound from these guys. These guys make one more sound. Trap knows where they're at, and he's going to run them down. Yeah. That's what he's looking for here. Any I movement. Toby eye tracker stuff. You guys can see what I see. Like, look at what I'm looking at. Yeah. This shit ain't cheap, though. Oh, yeah, he's a W keyer. But he's a tactical W here, though, because as you can see here, like he came up on where he knew this guy was and immediately hit crouch and went silent, right? And yeah. it's it creeping up on him. And so, like, yeah, he, he moves and he moves quick. Yeah, he's not full silent moving, but he is slow walking to, to give him the advantage. For... Right. He's just a, a little bit of movement, a little bit of sound. Yeah. And he'll be locked in. What if this is two player groups clashing and not. That's what I thought it was. I thought it was two players fighting each other. That's what players. it sounded like to me. Kind of assumed it was going to be. Scav is still alive. Player versus Scav. There's a Scav over there. Did Scav win that fight against the player? Is that what happened? That might be why it got so quiet. Help me. And this is an area of the map where. Oh, oh. No, that's a player. Still player alive still for alive. Sure. Wanasuka. There he goes, chat. Oh, no scope. He's got no optic, though. I die here. Oh, this is going to be a tough okay. shot. <laughs> I die here. I'd love the call out, dude. <laughs> There's one. How many do we think it is, chat? How many do we think it is, everybody? I'm thinking two man, just from the, the amount of shots I heard. It's Traps symbols. chat's thinking three. Three man. Three, you think three? I think two as well. Definitely could have heard a profile for three guns. I thought I heard two. I the definitely heard two. There might be yeah, a third guy, but the scav sure the scav was weapons. shooting in the mix too. So a third gun, minimum two for yeah. sure. There's two definitely. Right yeah, he's so patient. Just snap that one, dude. That's two dead, dude. Wow. Great shots. Uh, with a red dot, dude. A reflex, technically. Yeah, length prone, massive help. I, I just impressive. heard a footstep to his right. You'll want to be careful here, especially after getting caught out. Well, and his gun's loud. Yeah. Hey FMJ round's pretty big deal. Wait, what the fuck gun does this guy have? Is there a baby AK suppressed? Oh, no. Not suppressed. Damn. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> oh, no. I got excited. Which is not good for oh, three yeah, to five mans. Yeah, it gets a little tough it's on that map. Tough. Honestly, three to five mans are just tough anywhere. The comms get real difficult. True. This would be a nice gun if it wasn't super scuffed. Oh, no, I did not drop that mag, bro. Where the fuck did I reload at? Oh, no. No, it was as he was sprinting down the hill. It's lost in the snow, dude. Yeah. He's not getting that back. 
Level three, dude. Oh, what a bully. There's where that other gun profile came yeah, from. Yeah. From the PP-19 on the back. challenges going at once or what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She weren't supposed to know about the other guy? My bad, my bad. <laughs> she weren't supposed to know about the other guy? My bad, my bad. Chat, if you have any comments, questions, feedback of any kind, please let us know. As we said, this is our first episode. We are trying to grow on this. Um, and any and all feedback is appreciated. Mm -hmm. If you would like to participate, please reach out. It's um, basically, anything, right? You want to tell us we suck. Um, I'll enough. be sad. And I would hope that you would keep it constructive. But, <laughs> you know, True. the, the floor is open. <laughs> well, he just got a uh, Saliwi that he needs. Oh, yeah. He doesn't have room for that mag if he finds it. He's not going to be able to pick it up. Was that the mag with yeah, his 8.5? Anyway. Yeah. Uh, well, he yeah. used it in, on the kills. Oh, that's true. I have money for a car as well. I don't think it matters if he... Oh, on the ground, he found it. There it is. <gasps> oh, fucking that, dude. The fucking snow helped him out. Yeah, <laughs> made it pop up, kind of pop. Yeah. All right, our boy is heavy yeah, yet again, chat. We thick. We thick again. He's about to lose that mag. God damn it. <laughs> right, Giggle? Yeah, he just bullied a level five, three and yeah. a level two or something. Uh, they're big, both level three. <laughs> big bully, dude. Hey, dude. Late wipe, you know? Fair game. Level, level three, three and a four. four. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, Welcome to Tarkov. The <laughs> they were struggling they were. against the scabs, dude. They were, dude. You to knew it was going to be. We thought it was a player fight. We were like, yeah. is that a player battle? <laughs> <laughs> we were all calling player v player. Nope. Timbos oh. versus the Scavingtons. Oh, Poor guy. Oh, someone took his car. Oh, but he's got UN. <laughs> oh, he'll be okay. Yeah, cool. He's got plenty of extract options. You just got to cut through the mountain. That village. Yeah, yeah, I skipped Worst the village. Part. No reason for him to go there. He doesn't have a good scope anyways. You can cut along the, the ridge to get to Burn northern UN. Sam. Yes, sir. Yeah. We're good. Behind old sawmill. The only thing that could have been better in this raid. Still a long trek from where he's at yet, with low stamp. Like, find a suppressor for a gun that I have and a magnified optic. That's what an yeah, early white man is. just like everything is so valuable, right? Mm -hmm. like a gun like this, you can go on a suppressor. He found, oh, yeah, a, no he, he found a Ledex, and he's sitting here going, I wish I found a suppressor. Right. It's just like the early gameplay, like early wipe gameplay is just so different. Well, what's very interesting about this challenge is that it's capped at three hours. And so that Ledex, while, yes, really valuable for money, has yeah. no other value to this account and to this challenge yep. for that matter. Yep. Just and towards so, stash value. Right. And so just, you know, as a as a normal, when you're normally playing Tarkov, right? It's finding huge. The, finding yeah. the Ledex is like, fuck yeah, dude, I win this wipe. I'm, I'm the winner. Right. Finding it during the, the loot sack challenge is like, oh, cool. Money. Yeah, stash value boost, right? Yeah. Just as Chad pops up. Yep. <laughs> and, and a super Chad, you know, somebody with, with 8,000 plus hours yeah, in dude. the game. <laughs> Fucking rocked him prone with a reflex <laughs> off of unsilenced <laughs> MP4 on a hill, dude. I would have been, yeah. like, been so emasculated. Just, Again, ugh. I think Ryan should do this. Not saying like this is like, oh, you're going to grow your channel or anything like that, dude. Yeah, but yeah, like it'll help, obviously, right? But I think, like, Brian underestimates himself, for one, heavily. You got a homie he wants to see do it. Yeah, I love that. No, I, I love think, it. I love so that first, so much. First first Ryan here. Right. thinks he's shit pvp -er. Thinks he's not good at the game. Or he's, like, he's very, he, he's guys. got a slice of the fucking fake humble pie. I think this is a really a great opportunity for us to just meet new people. And learn more about them in the process, right? Uh, like, well, and to Trap's point, what he just said, I think this is also a really watch, unique way to show people that you don't cool suck at this game. Back, right? like, or show yourself. Discord, you show like, yourself, yeah. yeah. Right, people prove to yourself. Like, like, I don't suck at this game. Right, like you don't have to be the PvP Chad. You don't have to be the all-knowing map person, right? right? Like, there are so many different ways to be successful at this game. Right, and to uh, no, Shadow's point earlier, the way well that solo. we set this up Mentally, really allows well players of on the game any solo, skill to, to come in and much. succeed at this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Wax them all. Yeah. Yep. 
interesting side to choose to rotate on. Exposes you to a lot of places I'd expect players to be. He's yeah, a bit more of a straight shot. You know we used to throw these out of airplanes. Yeah. <laughs> used to throw these out of airplanes. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. That's not wrong. We're in Tarkov Arena, guys. <laughs> Did Arena get snow? Do you guys know? Or we should ask Strap his opinion on the snow when he gets out of this frame. Oh, that's a good question. Yeah. Two little Tim Tams died to my M5, M855A1. <laughs> yeah, not exactly the level right? of PMC that he was I'll hoping to kill with those bullets. Yeah. Open. Yeah, this one's always open, dude. But I mean, a, a dub's a dub, a kill's a kill, you know kills what I mean? Kill's a kill. True. They got caught out, dude. Welcome to Tarkov. Hit your shots. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> look out for them fucking Yo, bush, what? bush wookies. What in the what? <laughs> Now I just need to find an MPX. He said, cool. Weak ass raid. Weak you ass had, raid. You had half a GL there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's the weakest raid I've ever seen in my life, Trap. What that was cra it? crazy, dude. You bullied the fuck out of the level three and that yeah. level four. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? I'm only level six. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, dude. We were just saying, too, not exactly like the caliber of people you were hoping to shoot with that those bullets. <laughs> I don't know. That was really fun to watch, though. I got to say, I... I, I I was impressed with those shots. Just fucking pro them up, up there with a reflex sight, dude. I never Dropped think them. to go prone for some reason. Like, I just, oh, like, I guess. the ability is amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm noticing that. Like, I just, I, I always get that, like, oh, I saw somebody, I want to shoot him. Yeah. Right? You get that, that like, excitement, like, you you jump the gun. True. Like, figuratively yeah. and, and literally. And I think that's something that, like, just generally that's an emotion that a lot of people experience in Tarkov, and it takes a long time to, like, almost build up, like, resistance to oh, yeah, it. Yeah, to settle. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude. Casually. Don't forget about the Ledex. Casually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were we were casually. talking about how it's weird, right? Like, no, like early game, like early wipe gameplay, right? Like the the attachments and the scopes and those things are so impactful and so like necessary that they're almost more exciting to find than like a Ledex this early. And then you add on the fact that in an hour we're wiping that account. So like the Ledex doesn't mean anything other than just more ruble to throw at stuff and you don't have a ton of stuff unlocked. So it's almost like like weirdly like not that exciting that you found right. one, right? Like yeah. people are like, oh he just vendored a Lex. Oh, <laughs> Yo, you know what I did just think of though, that it will make a fun track on the leaderboard. Ledex is found. Say, say, yeah. after, okay, I was about to say after I sold it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it'll be no, found. No, it'll found, be found yeah. just in general. Not yeah, not kept sat. kept in stash, get smoked, nerd. Yeah, get smoked, <laughs> trapped. No, no, no. Just just found in general, right? The amount of let X's that you pull out of raid, that'd be right. I think be a fun one to track. It's pure RNG, right? There's no skill related yeah. to that. But I think it'll be fun to just That's why I at. like the bosses too, right? Like bosses yeah. killed. You know, it's totally RNG whether or not you even see one. Right. It's not something that we'll like truly track as like a way to compare. But right. it will be fun to see like you know, who found the most, who found the most lead X's in, in their run. Right. Like, right. Yeah. And, and stuff like that. We'll, we'll try to be as transparent as possible. Like, Hey, this is super RNG based. This isn't like a, it's just for fun. Right. It's the same thing that you would yeah. track in like a, like, like an, like they do it in hockey. They track every stat in hockey and then they'll just like randomly come up and they'll tell you that like, Oh yeah, he's blocked every shot that's been in the top right quarter of the goal this season. You're like, Oh, what the fuck? Like, right. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, where are we hitting next, buddy? I don't know. How much time we got? You've got um, Just 50 under minutes. An hour. Yeah, it's 48 minutes left. I don't think where I can make that be the most impactful. Streets is pretty good. You got two bosses, lots of scavs. Yeah, if they spawn. It. True, true. You got a lot of money you can spend too. You can I don't know what you can spend it on here, but goddamn thing. <laughs> Not a goddamn thing. You do a quick run to ground zero for the wine and then still have time for another one? You know what would be oh, interesting? Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Uh, you know, since we're still musing on ideas for this, if we had BSG support, it would be actually to start it at 15 with money. So you had access to the flea. The flea, but still like early. But still early game. Yeah, I think there's a lot of like. That means you can buy you, ammo. You add in BSG support, and it really changes like what it, it we're capable of so doing. Much. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 
That's a long ways away, chat. <laughs> Yo, Giggle, well, you missed it earlier. <laughs> Trap chat on some dude. He was level 20 sitting in the... Uh, yeah, camp in the, the, the quest room, the with, quest his, room with his yeah. buddy. There was a duo in there. On the map. Yeah. No, he was, he was there with a Timmy. Level yeah. 3 Timmy. <laughs> you so got there. him going around the window, though, dude. Yeah. I've never seen that rotation. Oh, he got caught laying on his pee-pee. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you know, the, they got to cuddle each other on their way out to the lobby. It's okay. Yeah. Chat, I'm going to run an ad while we load into this one, and I'm going to go pee. I'll be right back. I didn't oh. look at a uh, dash value. Oh, yeah, that is something that we're going to be uh, keeping track of. What was that? Of. The what? Dash value. Dash is value. It? Oh, yeah, yeah. It'll be just yeah. what it is at the end. Yep. And I keep yep. selling everything. Well, That's so fine. Your, your cash goes towards your stash value, so. Yeah. I remember last wipe, Zane was all like, yeah, I've got, I've only got like 15 mil, but I've got like half a fucking case full of Bitcoin. Bitcoin yeah, yeah blah, dude. Blah, blah, blah. It ended and up being like 60 I've mil been, worth. Yeah, I'm sitting on 20 right now, I've, and that's after selling 10 of them. Or nice. Trade, this, this wipe, I've just been selling them as soon as I get them instead of holding on to yeah. them. I might start filling up my Hall of Fame, just like fill up all the slots with Well, there was Bitcoin. one raid that's on great, Streets, dude, where I made it out with three of them. I believe it, dude. Raid. I believe it. And I've gotten I, two what, in one in a GPU. Yeah, my uh, that's where all of mine are in my Hall of Fame. I've got all the small trophies are all bitcoins right now. Nice. <laughs> I got to nice. pee. I'll be right back. That's awesome. Yeah, so Giggle, we can't get a level fifteen account without having PSG support. But to Lula's point, if we had PSG support, we could do custom creators, right? And everybody would still start at level one, but they would have access to higher level gear and things like that. Uh, yeah. Like some really really fun stuff. Uh, that'd be even cooler. Like if we had let, like specific and custom trades specific to this challenge, right? So it would drive you to go look for specific loot items so that you could trade to get better weapons and armor, right? Um, but that that's a lot, right? Oh that's shit! Like they're good. shooting already. Oh god. Yeah, he's already in. They're already shooting. I don't know where the fucking spawns are for this thing. Oh, muted. I know nothing about streets chat. That's not true. I know quite a bit about streets. I'm going to give myself more credit than that. I know a little, a, quite a bit about streets. But I do get really confused with the map on streets still. Um, so I have a very hard time orienting myself. Oh, there it is. Oh, nice. You already got Fish? the wine? That was a great spawn for the quest he was trying to work on, huh? Yeah. Crazy. Next trades for Zabralo or a 308 MDR is fully low with M61. Yeah, so you're talking about like custom yeah. trades and custom traders. And yeah, yeah, like where they're low level, but they have all the barters unlocked or something. Yeah. The, the part where that gets really spicy, I'll say, uh, is that we're still playing against people on public servers, right? And so having custom traders on our accounts but playing against people that don't have that now gives well, us an boy. advantage and i'm not <laughs> sure that's something bsg would ever do like support yeah. or support yeah True. um we would have to go on private servers which uh, again is that the, well that's where we start getting into like we need to coordinate get like everybody there at the same time right. and then, then we're just running a tournament a right across the street like over there in that so building. I think and that's kind of what Evasion's doing this weekend. Which, yeah. by the way, chat, a little chance to plug that. I'm actually, I'm competing in the Evasion Solos tournament that's happening this weekend. Group stages start Saturday. Um, my run will be at... Um, noon, yeah. Uh, I think it's noon Eastern, yes. Yeah. Chat, if you guys could please come by, show your support for that. Uh, I, I know Zane gets pretty nervous for some of the these events right and uh you just being there really really helps it means a lot to me it really does go? chat so saturday at 12 p.m eastern i'll be here i'll be live a little earlier than that uh it's a series of five mini games on various maps over the course of about four hours i think or three hours and um Damn, bro, we got Honda's It's kind of an elimination yeah. style thing where um only some of us will like That's based on our cool. scores will progress through the group stages, which start on Saturday and Sunday, and then go on to a semifinal and then a final. Mm, there's yeah, yeah there's so. a, it's uh, groups and then into a bracket. Here, I'll share the the the, the twatter, the tweet. There's a pistol Twits. guy from that direction. There you go, chat. 
It's very, very exciting. It's definitely going to be a really good time. If you guys could come by, just say hello, throw a hug in the chat. That would be so, so amazing. Keep us lurked up. You know, you don't have yeah. to be hanging out the whole time, but if you just keep me up, that'd mean a lot. And thank you, guys. There's a guy underneath trap. You can hear him. This is a vault moment. Alrighty, Huffy. Good night. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Is he really coming to push me? Good night, Huffy. I hope you have a great night. Sorry we missed your first message. I, I said hi to her when she came in. No, the first uh, good night. Oh, you said good night earlier yeah, and I missed it. You're we missed oh, it. thank you for repasting I, it. I appreciate Huffy. you. Good that. night, thank good you night. For saying good night again. I like to be able to say good night to you. You guys only got one way to go is to push trap or go yeah, back down. He's got no choice. I'm not sure he knows traps there. Can you go in here? No. <laughs> Smoked. Just <laughs> laid out like a fucking lawn was, chair, dude. I was perplexed. <laughs> no, he's level one. one. Oh, no. Dude, bad, dude. Level one. Dude, a side effect of this challenge that I was not anticipating is we are setting loose some very good players against bro. some very new people on this map. <laughs> Trap has bullied. Are we the baddies? <laughs> He has absolutely clobbered some low-level dudes. Oh, bro. I'm so sorry, little Timbo. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, no. I feel terrible. I, I, uh, Katie and I, we brainchild this, and we have orchestrated this level of suffering. <laughs> <laughs> In the bed. Good night. We're monsters. Bro. Poor guy. <laughs> Bully. Dude. Oh, my God. The poor babe. Dude, there's three tech crates in this. Yo, crazy. I may not have pulled the trigger, there? but I feel that blood on my hands. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you that. That man just uninstalled Tarkov, and it's our fault. <laughs> it's our fault, bro. Dude. Oh, no. What if I can get that <laughs> achievement on this account? They can't, oh, I guess resetting it does reset achievements, too, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you remember the guy that came into chat after I killed him? He was like, GG's, right bro. I just uninstalled. I'm so sick of this shit. <laughs> That is the nicest person to come in to, to be raging at the yeah, same time. He's like, I've, uh, <laughs> GG's, bro, you just made me uninstall. I was like, like oh, he bro, was so, I'm so nice about sorry. it. He was like, no, I just fucking uninstalled. But he was like, also nice. Yeah. Like, it, it was so weird, dude. Because on the same day, we There's had somebody come in and be me? like, fuck you. No, seriously, fuck you, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it was because I was like sniping that raid or something. So I just sniped him and he just had like no chance, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this poor guy comes in. He's like, I'm so fucking done with this wipe. I just uninstalled. <laughs> and you just have to make that like. Oh, oh you see him. He's on that bus stop. Oh, get him. Nate kill Fucking incoming. Kobe. Yo, he survived. Oh. No, he's dead. He got him. Oh, he's still oh. alive. No, he's alive, oh, bro. Oh, he's so got funny. another one. He's got another one. Nade kill. Here we go. Here we go. Get him, dude. No, bro. He just oh, shoot him. Yeah, he still got him, though. Oh, yes. Uh, oh, look at that. Sna he got a little bro. s'more action. <laughs> yeah, no, Google was. He just killed a level one. He he. He heard. Hold on, I heard the bush. This. I knew there's only one thing to go loot over there. I could be <laughs> wrong. But I'm pretty sure there's only one thing to loot over there. So good. <laughs> Trap. What is this? <laughs> His ice cream sandwich, dude. He stopped bar? mid. <laughs> Peanut butter bar is what he said. <laughs> this, this man That's just stopped good, mid sentence. That's a good snack, dude. Mid walking down the stairs, everything. He said, "Oh shit." He said, mm. <laughs> "Hey man." Man said, mmm. <laughs> He's so fucking enamored by this peanut butter bar chat. <laughs> I've heard that song a million times now since he started listening. Hell to yeah. <laughs> oh, that is right, fantastic going. chat. Maybe he almost got that nade kill. The second one just didn't go far he enough because he's got the Timmy arms. Yeah, yeah Giggle Watts. Oh, he sat and he heard a Timmy around the corner that didn't hear him. And he sat there waiting for him, and he ran around the corner, stood no chance, had no idea what he was there. Oh. Already ads at head <laughs> level and just yeah. fucking folded him. He's got the axe. He's level 10. <laughs> or at least that guy's not at level 1, dude. Yeah, no, he boy. killed a level 1, though. And he killed a player. Mm. 
enthusiastic. It's like, wait, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> Noise. His wife handed him something to eat, and he just started eating it. All right, no questions asked. That's how you know that if if his wife was not happy, Trap would not be here. <laughs> she always looks so sad when she gets carried away into his room. <laughs> Yo, I don't know how Full fucked up trust. this makes me. Yeah, but right, I just right there is how husbands died in the <laughs> 1800s. Right, that that. Bold, yeah, here, like, eat this. Unwavering <laughs> trust. Oh, you're feeding me. Cool. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> this woman just hands you food. Oh, you oh, what's up, buddy? Yeah, I had to diet for a oh subathon when we raised money for TwitchCon, if you remember. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Rogel, how's the baby? I'm laughing. How are you, brother? It's good to see you, buddy. Oh, my God. I thought for sure that died. that guy died to a nade. It's so bummed he didn't get the nade kill there. Yeah, I'm a, bu uh, a bit bummed. People have been camping. I thought I right? shouted and got the Kobe. He, dude, he's, he's being mean, dude. Oh, the man bully. Yeah. <laughs> he's being mean on ground zero. Yeah. With these How kids, cool would dude. that have been? He's like, oh, you're level 10? You deserve it. <laughs> I am a recruiter. I think he's I got some growing pains. Yeah, poor guy. I've been a recruiter for years now. Poor little yeah. guy's probably got teeth. All his bones are growing. Yeah. Big Sedge. All these, all these bones doing what bones do. Yeah, we got an extra M8 M4 out of that. Huge. I believe it, Robo. Where are we going now? What did I say? Shoot. I absolutely believe that. Yeah, we just you just baby on this side of Mason Dixon. I believe it. Yeah, he, he fucking Back gave a little heroin. eagle giggle. He's like, ha, <laughs> got him. <laughs> <laughs> uh. What a time oh, to be was, alive. That was a good one. Great raid, that buddy. was a great raid, yeah. I, I I'm bummed you really didn't get that guy that. with the grenade, dude. That was so close. Dude, I thought that I'm I thought the first one got him. Blew up next to him. Yeah, I did too. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I it, shouted Kobe on that one. It I must have been on the other side of that little like that little divider, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Or like a trash bag saved you. Yeah. Right, I was just about stupid. to say that he got saved by some lucky collision, right? Yeah. A light post, one of the right. like the fence iron rots or whatever it is. Yeah. Yeah, homie got it's lucky like, for uh, sure. The farm to go to Zarachi. You thinking about trying to get Zarachi? No, 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 no. I'm saying that's like the farm to go to to get. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Pixel peeking his ass. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just or doing like, the you know, wiggle. You guys have seen the the not the wiggle the uh the mines on the road, right? Yeah. It's like that. That's what I was. Okay, I'm not quite sure. I do know. So on the, along the road to get to the lighthouse, how it's littered with all the mines. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah dude, we're doing good. Good health. We're having a great time, man. This is we're something. Great, Rogel. So Rogel, right now, what we're doing, it's the loot sack. It's a challenge, like a thing that we've been wanting to do for a little over a year now. Kind of a brainchild that we've had. We've been blocked, stalled, ADHD. It got put on the back burner, but we're finally doing it. Today's day one. Uh, everybody seems to be really enjoying it. I, I'm enjoying myself. I'm having a great time. We're having a great time. We're getting to hang out with Trap and chat with him and watch how he plays and watch him bully people oh, on a standard no. account. Hold on. Almost didn't turn the wine bottle. Oh, the quest. Oh, shit, yeah, dude. Go get your quest progress. Yeah, so we're just vibing, dude. Everybody's having a good time. I'm... A I'm glad that people are enjoying it. I can't wait to see what kind of feedback people have for us over the My next week. My personal goal for this like challenge was to different. hit, ten, like, break 10 or get Ooh, 10. Ooh, you're close. Yeah, you're very close. And that, I was I was thinking that. I was Mario, thinking, thank I you for the love, buddy. The top end of this benchmark is going to be around, you know, 10, 12, right? You know, maybe 15 if somebody is really... No 15 in three hours, is yeah. that's tough. That's tough as fuck. Well, yeah, X, that's what I mean by The that. XP jump. Like between levels one to ten versus ten to fifteen is pretty significant. That is true, actually. I oh, forgot about that. Pocket watch. Ooh, the pocket watch. To customs. But that's gonna be really fun to watch to see like what really is possible. Like the top end. In, in, it's yeah, a three in hour hours. challenge, yeah, Hemario. Right, because you know somebody is gonna get the RNG luck, right? To have oh yeah, get like Caban or yeah, something. Yeah, and have great raids yeah. for all three hours. Yeah, right? dude sends it to streets, think, what, gets Caban. We have like 30, 45 minutes left. Uh, you got minutes. thirty-two minutes left. 
chilling. Yeah, hi, Mayor. So the the idea is, is we set trap loose on a fresh standard account yep. uh, for three hours and just let him play however he wants to play. Um, and at the end, we're going to take a look at his stats uh, and, you know, keep track of them on a leaderboard. And then next week, when Ralatar does the same exact thing, we'll what do a three deaths, fun two, comparison. Three? Deaths? Uh, deaths three? I think you've had three. 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 Yeah. yeah. That Is customs one that you died on, that was a yeah. huge raid, yeah. That would have been a lot of XP. At a min-max in three hours? I think it's 17. I feel like you'd have to get really, really lucky. Yeah. That's what I... Min and then it's min-max yeah. on quests. Yeah, yeah. min-maxing on quests. Perfect. No deaths. Like, yeah. getting good scav amounts and, like, farming a lot of XP. Like I, I think that, that we're going to see top ends of, like, 12, 13. I think is what we're going to see. Mm -hmm. It will be interesting to see if anybody does make... All the way up to 15. Yeah, yeah, it'd be wild. That'd be crazy. Yeah, getting flea access on this challenge would be nuts. Yeah. You going to bed? Good night, Haas. Good night. Good night. Look at Deadpool. There you go. Flipping this off. Love it. Appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> One more. One more. Just, just for possibly. Good night, Hans. Three hours after 17, you can get a level and a half every hour. Challenge is going great, Veronica. Trap's doing well. He's only had a couple deaths. Um, we're chilling. We're having a good time. Uh, great. It's going great, Veronica. We're getting a good idea of kind of like what's yeah. what's doable and like where the pitfalls might be. And is if you only do quests, zero killing. Yeah, yeah. you're just going well, to just sprint. Tasks require you to, to kill, but yeah. Yeah, I kill the scabs and stuff early on. Like yeah. none of the early tasks require player kills. Uh, Fresh from the West, you get pretty early. True. I think that's after the gas sands, though, isn't it? Mm, yeah, but it's possible for you to get gas sands. It's true. 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 Veronica, how's your night going, huh? Yeah, how goes it, everybody? I hope everybody's having a great Thursday night. It is getting late into the early morning, evening, for those of you that are on the West Coast. I hope you're having a great night. Um, I am. I'm having a good time. Noise. All right, buddy, good luck on this one. Playing around with his HUD thing. Yeah. <laughs> He's doing it live, chat. Very familiar with that. You guys spawned at old gas. Oh, Not yeah. a strong spawn for what he's looking to do. Um, what is he looking to do? I'm sorry. I missed he's that. working on pocket watch, so he needs right. to get into dorms. Yeah, he does need to get into okay, yeah, He needs to get into three story to get the key. I appreciate it. So that's. Oh, you, man. That is Trap's goal at the moment. My spoiled ass oh, just realized that, oh, like, you actually have to go to find those keys like, <laughs> yeah. at the, the beginning of the wipe? Wow, yeah. dude. Chilling, that's what chilling. imagine. Uh, imagine someone imagine, just doing it for dude. you. <laughs> <laughs> imagine actually having to go find those keys instead of just, you know, being thrown into thing. someone's pocket and brought so along. Much. Right. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to control the volume on it still. I don't know. the I, that can be hit just really out of the way versus pressing just a few day one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I just, uh... Uh, because the key is, I try to get that one early. Right at 50 oh, cents sit right, on a so bunch of them. Died four times. That makes sense. It's pretty bad. Yeah, dude, he just pulls red guard. That'd be fucking Less hilarious. <laughs> that is something that we could do jack up, though. Guards pulled, if somebody pulls a card. Or, like, maybe we just keep track of, like, rarest Rares, yeah, just the high, rare high-value items pulled. So Traps found one lead X, right? Yeah. Like, that was Set a dope enjoyer. thing. Yay. All right. Oh, well, thank you Fighting so indoors. much. Coolest, most entertaining idea you've seen on stream in a while. Really, Rogel? I that's gonna make thank me you, cry. Buddy. I actually sorry. Give me a second. Let me compose myself. <laughs> like, thank you. So we were like, you know how like you've been thinking about wanting to do something for a long time, and it starts to get to the point where you're ready to do it, most and you're like that little good. voice in the back of your head's like, "This is stupid. Like, why are you even spending all this time and effort? Like, right. no one's gonna yeah. like I mean, this, right? Like, it's account. been done before. But, you know, you know I mean? there's yeah. so many different Crazy. things. I mean, there's, about, like, there's the so many different to. Tarkov but also, that put think on about this on my main account too. Is I've had to content, go to like I've had to spend a lot of time in the labs and lighthouse and highly entertaining. Great production value. Yeah, it's like you look at that and you look at what we have to offer, and it's like, man, why would we even bother? All right, chat's running. He's running into a fight here. There are players in dorms. All right, all right, all right. We're locked in. Hell yeah. You'll notice he uses his left hand peak a lot, and he told us earlier why he does wipe? that. Yeah. It takes up less screen space. 
Except no, when you ADS. Jump, you stupid bitch. See there, right there. Trap wanted to vault, but his guy jumped. Yep. That spot that he was just at is my least favorite. Is that spot Rashushu? Forms. That's a player. One of those might have been a guard. God damn, that was loud. Anyone else seen GPUs spawn a lot more this wipe? Yeah, I've gotten crazy GPUs. Uh, yeah, I mean, even Tons I've noticed that one. Mm -hmm. Lots more. Oh, please don't shoot me. Oh, he's got somebody. What is he? What is he doing? Oh, what? Are you, what? Bruh, somebody Dude, changed fire stairs, modes and everything as he ran by. And over three for quests, sold like ten. Yeah. Oh, was me. No, they're everywhere. This wife dude's no, crazy. Doing on my stairs. Oh, there's definitely somebody underneath him. What you doing on my stairs? Fuck, I throw my nades. <laughs> He's out of nades. Rip. That's the other thing. Yeah, nades early wipe. Tough. Is there a window I can hop out of real quick? I'm glad you guys are, are enjoying this stuff, you guys. Seriously. Hi. Yeah. Um, <gasps> it makes me Oh, that's such a <gasps> sweet climb out. What? You can do that and not die? And he, well, not, not die, but he landed on the trash, dude. And he didn't break his legs just then. He's like, I didn't want to do it. The guy trying to jump in the corner of one. Yeah, go get him, Trap. Go get him. Nice work, bitch. Yo. You know he's there. Nice work. He's going to get him through the window right here. Yo. <laughs> oh, get the sweaty hands off. Get the sweaty hands off. Yo, is Trap going to get him here? These windows, man, are so ass. Yo, if he drops a three-man right here, I'm going to be so impressed. Oh, they're throwing nades at him? They got cheating. Was that a hip? Why did he shoot the wall where I'm at? He shot it, yeah. yeah How does that guy know Trap's there? Huh. Scared me. <laughs> Trap ain't playing with it, dude. Yeah, he's like, I'm not <laughs> fucking around with you, dude. Oh, Lord, he running. I kind of agree with that that choice there. Oh, smoked that guy. God Woo! damn. Saint, thank you for the raid, dude. Yeah, I would disengage from whoever's in Everton dorms because they put shots the right on the wall from where he was. Right, basically on his head. Yeah. Right? Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. For the suddenness. <laughs> Glad you guys welcome in. Oh, poor guy. Level 41, never mind. Hell yeah, dude. He fucking just dropped <laughs> that face. guy, dude. <laughs> his face. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Yes. That's got to be a good Karasa, right? That karasa has got to have decent plates in it, I feel like. Why? It's got to. The face he makes looks oh, like he shit. just like stepped on a leg. Oh, no, right, right, man doing shooter board. You got APMs. <laughs> That's huge. <laughs> and grenades, bro. Uh-oh. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot uh -oh. me, bro. Uh-oh. Only one MAGA. Time to pull out the sc yeah, the scopey scope. Hell yeah. Oh fuck. He's got two. Oh fuck. <laughs> oh my god. They're everywhere. Chat, they're everywhere. Jesus Christ. Fuck off me, bitch. <laughs> 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 oh my Fuck word, dude. <laughs> Hell yeah. I don't have time for this, good sir. I need to leave this place and get into another raid quickly. <laughs> run, buddy, run. <laughs> oh, don't want to talk to you, bitch. I can't see you. Don't <laughs> let the challenge in like this. Don't let the challenge in. <laughs> Is that him? Uh, I don't see shit there, dude. <laughs> <coughs> oh, we oh, got him, dude. For your loot. No shot. Clap that man through the Shit. bushes. Woo! Yo, is my no, eyesight bad, bad or something? Because damn. Oh, you gotta remember, got the remember the remember the twitch encoding. I've shown uh, you that. Where? Oh, that's right. right. Like, we have seen that. that. The some of the shadows and the pixels will like blend together. Yeah. Three hours.
That right there is proof that the setup is the worst quest in the game. Don't mind me or my gun, good sir. Oh, Lord, there's people behind him. Who the fuck? Dude, this, this ma map is popping right now. Uh, customs has been ridiculous. All wipe hey, There's people everywhere. Sniper scab just took a shot. Mechanic or dildo? Si silence shot behind him. Oh, there's... Oh, oh that sniper scab shooting at him. <laughs> <laughs> said, nope. And there's scabs out there in the middle of the road by ice cream. Oh, and then that someone... sniper scab. Yo, Raiders, welcome in. Sorry, it's a little hectic right now. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I hope the stream was good, Saint. Or do I gotta start calling you dad casual? I have a thing about calling other people dad, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Not having one and all kind of like... Oh, damn. Trap got real with it for a second. Right. It was... It was, it was funny. Funny. And, and then it was real. It, <laughs> it was, was really real. Got, it got really real. I think if we get out of here quickly, we would have time for another. I don't know what the... Hey. <laughs> oh, hell no. Oh, I love this. Yeet! There's a suppressed... He said, nah. Shot there's a boy that way. suppressed shotgun over there, and then there's a ton of scavs in here with him, too. Yeah, he's got a player in scavs. Oh, that's not a person. Fuck me. <laughs> trying to get out at Ruaf here. Woo! -hoo! Dude, that's always the scariest when you pop around a corner and the scab's already ADS. He's already looking right at you. You're, You're like, like, oh, fuck. God. <laughs> I don't oh, want to. I don't want to. Don't want Beach. Yeah. That's what I always call it. Oh, my God. There's an old call clip Dan out there, bitch. Veronica, of me with a fucking eye patch on pretending to be a scab. <laughs> going, oh, my wonton. <laughs> oh, my wonton. <laughs> and all kinds of other weird shit. Good raid. Good raid. <laughs> I agree. Oh, yeah, dude. In. Yeah, you, that, uh, that guy at dorms was weird, up. huh? The head, yeah, the shot at the wall. Yeah, yeah that was yeah, weird. That was suspicious as hell. I would have, I would have dipped out too. We thought you were done. We didn't know if you were gonna make it out of that one alive, you know? Yeah. I was hoping to have like a a Usec guest kill. You know what I mean? Like, oh, we don't know where you killed him. At. You didn't get right. the tag. Because like, I thought I saw one of them go left or right as I was leaving. That's why I fired into the window again. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and through the door. Yeah, right. I thought you popped him as you went too. To be honest with you, I thought you got a little head tap there, but it'd have been a nice one for sure. Yeah. Uh, as for your question earlier, you're saying you're not really sure kind of what the cutoff is. We haven't really like fully decided what that is. Like the the stuff that like BSG does, sometimes they'll say like you know you just have to queue for that last raid, and then people milk that last one super super hard. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think kind of my my goal for it would be like when we hit that threshold, like you kind of start making your way to extract. Like the goal is yeah. to kind of get out, you know. Yeah. It's a little ephemeral, and yeah, people can still probably milk it, but um, the goal is to try to keep it to three hours. I, I agree with that, right? If you're in raid when the, the timer hits zero, I then just think it's, it's, it's time to head to extra. It can be kind of luck based on whether or not you can make that work with like the matching cues and stuff. And like, yeah. we saw it happen in the streamer challenge where like some people manage to get in, they get an extra hour of play time. Oh, yeah, it was right? massive. Yeah. Because yeah. if you know you, you queue streets like that right on the last minute, you got a 50 minute raid, you can really sit for a long time. Yeah, I don't know, especially with that challenge, it was just who can kill the most scabs. So, right. so that extra hour was massive. Was and I think huge. with this, is the goal is like it's three hours. Like, what can you do yeah. in that time? Yeah, which especially because of. The one competitive piece that we do have of this is how far can you get in that time. We want to yeah. be very strict on that time. Strict-ish. Strict-ish. Yeah. All right. I think I'm going to go to Lighthouse for the last one. I like it. Yeah, you got the, case the scenario, BPO. You know what I mean? There you go. Oh, yeah. A little fast way home, you know? Yeah, do you want to say that you've got 10 minutes to get out of raid if you're in raid when the timer hits zero? Yeah, whatever you want like to do. That, like official? Yeah, yeah just like an, an official rule, right? Yeah, just to kind of throw something out there. I think 10 minutes oh, is enough time. Yeah, cool. Yeah. I'm right. Ready. Like if you're across map from your extract, I think that's the max amount of time. Yeah. I'm fine with that. Yeah. And then, yeah, and then if you just, if you're, you end and it's right around the stop time, you know, like maybe we, you need like, because if someone queues in that like last minute, then they just get a 10 minute raid or. Uh, I would say like five minutes to the t the cutoff or something. Yeah, I would say if you're within five minutes of the cutoff, you can't queue for a new one either. Yeah. Just to kind of like. We're figuring shit out on the fly, chat. You mean I could do a factory run? You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, you get <laughs> yeah, to run yeah. a factory real quick. Yeah, yeah, a little, a little quick factory to like finish it off. I think. Yeah, I'd just say ten minutes past the cutoff time. That's it. Like we're stopping. We're not tracking anything after that, right? And get out. And, okay. Yeah. And then do that. You, get out of that raid. Yeah. And right. If if you don't make it out in time, that raid count. Yeah. 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 And then yeah, so if if you get out, you got five minutes left, and you got the kit on, just run into factory and send it, right? Yeah. Now like two things to DM me about. Hell yeah, Veronica. <laughs> get all up in them DMs, dude. Slide in there. We got that Pocky watch, dude. Oh yeah, he almost queued in and forgot that one. You guys can DM me as well. Um I just I typically send people to Zane because he has the Here schedule me. on his computer. Um, but if you have any oh. questions, concerns, oh yeah, you're welcome to talk get to. Involved. You can open up a group chat with both yep. of us. You can reach out to me as well. You can just chat with us in the in the Discord. All right, chat. We basically, 25 minutes left in this challenge, uh, with the on the fly decision to cut off 10 minutes post the end end time. Yeah. So, uh, so clarify for me. Did we decide we want to not let people in five minutes before the end? I or? don't think that's worth trying to keep track. I think yeah. if you can get the queue in before that last minute, sure. And mm -hmm. then 10 minutes after that time cutoff is just what it is. You're not getting a full 50-minute streets raid. You might be able to run in, grab a thing, and get out, right? So you can yeah. maybe get that last task that done. That last factory raid in, basically. Right, or whatever. Or one more survive for a daily or something like that, right? But cool. like. That we're not opening it up, so that, like I just uh, I didn't like that about the streamer challenge. I didn't like it either. How people were timing, like you had to time your raid so that you got out with like three four minutes left, so that you could queue up a fresh one and then milk that one for fifty minutes. Yeah. And then if you get sniped off spawn, you just lost an hour of play that you can't get back because the, the the timer's done, but other people are still playing. Yeah, right? but uh, yeah, I I totally agree with that. Cool. Deet, what's up, buddy? Oh yeah, dude, Deet. slide in the in DMs. There. Get up get in, in them DMs. I did just give you permission to slide into his DMs. One hundo P, dude. One hundo P. I know we've said it a lot tonight, but thank you guys all so much for coming in and showing your support. Uh, it is very much appreciated. We were really nervous about how this was going to go, and I think it is exceeding expectations. Blast. Go ahead. Blame blast. Uh, clip marker at the end of each raid. So I can go back in the highlighter, get the stats. Good stuff. Yeah. Go. You need to rem remind me, and I need to get the muscle memory around doing that as I get out of their raid. Hit the clip marker. Hit the clip marker. Hit the clip. Yep. That, I think yeah. that's perfect. And then I'll be able to find it real fast. The highlighter. Well, Brain blast. Now we're just thinking about like ways to make this shit easier. You know. Easier. The, fuck. The tracking, yeah. like track, not like for you, for me. To the Tarkov right. ways to make everything exponentially harder. Harder. Yeah. No, uh, we're just thinking about ways that like so that, like. To go back through the VOD, I think if, if I drop a stream marker at the end of each of your raids, right, that'll give me, like, marks to just go back to so I can track all the stats without having to comb through. True, too. Been grinding Skull and Bones the past couple of days. It's been fun. Definitely not enough content for a full game, but it'll be nice to play here and there. Well, that's tough, too. You see, when you're used to playing Tarkov, right? Like, that's the hard part. It's like Tarkov stacking up versus everything else. Is <laughs> uh I didn't want to do that yet. Can I mark you? How do I mark you unread? Oh, okay. God. There we go. <laughs> he doesn't know, chat. I do know. I figured it out. He what? does not know that way. You do I, not know that way. Katie's making fun of me. I just, like, I didn't even know what I just said, chat. I just, like, mumbled. All right. Are we, together. are we rogue farming? That's the plan for this last one? Yeah. Take a couple. You know, get some loot. Get out. Hell yeah. Oh, I've been hot, Mike. Hell yeah. I am so sorry. Fire Maneuver, welcome in, buddy. Thank you so much for the raid. Sorry, we have all the raid stuff turned off right now Thank for so the much. challenge. Solid Snakes, good to see you again, Bring buddy. everybody in here. I appreciate welcome in, that. Welcome in. You guys, we are on the tail end of our first Loot Sack challenge. So, uh, Trap is wrapping up <laughs> his three-hour <laughs> challenge right now. Sorry, my brain just like completely blanked mid-sentence. Sometimes it happens. Uh, this will most likely be his last raid as we're coming up on uh, the end of his timer now. Mm -hmm. um, once he's done with that, we'll do Good luck, buddy. Twenty minute uh, wrap up interview with him to see how well he liked chat the about the challenge and yeah, yeah. you know, yeah, chat about watch. what's watch next watch. for are you him, Tarkov? right? You know, or are you playing Power charity World? streams, oh, shit, projects, yeah. things like that. Um, yeah, Just we'll chat about much. that here in a little bit. Ralitar's next scenario. Actually, redo me if you were getting. No, we've got all that stuff turned off. Ralatar next Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern, you guys. Yes. So the idea is we're going to do this every Thursday. And then week after 2BD. We're still figuring that out. Yep. Thursday before Loot Fest, we might not be able to do. Oh, on Tiny Tina's Wonderland? I haven't played it. We might be able to make it work, but it might be tough. We'll have to figure it out. We'll talk about that, and we'll let you guys know. 
Yeah. We do have Loot Fest coming up. Uh, also, chat, just want to call it out again. This Saturday, 12 o'clock Eastern, um, so noon. I didn't either. I'll be competing in the Evasion Solos I don't event. I get that on my main account. Going to bed. Good night, Fire. Good night, Fire Maneuver. Thank you again so much for that raid. Thank you for the raid. Community over here. I appreciate you. Rally Daddy's channel for viewer kits. Hey, if uh, he wants to take, I don't think we'll be able to do viewer nah, kits for the okay. challenge because it takes away from the confused. like. We have to add that. No viewer kits. Yeah, we are. Yeah, See, I, I appreciate never, you so never, so much. But I had uh, not one we thought okay. about. It's not what we thought we about. We thought about turning it off on our stream, but not having the no, competitor we'll agree to, to turn it off on theirs. Yeah, we'll have to put that in the have form the that they it. agree to turn yeah, it off. Yeah, we can't have you give them a juice up, up, like M4 or something. God yeah. damn. They can run BitBot if they want. Yeah. <laughs> get held against my fucking will We're for you at home. Dude, is Trap going to get clapped by the... Dude, get off the gun and shit on me and be mad as fuck. <laughs> I like him, Mario. I appreciate that that comment, Shadow. It was it was definitely a he uh, trolling comment, but it was a on point one as well. Hey, there some are ammo. some rules. No outside help. Or was he shooting at me? Uh, see, that's what I do for a living. But <laughs> you wait for a tech startup. Yep, yeah. that's Katie too. Her brain's yeah. the same way. I'm a senior quality engineer. It was <laughs> you were here earlier when Zane was asking me like how he should word something, and I was like, no, you should say participants because if you say it that way, they're gonna think that you're gonna compare their profiles to just like random streamers. And he was like, what? Why? <laughs> <laughs> Thirty more minutes to your birthday, Lycan. Yo, that's so exciting. That man's dead as fuck. <laughs> it's all on you. <laughs> I appreciate that, Shadow. We did get rid of the no rules comment. We did. No, it, it was right. <laughs> it, it needed changing. It needed changing. It, it did Shadow's that point. Peak. That, oh my god, dude. Sorry, I've missed some of the fantastic fucking peaks that he's been making into this road camp. That is a way to get in there, huh? Yeah, he's playing bear and just kind of fucking forehead pushed his way all the way up it into is, this camp. It is nighttime. But still. I don't know where this he went, bro. Long. This motherfucker went out there, did he? I gotta get better at throwing nades in this game. It's gonna unlock so much. Dude, that, that rogue was doing some weird-ass fucking shit with his arms. I, he was doing some weird-ass shit with his AI altogether. Homie just stopped so in his tracks funny. in the middle of the that, road that, when he got shot. That, that was it. Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. Damn. Bro. Was that a rogue? What was that? That sucked. That was a rogue. That so oh, I breach. armpitted What's him. Up, dude? Brother. That's funny. Oh, that's oh, rough. Okay. He actually does have enough time to get well, we another two rogues. That one was a regular scav. You got time for another one, though, buddy? Damn. Yo, it just went through the chest. It didn't, like... Yeah. Yeah, I think you got like shrapneled it... into the armpit is what happened. It either fragmented or you did the, the multi-hit bug. Oh, the multi-hit bug would do it, yeah, if you got hit more than once. Yeah, with level 4 armor on with PS ammo. Yeah. Yeah. That's the other thing, too, is, like, you know, you return, like like quarter to him and so then you get the weird hitbox overlapping yeah like did it actually hit the armor or did it just go right into your side and that's right? what i mean when it says chest like that sometimes it, you got the overlap bug where it actually went into your armpit but it says chest right and so, yeah the hitboxes have like weird over like at angles it, yeah they, like do funky stuff yeah right seat you don't even know what the rogue sight distance is anymore. Uh, really, really far, unless it's my time. And then that guy was just in the middle of the street and already aggroed on him. Okay. Now you've Trap's got this SVDS, though, so. Eh. I that SVDS. I run that for the last one. Be thicky icky. Yeah, I'll die but... immediately. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's where you're coming up, you know, on the on the last raid, most likely, here. How, how are you feeling? Oh, good. It's fun. Fun first attempt. I didn't do like any kind of practice runs or anything of the nature, so I wasn't. There was no, not really any real opportunity. It's like war game anything. I just I wanted to go in this like oh, okay, fresh wipe. See how we do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, I think that's kind, kind of, of the, the goal. Yeah, that's kind of the uh, the goal. There's really not much I think that you could yeah. do to prepare for this. I think I think you just you target 
the things that you're comfortable targeting, right? To play off your play style and yeah, and see where it gets you in in a little bit of time, right? Yeah, no, I've I've had a lot of fun watching the rotations that you use, right? They're very different than mine. You've gone to a, like numerous places now that I didn't even know that you could get to or stand on, right? I didn't realize there was actually uh, meshing, or you know, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Collision. Thank you. I was trying to say contact, and my brain kept going, "Nope, that's not the right word." Good night, here, Mario. Uh, yeah, I, Thank d- you, I buddy. didn't really know that there was collision meshing, especially <laughs> on yeah, uh, woods, right, right? Like well, on the the netting that you were standing on. I didn't know you could do that. Oh yeah, over at USEC. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I thought you would fall right through that netting. So uh, sneaky lots little spot. Of really cool things that you've shown me so far. Mm-hmm. Good. Yo, Azarek, thank you so much for that follow. Sorry we missed it. Oh, we missed the follow. I'm so sorry about that. Um, you got six minutes to get in, and with the ten, so you got about sixteen minutes. I with that kind of like ten minute buffer timer. So this is definitely last raid. I can't see it. I'm blind. I'm so sorry we missed that follow. Thank you for coming in. I appreciate that. I hope everyone is if having it, a great night. Go if ahead. any of you are in here and you're not following the channel, please drop that follow. You get notification when we go live for episode two of the Loot Sack, which will be next Thursday. You can also join our Discord. Uh, it's a great way to get updates on all the various things we're doing, charity initiatives we got coming up, uh, any cons that we're planning to go to or any trips we're planning on taking. Um, a lot of that all gets posted in there. So, And we'll talk a Thank little you, bit Dusa. about what we've got upcoming as well towards the end of the show. Um, as we talk to Trap about what he has upcoming as well, it'll just kind of be you know what we talk about going forward, what's next for us, what's next for Trap. Yeah, I think we'll kind of outro with him, talk about his stats, sign off. We'll kind of do our own little outro with chat, and then we'll probably raid out to trap as long as he's staying online. I think is the plan. Yeah, I think that's the plan as well. And I do believe he's staying on. We talked yeah. about hopping on his. Want to do his lightkeeper stuff? Yeah. Yep. The weird bugs you've seen me find, or where you're hitting all the mesh problems of video games, which you can generate any number of bugs from doing stuff at those locations. Yeah. Yeah. Hitting places where a lot of stuff overlaps, you know, or or where like multiple layers of things exist, so there might be gaps, right? Yep. Um, always, always good places to target. Yep. Whoa, that's a weird. Uh... It's like a face mask. Yeah. Gas mask. It's that HUD FX thing that he was talking about. That's that, super cool. There's like all sorts of like overlay green screen effects and stuff. Yeah, that's it's actually, really cool. It's something that we can do just with Streamerbot. I just need the green screen video, and I can do it with Streamerbot. Yeah, this is, that's some fun stuff that we could incorporate into the show. I think. Oh, it's flash banged him. I guess one thing that that thing does that StreamerBot doesn't do is StreamerBot only plays it to stream, whereas that's doing it to his screen as well. So he is seeing that on his monitor. Oh, that is really cool. Yeah, so like the flashbang is actually like flashing him. It's flashing him, so he's like, oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's raiding in. Here we go, chat. Here we go. Good luck, buddy. Ready, Ready, dude. I'm ready. Last raid. Last raid. Spend like some good quality time with my kids and shit. Ooh, here he is. Good luck, buddy. Tagila's here. Tagil is here on his. Ooh, dude, huge! Can he get? Can he get the Tagiler? Yeah, chat. I think that would be a fantastic way to end this end night, night for him. Oh like, yeah, Tagila to get a kill. Tagila kill right now. That'd be huge. That'd be cloud nine. He's got players sneaking underneath him right now. Oh, he's about to drop on this dude. You guys not feeling good. Ooh, right in the back. <laughs> Poor guy didn't even know he was there. Never stood a chance, bro. Oh, that's cool, Shadow. You can have oh, God, I'm bottles throw uh, stuff at you for point redeems. Oof. Ooh. VTuber mod point redeem throws stuff. I think it'd be cool to like get a VTuber made for us that we could transition to sometimes, right? That would be fun. I I wouldn't mind that. Get one. They're expensive, but to get one like a a basic one commissioned and rigged would be a lot of fun. Yeah. Forkless. I mean, it makes sense that they're expensive. Trap is on the hunt. Basically, he's looking to kill everything that moves on this map right now for as much XP as possible. Oh yeah. Oh, he got stuck. And he's got the Tim Tam legs, dude. What it do, big boy? <laughs> Just gaming, brother. What are you doing? Uh, you know, gonna die. Wow. Ooh! That was dirty. You'll be fine. Went, opened the door, circled back to the other one. 
Oh, yep. No, you're not winning that one that way, buddy. Ooh. <laughs> Infect was not fine, Jet. Ooh. Well played from Trap right there. Seriously. That's another thing I never oh, thought to no, do, to open the door up like that. Up. Bait multiple. Em. Yeah. yeah, multiple doors and then circle back. Or I to that guy. Fuck him. <laughs> Neil Helmet. She said, fuck him. <laughs> what you got for me, big boy? <laughs> Lovely commentary. Oh, Fucking Come love on, it. bro. <laughs> Get this shit together. Call me Rafi. GG's, buddy. Poor guy running a shotgun, still lost. Alright. Oh, yes, All the time. Oh, it's taking a look! No! <laughs> Oh, come on, get him. Come on, Trap Daddy. Heal, pussy. Hold him the fuck off. Oh, no, oh! Oh, no, no, no! <laughs> fuck, man. Damn, oh. dude. Damn, GG's, dude. dude. Waits till Damn, ammo. Was... bro. Bastard. Dude. Right, that was such a good try. Uh, Better bad. ammo Damn. than that. Yeah, dude. Tequila crazy lately. Oh, GG's, right. dude. GG's. Yeah, is there anything want to see on the account before yeah do you mind switching There's... on just like pulling up the overall yeah. stats man and we'll just kind of chat go chat and look through them yeah man three hours later what do you think yeah how you feeling first impressions chill 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 i think so here's what i think right three hours is is tough because anybody, any like, what if I just I'm connecting to shit servers, or I'm having I'm getting Tarkov over and over again because I got a mm -hmm. standard account early start, dude. Getting Tarkov twice in a row, three times in a row sets you back. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It will for sure. All right, let's see. Three million stash value, three point four. Hell yeah! Pretty nice. Yeah. Letty Letty came in. Came in big there for the stash value for sure. It'll be interesting to see just kind of like what the average is, right? Got Ain't... eleven total raids in and three. That's pretty good. Oh, yeah, eleven raids. You survived five of them. The run through we still count. That was just to get the the task done, right? PMC so killed. thirteen PMC That's kills. That's pretty impressive as well. That's a lot of PMCs for that short of time. Boss has killed two. The yeah, rogues. Yeah, you got a couple oh, of the rogues. rogues. Right, right. What was your longest shot? 179 meters. There you go. Yeah, 180. What was that? 27 on? headshots. I had to. It's got to be the rogue, right? At the um, building one one that you saw. Yeah, that was on lighthouse. That was 149. Oh, okay. Who did you crank at 179? Maybe this is the sniper scav on woods? No, that wasn't 180. I don't know. I don't know what shot that was. I wonder which one it was. Twenty-seven headshots. The Usec versus bears is interesting for me. I feel like it's very split evenly. You had ten Usecs. Yeah. To three bears. That's actually kind of wild. Why, I think this way there's a lot of Usecs. Yeah. Well, see, every time I I get a kill, I'm killing bears left and right. Yeah. The early wipe. Well, uh, everybody I killed tonight that saw these two numbers was like oh, cheating. Reported. <laughs> Eleven hour lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, seriously, everybody who looked at your profile re reported you. 100p. I didn't even think about that, dude. I the stats either, with actually. the view profile. Oh, man. My, my, my. Level 20 was like, that guy was fucking cheating, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Look at his account. Oh, oh man, dude. dude. I didn't think about that either. We might end up dealing with an issue where that account gets banned or something. Nah, I doubt it'll get banned. Um, oh, that's pretty fucking I'll, funny. I'll DM dude. Apple Zor and be like, bro, come, uh, bro, come bro, on. Come <laughs> on Put a PSA out there. It's just the this loot sack challenge account is not cheating. <laughs> How much blood did you lose? That's one of the weird stats. I think it's top right. It is. Yeah, it's top right. Very, very top right. Point two liters. Hey, dude, you not you survived. Yeah, not, it's not a lot of blood loss. When you, you died, you just got smoked. HP, though. True. Yeah, dude, when you got in a fight, you either died or didn't take much damage. Yeah, so. yeah only 136 heal XP. Yeah. Not a lot. I think you're definitely going to be on the top end of stash value unless people get lucky with some good, like, PMC kills. Yeah, like, big loot, yeah, definitely. Right? Uh -huh. I think you're going to be on the top end of some of the PMC kills, too. Yeah, 13 were, PMC kills. You were solid. dropping people left and right. A, lot, a couple double kills. Yeah. 
Yeah, man. This is going to be so fun to see how this turns out, right? It'll be and really exciting to see just not like, that what it looks different like. different survival rate from my main account, but that's because of the quest I'm doing. Yeah, right. well, and, and that sh honestly, that should be pretty much the 51 same. 51 on my player. Well, 51% yeah. on my player, and then 7.6 KD. It was over 8. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, your stat right there, dude. Honestly, what's crazy, your stats are in line. Yeah, that's what I was just equal, looking at. Equal, survived and died, equal with one run through. Yeah. Isn't that weird? Did I have one run, run through? What it, yeah, on, run? on your main account? Yeah. Oh, it that was is... going to factory and killing the boys. That's what it was. Yeah. That is so very interesting. Isn't, that, we isn't that wild? Yeah. That... Three hours versus, what, what like, a month? It's like, averages out all the same. And when you think about it, it should be, right? It's Because yeah, you didn't, like you said, you didn't really change the way you played that much. You just played the way you normally play. Yeah. That's what it really does cool. to show is how many PMC kills I have, right? So I've, I don't even remember. Like it's, I'm not like, yeah, what your actual number is there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I'm, that, that makes sense, is I, I'm like an old, old account, right? And it doesn't count alpha hours, but regardless, there's people with triple my four times. My yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's crazy. Car extract? Oh, I know this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking about last on my account. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. How much you did? She's falling over. Yeah, just getting one tap, bro. So you smoke them, and they smoke me. Yeah. With yeah, yeah. with three hours being tough, would you suggest like longer for four, or do you think that maybe people would no, get fatigued by that? Fairly, I think it's a good Paris, right? Because yeah, you can get your mm -hmm. Tarkov, but like uh, somebody who's a veteran of this game should be able to recover or be able to deal with. It. Put some so, decent raids in over that time yeah. period, for right? sure. Yeah. Because all they gotta do is change the, their pathing or something, you know, like kind of like what I did on Woods. I changed my pathing, killed those two guys over at mm -hmm. Sunken Village. Because mm -hmm. I ran by the ponds in the middle of the fucking map. No one does it unless they're right. trying to avoid people. Yeah, no one does it on, on Woods. You're right. Yeah, and that's one of the things you get to bring with you that we can't take, right? Map knowledge, you know, rotations right. that have worked for you in the past, the guns that you're comfortable using, right? Nope. Like, I think one one thing that would be interesting to, is to bring somebody like if we could like get Berkey to do this, where like she loves to play with like a Mosin, and, like right. that's her favorite gun, and then she goes every map she goes with a Mosin, right? Mm -hmm. It'd be, just be interesting to see the different play styles and like how it how it, it like shakes out at the end. Yeah, that's yeah. I think that's one of the things I'm most excited about to to see in this is just what different things can we learn about how people play Tarkov? Yeah. I, I wanted to ask you in the middle of one of your raids, and I forgot. Uh, what do you think about the snow, this white? Uh, at first, it was pretty rough with how loud it was, but I Ooh, think it yeah. was very interesting to see how they implemented a new feature that wasn't even really talked about. Right, yeah, they just kind of snuck, it to, like, yeah, yeah. snuck us with it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. They were like, oh, hey, here's this surprise. It's like, oh, shit, this is fucking awesome. Never seen anything like this before. That's cool. Da -da -da -da. You know? Yeah. Yeah, 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 it changed like, a lot of things. The way the maps feel and like the flow of them too. Yeah, what I I'm curious to see if any other weather weather patterns will come out of that. Right, we already have rain, we have snow. Right, um, I don't know what else that would I be. Have thunderstorms too. Yeah, we yeah, we've seen them with the Halloween event. It'd be cool to see those kind of come back, like yeah, and be less intense and like over the top because they were for that Halloween event, but be like more realistic. Yeah, and we've seen fog to an extent, right? Um, I'd say I, I don't know how much you guys have been playing this wipe. But like sometimes the fog is like, it's crazy. Oh, yeah. it's it's really it's bad actually. I've, I've and the glare of this wipe too. Like, sometimes yeah. like the sun is just like I can't like I literally shouldn't even play this raid because I spawned on the bad side of the map and I can't fucking see. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I can't look on the other side of the map. I'm screwed. Yep. So as we're wrapping up, I I do want to ask you know if you have any like projects or uh, you know charity works or anything like that that you wanted to talk about that you're working towards right now. Nothing currently. I, I've kind of I've been looking for a charity to support. I've been looking at uh one that one of my buddies supports. Um buddy Twitchy Glitchy. Uh he's an active duty army guy as well. And I was just I don't know. I, I want to do a fundraising where like the money goes towards something, but at the same time, like I don't know. I don't want to You wanna make sure it goes to the right cause. Right. I get that yeah. apprehension. You know, yeah. we've we've struggled in the past working with organizations that um they use very colorful language about like how much of their your support from your community will make it to the end charity, and the reality is, not a lot yeah. of it does, right? Yeah, um, I definitely understand. Here's a step you guys attract to: number of mm. achievements gained in three hours. Ooh, Ooh. 
yeah. That's a good one. I like that. Can you, yeah, make sure you report that down, Zane. Like it. Or don't fucking tell people because then they'll achievement hunt. Yeah. <laughs> like it's going to be one of those ones that will sneak in at the end, right? We'll be like, hey, yeah. I think where I'm at with three is going to be very cool. Those are three easy ones. Right. Yeah, just the welcome to Tarkov. Yeah. You killed somebody, and uh, the plane. I located the plane. It'll okay, be interesting yeah. to see if anybody gets the the seven survives in a row. Could have got call yeah. your brother. Yeah, that would be. There's a there's Is a it challenge. Seven now? Yeah, I think it's seven for that one challenge, right? Ten or... consecutive raids while playing as a PMC, ready for anything. That's what you're talking about. Isn't it? Is it ten or is it seven? I thought yeah, it was it's ten. ten. Is it's it ten? ten? Yeah. Woo! Yeah, yeah, I've got that. Only two percent of people have that. I have that one on my main account. Yeah, so you got that early too. Yeah. Yeah. I usually do. Usually early wipe, I'll get like a like a 12 to 15 survive streak, and then I'll never match it over the rest of the wipe. That makes sense. <laughs> that totally makes sense. I don't have any. This says 1% of players have eliminated Sanitar. <laughs> That's crazy. That's actually really low. Wild. It is really low. Sandy's one of the, used to be one of the, the guards, uh, bosses. But here's something to think about, too, though. Only 29% of players, of, and this is why I think it's accounts ever registered with, through BSG, because only 29% mm. of people have died in Tarkov for the first time. Got, yeah. Uh, you're right. That's got to be registered gotta be players. Got to be just all registered players. Yeah. yeah, not people who have actually activated this wipe. Yeah. That's kind of a bummer. That'd be yeah. a much more interesting number to see. See yeah, how that changes over the course of the life. that until you pointed that out, but you're right. There's absolutely no, keep in no mind, shot. Mining storms would be awesome. Keep in mind, this is something I pointed out to Shane the other day. Uh, there's this stat right here, right above it on this one. Survivor raid without the run-through status for the first time. Right? There's 3% of players that have died in Tarkov but haven't survived yet. Yeah. Yeah, those numbers don't make sense. Yeah. I thought that was a weird one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Crazy. Well, hey, man, La last last thoughts on the challenge? What you think? I like it. It's cool. It's unique, and it's something fresh for the scene. So, I like Hopefully it, man. You guys get a lot more traffic with it, and there's some fucking huge names on here. You know what I mean? I'd love to see I'm, that. I, we're gonna we're gonna try, brother. Yeah, we're gonna that's, try. That's definitely the goal. One of the goals. Yeah. On, on that note, again, if anybody is interested and wants to participate, please reach out to either Zane or myself. Um, you can hop in our chat right now and do Discord, uh, exclamation mark Discord, to get into our Discord. Um, it, I've had an absolute blast doing this today, Trap. Thank you and so Trap, so thanks. much for for being yeah, our guinea pig, yeah, dude. Thanks for, for letting for, us test the shit out on you. you yeah, know what I mean? jumping in with you, you know both feet. Surprised. Yeah, we're gonna be surprised with how good some people are, how good they do. I believe it. I'm I'm excited to just see like the the gauntlet, right? And just see how everybody does. And I'm <clears throat> I think one of the things I'm most interested to see is like a weird rivalry, maybe that we didn't anticipate, right? right. Like bringing, we know that Ral and Sick are gonna are gonna want to compete right. against each other, yeah. but bringing somebody on that's like, oh, you know who I really need to be? Like I really need to beat so and so, and you're and right. we're gonna be like, whoa, what? Like that's all right, hell yeah, yeah like, you know. Flan comes on and she's like, I have to beat Stevo, right? Right, like yeah, yeah. That'd be so cool. Trap buddy, are you staying on? Uh, for a little bit, yeah. I gotta. I'm gonna go try to unlock. Uh, I got a light keeper task. I'm trying to complete. Cool, man. All right, we're gonna wrap up here, and then I'm gonna drop the kids off at your pool. All righty, buddy. Sounds good. Sounds good, dude. Hey, man. Later. Thank you so much for doing this with us, buddy. Thank I really appreciate it. Thank yeah, dude. Have a good one. You too, yeah, man. Too. You should, you're awesome, man. Thank you. Peace. Chat. Chat. That's uh. That's a wrap on that, isn't that crazy? That went well. I'm I'm excited. That went well. Uh, thank you so much, Quirky Chick, for coming in. I appreciate you. Thank you. I hope you get, you're able to come and check out the rest of the events. Um, we're gonna be doing this for the foreseeable future. Um, yeah, that, I think that went well. I think it went better than I anticipated. Trap did great. Um, good sport for just doing something that has like no guidance whatsoever and just sending it and doing what he can, right? And yeah. I think it's going to be really, really interesting to see how this develops week over a week. And as we start bringing some people in and maybe start getting mm -hmm. people that are like hitting us up too, like today, like Veronica Luau hit me up, right? Like, I think that was something that like, I wasn't sure if we were even going to get it all and have that day one, like already people are hitting us up like, Hey, I want to do this. Yeah, right. I, I want in. Um, and that is, that's so humbling to hear you guys. Um, yeah. See, yeah. Mid 90 wolf once in. Rates? Jesus. Dude. Crazy. Oh, you guys. God. 
Um, if you guys have any feedback, I, I really, seriously, anything that you guys have. Anything at all. Positive, negative. It was confusing. This was super, super cool. I would love to see more of this. Please, 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 any information if you have like that, drop it in the general chat and Discord. Just yeah. brain dump it on us. Like, just, just put it out there. Anything, even if you think it sounds stupid or you're like, ah, they probably already thought of that and they didn't think to do it and there's probably a reason don't let that filter you out. Please share any and all feedback that you guys have. We do really, really want to hear it. We want to make this the best thing that it possibly could be. Um, Absolutely. And we do that in part with your guys' support. Uh, so tell us like, if there's anything specific that you guys want to see come out of this. There's a specific scenario that happened tonight that you would love to see us try to like facilitate more of or anything like that. I think Veronica, he was nervous. I think it would be great for you to come on. I, I think that you would have a really good time and you would surprise yourself. I think so, too. I think uh, we saw that with the streamer challenge when BSG put that on. We have some yeah. of our friends like Unicorn. Unicorn doesn't play solo very often previously to that. The streamer challenge really helped her see that actually she can hold her own and she can, you know, go out and, and go do tasks and succeed on them and that she doesn't need to have somebody there with her. She likes to, and I think most people would say that they prefer to run this game with a duo. But at the same time, running a challenge like that, forcing yourself out of your comfort zone, it showed her that actually she does have the skill that she can hold her own and was very validating for her and actually made her more excited to play Tarkov, right? Uh -huh. And and more confident in duos and, and playing with her friends as well because it just instilled a ton of confidence in her. Yeah. So I would love to have you come on here and do this with us, Veronica, and chat and vibe out and have a good time and tackle the game in whatever way um, that you want to and, and, and see kind of like where... What does that look like? And I think that's really kind of the fun thing, too, for the people that participate in it, right, is let me play the game the way that I play and not, like, because you, you can't really get that with the start of a wipe, right? Like, so wipe starts and you go play for three or four hours. I played for 16. Yeah. Wherever we are at the end of day one is it's going to be leaps and bounds different from each other, not skill notwithstanding, just because I put so much more time in day yeah, one than you did. It's really, right? really hard to make that comparison. Right. Ever, and, so, and so this ever, is something that's time account. gated. Yep. Yeah. From, a, from a baseline, everybody has the same stuff that access to. Mm -hmm. You still have to deal with the RNG of Tarkov. Like, yeah, you might run into a five man three raids in a row, right? And th that's just Tarkov. Can't do anything about that. But we can at least try to, the variables that we can control, try to bring them in line with each other so that we can really create something that allows people to see. Like, where do I stack up against these people, right, right? right? And not from a perspective of like, am I am I good enough am or anything I like better, that, or better? No, it like just that. like does no, my play style. Where does it put me, right? Yeah. You know, where, where like on the on the on the line of leveling up in Tarkov, which is the main thing that we're all trying to do, right? Right, right. It's yeah. I mean, I it one of the, the sayings I think of a lot is right. You know, you don't don't judge a fish on how they climb a tree, right? That's kind of the idea right. here, right? Yeah. Is that like there are so many different ways that you can play Tarkov, right? Mm -hmm. That there is no one right way, right? Yeah. Yes, there is. A, you can be better at PvP. You could be better at looter. You could be better at map knowledge, right. right? You can be better at all aspects of the game than one particular person, but that doesn't mean that you're the best at everything, right? There's mm -hmm. going to be somebody out there that's better at PFC kills. There's going to be yeah. somebody out there that is better, better at loot looting knowledge. the map, yeah. right? Uh, you know, it's just there will be someone that has better rotations, right? There will be always something to learn, especially in a game like this, right? Um, and I think even I struggle with that mentality of like, oh, I'm just not good enough to play this game, right? Like, yeah. I, it's a tough I'm not game. good at PvP, or I don't know the maps well enough, right. or I, whatever. Insert thing here, right? Um, and we get really stuck into that mentality. So I think this is a really fun way to show that like, hey... Like, the way that you play Tarkov is valid, too, right? Once you guys have a list, I do all three cams on one side and the list of up-and-comers on the other side. You start to run out of real estate a little bit. I might have to, like, have you draw that out, what you're seeing, so that I can kind of think of, like, how I might make it how fit. How we would do that. Because yeah, it's kind of the idea that we have. If you can sketch that out life. for me, Lucas, and send it to me, dude, I'd be happy to see if it's something that would maybe work better. I just can't really picture it in my head right now. Yeah. And that might be just be because my brain is fried. Oh, I'm so moment. tired right now. Yeah. <laughs> so, so tired. So it can be super nerve-wracking at first. It's the quickest way to get better, especially right now with snow making footsteps so much louder or a night raid solo plays. So the thing is, see, it's, it's like it's not about like the skill level for a lot of people playing solo. It's literally like the emotion, like overstimulation and like the anxiety, yeah, right? And I think for some people it's really, like the anxiety is something that's really, really difficult to just – you can't really just like play through it if it's bad enough. And so one of the things that I think I've seen help a lot of people 
that I saw, I think I saw it suggested maybe like three or four months ago, and I started to see it get suggested more and more frequently, and I really like it. Find somebody, like get your duo or somebody that you play with normally, and have them just sit and chat with you while you run solo raids. It's something that, um, it'll, it gives you that voice, that calming voice, something that you're used to hearing when you do run your duo raids and something that you're used to taking cues from, right? But it, you're still playing on your own and it'll help bridge the gap a little bit between like the group play and the solo play and oh, hopefully, hopefully help make, give you some like resistance and resilience protection against that anxiety from building up over time. Right? Oh, and I, I mean, I can firsthand say that that helps. I mean, when that's we, what we did with you. Yeah. yeah so we, we used to participate in uh, a Tarkov league, um, which was very similar to this. It One of the first challenge things we ever did. Yeah. Tarkov. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's only pixels put it on. That's a throwback. Great, great group of people. Um, great, great uh, league to participate in. Um, but that's, that's how I first started playing solo myself. And I still don't play solo very often, but I am confident in my ability to do so. And a lot yeah. of it is because when we did this, right, Zane was my coach, right? He was sat in my ears and he was watching my feed uh, through discord, not through stream. So he could see what I was seeing when live. I was seeing yeah. it live. Right. And so when I got lost on a map and I started to panic because I had no idea where I was, it was, this is where you are, right? Do you know where, do you know? do you know where you need to go, right? Yeah. And so th that... And then that too, finding like what type of language worked great for you and helped keep you calm and... Right, yeah. right. Because, you know, a lot of people when they're nervous, you can't just start throwing things at them. Yeah, the right? info um, overload. It's, like, it, it'll, that, make, it'll make me shut down. If you well, do that to me, you're going to make me quiet and just like... In Tarkov, usually that's what gets you that state to begin with. Is yeah. there's too much happening, right? That, that's 100%. It's just Trinity! Overwhelming amount. Tago arrived ah, just in time, Trinity. Welcome. It's good to see you. Yeah, so it's... it's uh. It's very helpful to have the right person um, in your ear if mm -hmm. you're playing solo to just kind of help you out, be that coach. True. Right? True. Well, I was about to say, I think we I think should. That's a wrap. Get yeah. Ready to sign off. Thank you all Thank so you very much for coming to hang out for this first episode. Uh, like Zane said, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, feedback. I'm sorry, Trinity. Any kind, Trinity. I'm so sorry. It's We're going to have the VOD uploaded to YouTube in a couple days. Um, so you'll be able to catch the whole run there. Yep. Um, it'll be edited down a little bit too to get rid of some of the dead air. But Trinity, yes. it hugs, hugs. It's so good to see you. Everybody hanging out in the chat, everybody that came through today, thank you all so much for your support. Um, I'm blown away. I, I uh, Absolutely blown away. You can also, tell, Katie, I've been nervous all week uh, about like that we finally set a day and that we were going to do it, and I was I was scared, right? I, I didn't know if you guys were going to like it. Um, uh, I've been terrified. Yeah. Um, this was like I said. This was our little brainchild, um, and I, I I was very very excited about it. So right, excited and scared at the same time, right? To show it to you guys. So thank yeah. you so much for showing up. Thank Thanks you for, for being not pooping here. on my baby. Thank you for not shitting on it. It's great <laughs> of you. I appreciate that. it. Um, yeah, you guys. Thank you so much for your support. And uh, yeah, we will, um, we'll see you. None all. of this, none what? of this stuff happens without you guys. Like it's it's you guys that make it um thank you so much swag make the community what it is so that's gross cat it is <laughs> that's gross. gross swag it's good to see you buddy well, i, I hope you got to see a little bit of it i hope you enjoyed it yo see thanks man you know thank it's you. it's tough like it's it's something that we created and if we get, show it to you guys you don't like it what does that mean so it's just a little nerve-wracking right <laughs> Oh, child services damn dude crazy wow, you gonna wow. do me like that that's crazy you do me like chat. that Chat, next Thursday, where is it? Hold on. Right there. Next Thursday, Ralatar. We're going to get the get the homie, the sweat lord the up sweat in here. The sweat lord up in there. We're going to see what king, dude. the labs king, um, the meatball extraordinaire, the gabagool himself. We're going to have him here ready to <laughs> ready to throw down. Can you say that? Um, I have an Italian friend, so it's okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Chat. Just, just clarify. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. Um, you guys, go give Trap some love. That was who you saw playing with us today. He's an amazing, amazing person. Um, great at Tarkov, great community leader, and just all-around great person. So thank you guys for your support tonight. I hope you have a great rest of your evening. We will see you next time. Um, tomorrow I will be live. Katie potentially with me. I'll be with him. I don't know what we're going to play. Be a normal stream day. So we'll see you tomorrow. All right, everybody, have a great night. Love bye. you guys. Bye, 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 bye,